Hello again. Back for more Community Endurance Run. If you're wondering where my straightened hair and my eyeliner is, I went to sleep last night and I showered. And my makeup and hair, my hair and makeup was undone. It will be redone shortly. But I thought if it had to be redone, it has to be redone on stream. And so uh, my lovely assistant will be back later to re-fuck up my, my hair and, and face. So just in case anyone was wondering about that, that is the root cause. Hopefully, Noah, also Noah told me it seems like the game audio might have been low. It's now been raised. Um, so hopefully you can hear Stranger Paradise and hopefully the audio balance is okay. Uh, let me know if anything's too loud or too quiet. So I'm back. Once again, to raise money for Pencils of Promise, a charity that builds schools, trains teachers, and sends kids to school in developing nations. I am aiming to raise $2,500. I am about at $1,900, so I am within striking distance of the funds necessary. Uh, thanks to your donations, I currently have a fucking chin soul patch. I will have straightened hair. I will have eyeliner. I have this ring. I have this awesome shirt from the Hot Topic. I have this chain choker. In a hundred more dollars, I will have to paint my nails, which might make playing this game difficult for a short period of time. Um, I also have two more donation centers. One to style my hair once it is straightened into whatever you sickos want. And then a second donation incentive to cry live on stream to get my eyeliner to run. Um, and then the main donation incentive I've been doing is every $20 raised, I sing an emo ballad. So I am still honoring those. Any $20 donation will cause me to have to sing an emo song from my list of emo songs that I've learned. So please donate if you can. Any amount counts. It's all good stuff. It's all going to a good cause. Let me take my phone out of my pocket so it doesn't annoy me with vibrations. Did a donation come in? No, not for this. Okay. Let me uh, get back to it. When last Jack Final Fantasy and his crew were running all over the place, I defeated uh, Mer Merilith, the fire uh, fiend. I defeated Lich, the earth fiend. So now I am up to uh, the last fiend, the, the water fiend, Kraken. Ruins of Machina. Dimension 5, yeah! The world that implied this place lies a kingdom that used the power of the crystals to flourish. In my humble opinion, the ability to manipulate crystals was what they should have chosen as a model from Dimension 5. But no, they chose an ancient ruin studded with weapons that resembles nothing more than a colossal ship of war. I can only assume they intended this location as an emergency plan of sorts. Its motive, power... Being a powerful crystal, authorization for its deployment was strictly limited to true emergencies only. That being said, it seems that those who crafted this place never had any occasion to use these weapons, and so the ruins were buried, slowly decaying into corruption. Okay, the ancient ruins from FF5, then. All that's left is the water crystal. Yeah, and the final fiend. Um... You might not like this, but you know I like to speak my mind. Of course, Jed. Let's go. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, shut the fuck up, Jed. Dumbass. Oh, right. No reason for me to have this combination anymore. They're both maxed. Uh, let me... You know what? I have not messed with thieves at all. Hmm. 
let's try to get into Duelist. It's late in the game, but... Let's become a Duelist. Ooh, weak spot ability. Cool. And secondary job. I mean, I've got magic jobs. Oh, I, I do want uh, samurai. I need samurai so that I can learn breaker. Time for a change. All right. That looks pretty old. Oh. I wonder, does it work? Nope. No response at all. Let's find a way to open it. So, does Neon have a onesie? No, she's got underwear. Okay, they both have underwear. Thought for a second that, that was some sort of elaborate onesie. Oh, switches. I hope they have the giant fan Looks monsters. Like Okay, we've got the switches and the turrets, like the last place. Let's go. Hey, Jack. Let me guess. More memory talk. But memories are precious, don't you think? If they're huh? so precious, keep them to yourself. <laughs> I don't want to talk about my memories. I don't have them. Memories are idiot dumb. Stupid poopy talk. Let me just lower the game audio a little bit. Okay, there's a shortcut back. They are resistant to slashing. That's what you get for all the blocking. Okay. Well, my double slashing party it's probably not going to necessarily do great if all the enemies are robots we've got a hard road ahead of us i don't know what i expected <laughs> uh you think we're safe i could keep going where's where's the switch This ladder doesn't work, right? Yep, yeah, that's a backtrack ladder. Where's the big dub crank? Down this way. No thanks, ghost man. So the place we came from different from this one. We came to this world to strike down chaos to become warriors of light. You don't need to say everything you think, you know. Ah, cursed embrace. Oh, what? That killed me. Okay. Enemies deal more damage now. Berserker. Three job points here. Near death physical damage, Berserk Mastery. Berserk Mastery seems good. White Mage, Sage seems like the better one. But I don't have a 
need to spend the points on. Let's get back to him. Get back to stabbing. I like that your damage output, even for jobs that you haven't really messed with too much, is is not terrible. Like, the weapons do most of the damage, so it's not like being underleveled means you can't just swap to a class because it, it, it'll just do shit damage and be useless. There are plenty of games where if you are a job that you haven't invested any time in, your character is just worthless. Way to go, Stranger Paradise, for not doing that. Oh, that's a lot of goons that are going to wake up after I kill this wraith. More trash to dispose of. I love that when this thing teleports away, it does not break my target lock. Ooh. That's a better sword. That's a better katana. That is a much better katana. Yeah, oh, like, why, why even bother <laughs> paying attention to what weapons you've got equipped? Or ever, like... Upgrade weapons. Yeah, job a level up. All right, pull the big crank. Gotta wake up all the robots. All right, let's get back up there. Nothing behind me, right? Shit. Nothing's ever easy for us, is it? Let's silence this thing. Get him. Get him, Neon. doesn't bode well, just keep hitting them. All right. Oh boy. Yeah, that thing's got a power strength. Power swing. Power swing hurts. Enemies are now hitting real hard. Venom. A temporary causes landed hits landed to accumulate poison. Ooh. Sure. That seems good. I thought I also got a point in samurai. I did, but not enough to do anything with it. Okay. Lasers. Let's be quick. Get dumpstered.
cut these dudes. I was kind of hoping we'd get a better dungeon for FF5, honestly. Like, this was the dungeon that I thought was low cost. Like, the odds of it being this dungeon were pretty high. Because the Earth, ca the uh, Flying Fortress, Underground Cavern to Flying Fortress is not really distinguishable. It, it's a pretty, there's not a lot of assets that feel like they would need to be uniquely made just for this. On to the next battle. So it felt like the lowest opportunity cost option. Wow. I didn't think we'd get through this way. The next time we need a breather. Neon, no! <laughs> the only thing I can remember about home is the tall grass. Where's Neon gonna appear? There she is. Weird white room. That's all I can recall. Nothing else. Not even the town or my house. And so, I wanna go home. Oh, go there's a cactus car. I can't remember at all. <laughs> hey, are you guys listening? No, Jed, you idiot. Job trees. Do list. Do list job affinity. Extend evade invincibility. Ooh. That's a lot. That's good. Ooh, become invincible when attacking with weak spot? That's a good one. Life Breaker Duration, Duelist Affinity. Okay, I'll I'll save my points. I seem to be leveling Duelist really, really fast. Because it's the late game. Pull the switch. This remix is pretty good. Cut this dude. Job level up. Oh, no. Stupid Earth Elementals. I'll get you, Cactar. Stop taunting me. Jack Final Fantasy will eventually get you. This thing still gets staggered even when it's resisting my attacks. I guess I probably want to be using stabbing weapons. Make this 
Are you keeping track of your potions, or are you just drinking them like a drunkard? Sophia, real judgmental about my use of potions. Really, don't put the knife away when I'm killing a turret. Just because it doesn't have a heartbeat doesn't mean we don't need to stab it. Oh no, that might kill me. Dang it. I can't get grabbed by the ghoulie. I don't need to kill that many enemies to get my duel list up. Let's go. I expect to be impressed. Stab these dudes. Ah, ah, no. Oh, boy. This is a noticeable difficulty spike, and I am trying to use a bad class, or not a bad class, a class I have not used before, so. And it's ill-equipped for this environment. So I'm just going to use Anima to get, uh, actually, you know what, better idea. Let me not do this now. Let me get a stabbing weapon. Does it say what kind of damage type these do? Are these stabbing? I know that this is blunt, this is blunt, this is stabbing, this is blunt, slashing, slashing. This seems like it might be stabbing. Um... Let's get the regular equipment details. Extreme Edge. Attack type Pierce. Okay. Attack type Pierce. Oh, it's got a special move that is attack type Pierce. It is not itself attack type Pierce. Okay. Let's switch jobs. To huh, sword failure is already level eleven. Let's go to red mage. Oh, uh, I can actually red mage equip a shield as well. Okay, I'll need to get more shields, and then I will be able to equip the shield.
but having access to magic should help. Another job I've neglected. Oh, it's still slashing, huh? Get him. Ah, no. Ah. Oh, water deals extra damage to these dudes. Right. Because they electric. Wiggy, wiggy, wiggy. Spike. This is a bad place. Let's be quick. Oh, you don't have access to water, huh? Okay, you got access to haste, though. No access to water is annoying. Gen's fine, but it doesn't heal as much as I'd like. You don't tell me what to do. Oh. Using these weaker classes or these underleveled classes is messed me up big time. I guess I'll just try to do samurai stuff. Red Mage Affinity, physical break damage up, status ailments. Okay, Tyrant seems good. Void Knight. Beating weapon with a chosen element. Uh, Tyrant seems like the way to go. So let me just run around with my samurai. It's at least a higher level. And Mikyo Shisui is a pretty good ability. Increase my MP up so I can chain abilities. There we go. Get hit, they stay hit. Come on, follow me. That's way better. Jinpu. No. Ooh. 
Nice. Okay, so if I hold it, I enter fast slash mode. And that seems like it's way more powerful. Okay, the turrets stay dead. That's good. Right back at you. There we go. I like it how much fun Jack seems to be having with the killing. Oh, monk! I can equip monks with uh, katanas. Really? I did not know that. Oh boy, this is a bad room. Robots do not deal a lot of damage. This looks good. Collecting. It's up to you, Sophia. You're finally asking for Not numb. Not on me. Oh no. Get it. Get him. Bad room. The heck? Okay. Have I been down? I've been down there? Oh, I do need to kick it down. Okay, I was like, how the hell have I been down there? We'll use this to get back. Hey, Cactar. Chop, 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 chop. Gotta hit him with the slap chop. Oh, okay. Got it. Know where I am now. Get into slap chop mode. Oh no. Slash, 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 slash.
Ah. Oh boy. Oh no. Job trees. Ooh, I can get all the way to Breaker. Finally. Expert jobs boast highly unique job actions whose true value only becomes clear once they are customized. With your expert jobs, you can combine various jobs and equipment to create your own personal style of play. Lay out all your enemies to the sword. Lay all your enemies to the sword with Zantetsuken. Breakers have access to Zantetsuken. R2, an ability which summons a colossal blade to devastate your enemies. Enemies broken or brought to zero by this attack will be finished with a soul burst. Cool. Zanshin. Temporary reduces the MP cost of combo abilities. Cool. Well, I mean, let's try the new job. Let's try Breaker. See why it's called Breaker now. Why can I not Zantetsuki? Does it cost more than one bar? Just checking for donations real quick. Yep, that's where the cactar was. This is where the tomberry was. Oh no, that'll kill me. Can't get command grabbed. Getting command grabbed is bad. Okay, uh, where's where am I supposed to go here? I wish they had picked a more distinctive level than the ancient. What <laughs> what is it? Ancient ruins, the buried, buried ship. And FF5. Okay, yeah, it takes up two bars. Okay, Breaker seems like it might not be outstanding. Standing there, charging up Zantetsuken, as cool as it is, doesn't seem like it might be. It seems like I'm just kind of vulnerable. I don't know that I can use it to kill bosses or anything. No boss is just going to stand there and let me do it. Breaker does quick. seem to uh, so hit pretty hard.
the other one fell down the hole. Journey continues. Okay, girls. Get him. Why would you go after me? Those two are casting way worse spells at you. There we go. Go after them. I need y'all to stop telling me how to use my potions and when. Alright, on to the next floor. Slop it through a little bit. Reminder, $20 will get you an emo ballad. Just $20. Oh! Ha! I'm donating solely because of the feet feet comment. Like I care. Thank you. Thank you for the donation. Twenty dollars, which means it's time for an emo song. Okay, twenty dollars, which means let me let me go to my emo song collection. Pull something up. What do we got here? Uh, which song have I not gone with yet? Ooh, I, I know. You know, I haven't done any... I've got some options. I haven't done any Linkin Park. I haven't done... Uh, I still have some 41 and Blink-182. Let's, let's, re let's revisit the uh, poll from, last, from yesterday. Ah. Come on now. Fi fine. Entering a poll kind of... Y'all don't see it, but it, it sometimes is a little bit finicky. Forty-one. Create custom poll. Okay, folks. What do you want to hear? Ooh, we're going forty-one. One eighty-two. It's tied. Monument of Fallen Warriors. Okay. Uh, another coral. Looks like we got a tie. This help. This helps me not at all. Yep. Dead. All right. Well. If it's between, if if it's an actual uh, tie, I guess I'll be the tiebreaker here. I'll go with which I prefer, and I think I prefer some 41 Fat Lip. Strolling through the party like my name is Alanino. Battling at the back of the Camino as a kid. Was the skid. No one knew me by name. That's my own house party because nobody came. Well, we like having fun at high school. We had to. Never played. At my age. I don't want to waste my time. Become another casualty of society. I'll never fall in line. Become another victim of your conformity and back down. Because you 
don't know us at all. We laugh when old people fall. But what do you expect from a conscience so small? Heavy metal and mullets is how we were raised. Maiden and priest were the guys that we praise. You're kind of fun at other people's expense, and cutting people down is just a minor offense, and it's none of your concern. I guess I'll never learn. I'm sick of being told to wait my turn. I don't want to waste my time. Become another casualty of society. I'll never fall in line. Become another victim of your conformity and back down. Don't count on me to let you know when. Don't count on me. I'll do it again. Don't count on me. It's a point you're missing. Don't count on me. Cause I'm not listening. That's right. I don't give a fuck about nothing. Distortion. Sets around the front of it. It's not the hook, I'm a hit list wanted on the telephone book. Songs with distortion. Get an abortion. My doctor told my mom should have had an abortion. 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 I don't want to waste my time. Become another casualty of society. I'll never fall in line. Become another victim of your conformity. But waste my time again. Victimcy of society. Waste my time again. Victim of your conformity. And back down. Okay. And that's some 41's fat lip as best as I can perform it. Thank you everyone who's donated. Again, another $20 and I will sing a different song. Oh, let me put in the donation link in chat. That is my my page. Thank you for the donation. Let me check. Did we get any more donations? And I am now a hundred dollars away from having to paint my nails. It is rapidly approaching. Let me update my totals. Oh, I have been. Ugh, I apologize. I have been... The gameplay has been in the wrong area. I apologize. For 40 minutes. No one told me. I guess people thought I wanted it to be on me and not the game. That was dumb. Sorry, I apologize. Refresh cache of current page. Refresh cache of current page. Okay. Back to trying to get through this level. All the gameplay was in the little tiny little space. It is day three of doing this, and boy, are my arms tired. Um, I feel like this is a fine, fine combo. I just need to play better. Zentetsuken is a weird ability. I basically stand still and let this ability charge up. Come on, follow me. But the big defense down, like that definitely helps. Now it's got more of a purpose because of the defense down, but it's still not great. I keep getting turned around with that every time. Okay, I 
I go over here, there's this wraith. I try to Zantetsuka it. Okay, instant death. On to the next area. Hope folks have been uh, tuning into all the various streams we've got going. Okay, so Zantetsuken, you can just kind of tank while it's happening. You tank hits while it's charging up, so that's at least convenient, so you don't get just knocked out of this stance, but it's really a, uh, it's really all in. Back to the bad room. Let's get on with it. Let's get it over with. Ha! One of them. Just keep hitting them. Oh. Okay, yeah. Uh, Breaker. Breaker is not good for this. <laughs> not good. Let me upgrade Breaker, and then I will get out of Breaker, I guess. Swift Steel. Breaker Affinity. Ability Break Damage. Breaker Affinity. Decrease Action Ability MP Cost seems important for this job. Magic Regen. And you've got a little bit of, like, hybridization that you can do, too, which is interesting. Like, you can kind of make your, your own hybrid jobs. Uh, breaker, I'll change Red Mage. Let's... Myself a duelist. Oh, these knives guy can do with almost everything. So if I like some of these early starter weapons, I can use them with almost any job, which is cool. Let's I don't need quick. to kill y'all. Go Ignore. It's not that way. It is this way. And then it's this wraith. Quick thrust. Don't don't grab me. Don't grab me, Ghoulie. Okay, back attacks. Don't care about defense. That's good. So if I can get behind them, I could just jack them up. Oof. Yes, you must help Jack. Crank. Get him. 
fire. Yeah. Waraga. Way to go. Way to go with your sicko modes. I need a moment to correct myself. Maybe we should rest up. Get him. I would focus on the enemy who's messing you up, but I suppose you can stare at me. Oh, what the hell? Magics. Cursed magics. All right, I, I, this is a bad level. This has gone bad. Uh, let me just get what I want out of Duelist and, and be done with it. Let's use some Anima. Let's unlock Thief. So that's all I actually want. And then let's equip Thief. Where's Thief? Thief is 100% a weapon, I sh a job class I should be able to use here. Oh, do I need, what else do I need for Thief? Job trees. What else does Thief take? Pugilist. Okay. How many job points? All right. Well, time for a change. All right. Let's give myself my fists again. Where's a pugilist fist? Here come a pugilist. Need to get more pugilist points so I can unlock thief. Most of this just hits hard. But at least I know what the, like, punch patterns are. Time to go to work. And at least they do full damage against these guys. You hit so fast. Like, even Thief looks like a joke next to, next to Pugilist in terms of speed. Like, look at this. Get tricked again. Hell yeah. Ding, ding, ding. Pugilist is my shit. Just run up and wail on them. Hey, what's up? Bop, 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 bop. Ah, oh, Plasma Blade. Don't get hit by Plasma Blade. Okay, if I can get any enemy to a single combat, I can take them out with Pugilist. Crowd control is the problem with Pugilist. A nuisance. Let's make this entertaining.
Crazy flippy shit. Get him. Uh. Take down. Uh. Stagger, 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 stagger. Stagger this man across the room. Is that it? Let's forge ahead. Pugilist is so good. <laughs> Reminder, this is for the John Bob Community Endurance Run this stream. Raising money for Pencils of Promise, a charity that builds schools, trains teachers, and sends kids to school in developing nations. At uh, another, just another $88, uh, I will have to paint my nails. Um, I, will soon, I will soon have straightened hair and uh, eyeliner. That will be happening... In the not-too-distant future, I just have to wait for my lovely assistant to get home. My, my significant other. Punch rush. Uh. What? I died in one hit? Oof. The naked part of this run is now starting to become a problem. Once you start getting one-shotted, like, I was able to just kind of overwhelm my enemies earlier. I could out-DPS the damage. Now I can't really even damage race them. I'm dying too fast. Let's make this Like, even with Blood Weapon. But it is very funny to see him running around in his dang boxers. I like that he's got compression shorts, you know? He's an athletic guy doing athletic things. He doesn't need chafing. That was quick. On to the next battle. Come on. More traps to dispose of. Quit blocking. What the? Like, just getting hit by strays kills me now. Boy. I mean, I could keep unlocking more jobs, but the problem is just I, I don't have enough health. Or I don't have armor, so I, I just take full damage from everything. I'm pretty late in the game, but Let's be I clear. might be ready for I might need to put on have my team put on clothes. Oh no. Knock the health out of them, Jack.
Just punch the health out of them. Punch, punch, punchy, punch, punch. Sweet, another job level. Next. Only four more job levels to max out Pugilist. But I won't need to max out Pugilist. Is there any upside to maxing out jobs beyond just having like all the skills possible? Jack. When, when Zantetsukin works, it really works. What does my job affinity get me? HP up, strike, break damage, dealt, agility, strength. Percentage ups. Way to go, you two. Look at you, Square Enix making characters with different body types. done with pugilist to get thief I can get thief cool thief is unlocked duelist swift swipes critical damage up extend evade invincibility yep Swift steel, breaking blow. It's a great sword weapon. I would like overpower. Okay. So now I can be a thief. Yeah. I can still have these sweet bracers, but I can be a thief. These gloves basically can be used with anything. There's one. More trash to dispose of. Which another cool thing. Like this game. They let you use even more of your weapons. Like you can always be using many of your favorite weapons. And because the weapon is what has some of these upgrades. I could just keep using these bracers and tear dudes up. Oh, let me see. Do I have any bracers that are good for thieves? I do not. I have Dark Knight. I have, oh, that's just that's just way stronger. Let's just hit hard. I'm not sure how steel works, but I also don't know that I will use steel. I think what I'm mostly going to use Thief for is the extended invincibility on dodges. Go. Thanks, 
Pá, 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 pá. New bracers. Okay, they're pugilist bracers. I mean, getting my pugilist affinity up is better than not. Buffs are buffs. Why is it not triggering? This room again. Here we are. Let's be quick. This will be a thorn in our side. World could use fewer monsters. Get him, folks. I thought I blocked that. Oh, nice. Does that kill all of them? No, but I can use the experience, so I'll beat it out of them. All right, are we straightening my hair? Or do you need a minute? We can straighten your hair if you want. Uh, we need to plug in the flat iron. Yep. Plug in the flat iron. You could do the eyeshadow, the eyeliner first. Yeah. Draw hope from their presence. This is unideal as it increases aggregate light and invites imbalance. Our solution was to pump darkness in to counteract this trend. But that introduced a new problem. Humans affected by darkness causing sharp shifts in the opposite side of the spectrum, inviting the dangerous possibility of the chaos entity's manifestation. The entity's existence is a continuous blight, and we should have wiped them out during our period of open conflict with them long ago. I remember being from here and getting the crystal. You know I don't want to lose to anyone else. I know I have to live, and no, no, Jack will be pissed if he overhears us. Let's not. <laughs> Jack will be pissed if we think about this too much. I would simply not care if Jack was pissed about something. Temporary increases movement speed and break gauge recovery. Sure. Boss? Nope. Look at that one. It makes all the others look like toys. Nothing hits us. There must be a way to stop it. We just have to find it. Be safe in this animation. Okay. All right. One sec. Let me just get to a safe spot. Oh God. Oh God. He got shot to death by a laser. 
because you distracted me. Okay. You asked me to do this. That's true. That's true. Okay, let me just change the camera angle. All right. Do the do the thing. Make me pretty. Okay. Close your eyes and I won't kiss you. Close my eyes and when I open I'll be pretty. Mm -hmm. Almost. He's still gonna straighten this one. Yep, the flat iron needs to heat up. Got a twenty dollar donation already. Yay. So I tried my darndest to sing fat lip, and then I realized that my camera was on the wrong camera angle for the whole time. Cool. Yep. What's up? Wow. What's up? Ow, you're fine. If I just looked you right in the eye, the whole time. You and your phone. Stop holding my head. It, you've got a lot of hair. Don't know if you noticed. I do. You're just putting stress on my neck in a weird way. Ugh. Okay, we're gonna smoosh, smudge, smoosh, smoosh, smoosh it. What a pro. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, do you need to do you need to do the flat iron? It's hot. It's hot? Okay, let me take my headphones off. Did, gotta spray it with the the primer. Laser beam. Ah. Is that it? Is that as much as... Yeah, you don't need a lot. You don't need a lot? Okay. We're almost out of that stuff, huh? Yep. So this is because of your donations that this is happening. All thanks to you, the viewers of the Giant Bob community. This is happening. Ah, ah. When does the soul patch go away? Uh, as soon as this is done. Ah. You're just trying to take hairs out. Jealous of the luxury. Big as my hair gets. Voluminous. Now that's a fun term. see if there are any comments chat reminder i'm 88 dollars away from having to paint my nails mm. <laughs> touch my skin i did not touch your skin you did touch my skin it's my skin i know when there's a hot iron on my skin It was sharp, and then it was not hot anymore. Fair, we are boring. Ah! What? I thought I killed you. 
phaser cannon. Let's be quick. Time to go to war. Yes. Yes, chat. That is an appropriate emote for what is happening. You just see the top emote. from the laser beam that time. It wasn't you. Yeah. There's a different tone to your... Ah! When it's me versus... When it's me, my scout being burned versus the game. There you are. Be ready for anything. That's that time when I said you were burning me and you said, no, I'm not. Um, I can feel a throb in the spot where... It definitely 100% touched my neck. Also... Don't tell me I moved. You know, I know. Let's be quick. Let's make this what? entertaining. Rude. I did not move. You're implying I moved, but I didn't. Why did I get my hair wet? Because I felt, I felt terrible, and I was gonna have to do this anyway. I mean, a little bit, but it's just if you're like, you know, you're doing it. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't realize the maintenance routine was going to be meaningfully changed. Apologies. You watch me get ready every day. I do, but I don't pay that close attention. I just assume it's mostly magic. Yeah. Fairy dust. Yep. Women wake up looking dolled up. We don't poop. That's true. Uh, That's a fact. Always male dressed. Yes. Facts. Don't sweat. Nope. They show up. Boom, baby. No. One, one no risk to, to a baby. Everything from the waist down is totally intact. Yep. We're on the same page here. Oh, there's a ladder. I don't like the smoke that comes off of that. It's it's steam, it's not smoke. It's energy. Oh, good. That's why that's why you do the heat. That it's also more the heat resistance that makes your blood that that my hair is moisture. Yeah. There you are. It's just your less your life essence. Your lessons. That's all it is. I see smoke. Yep. I smell smoke. It's like, uh, ectoplasm. Yeah. Just like ectoplasm. I can keep going. Let me go up the ladder. I just want to go up the ladder. How heavy was this heavy bag? Come on, I expect to be impressed. I won't. Well, I would be walking with me in the alley as a friend. You would not be threatened by me. That's what I'm saying. You would not see me as a foe. Why don't you beat the 
crap out of that guy and you'd be like, he's a friend, he's with me. have any donations I'm just gonna move my head just a, just a little bit so I can see oh we got a hundred dollar donation for some painted nails and say thank you to your hairstylist and assistant thank you Jana B um, my lovely assistant I'll get, I'll get the nail polish excellent I'll get the reserves. okay I'll get a poll going as soon as we have the reserves uh, if you could get that nice sparkly crackly one that you like so good no, that one's old. No, it's old. You threw it out. What? It was old and crusty. It was crusty. It was like what crackled in the box at that point. Oh. Sorry. But I thought that some sort of influencer, like, did that. I can't. I thought you learned about that from some sort of influencer. That crackly nail polish. I thought that that was from. I got that like twelve years ago. Oh. No, not the. Wasn't there one that, like, you got for your sister that you were like, this is my favorite nail polish? Yeah. Yes, Hello Taco. It, is it sparkly? It's sparkly. I thought that was the crackly one. What a dummy I am. Of course, Hello Taco. Duh. Hello Taco. Not Hello Taco. Hollow taco. What a dummy I am. I'll take that. All right. And I am. Yeah, I'm not not into it. I don't want it for me because uh, of the impermanence of it, but I am into it when you get it. I'm like, that's cool. What a cool nail art you got. Wow. Art's crazy. Look what they can do nowadays. Did you see that my character is always wearing his underwear? Me? Yeah, did you notice this man in his... Okay. How do you feel about his boxer choice? Solid. That's fair. Ignore the blood. Okay. So his rump doesn't have much rump. Okay. It's a shame. Square Enix being cowards. And then the, the ladies. Uh, you know, good on Square Enix for giving them, like, relatively normal underwear. intervention. Maybe they're wearing a bra underneath. Maybe a push-up bra underneath. I don't know. Yeah, they definitely have a Barbie-esque yeah, that's exactly what I thought of. look to them. Um, I will sing as soon as there's not a flat iron next to my face. <laughs> don't threaten me. Ah, mine, the Pisca Demon. Yeah. Pisca Demon. This is what Pescatarians need. Pisca Demon Italians. Done? It could be done. I can't. It's a little. No. No room for mistakes.
right, it's going to block my vision the whole time. Right. I was like, oh, it's in my face. That's probably a no, mistake. That's your, that's your nope. Hair. That's how it's got to be. I didn't do nothing. I just straightened it. That's how it's still done. There you go. Let's make this. Is easy. how's it going to be an emo song? I did not sing Kill yet. I sang Fat Lip by Sum 41. Let's be quick. Time to go to work. Yeah. How's it gonna be it's too it's ten years too early? Time for a change. Let's get on with it. The world could use people Oh no. Oh goodness. But I'm not. Yeah. This might be is that is, I think this is not I straight? Keep going. Is this the same hair that you have? I can't tell. It's straight. The I think camera. You don't enjoy the placement of it. I think that's. Yeah. That might be it. I don't know. It could be gravity's fault. Yeah, this looks exactly like that wig that your friend was wearing. Jack. Your friend's Fight. husband was wearing. Yeah. It's a fight up ahead. But it's just the head, the hair on my head. We have to focus on what's in front of us before we I'm the human wig. Mm -hmm. All right. I, how do we feel? Are we done? We're done with this. What? Chat. Does it look? Chat. Is this accurate? It does to me. But chat. Chat. Good. Thumbs up. Is the hair. Great enough? Question mark. <laughs> I don't like when it's near my ear. Yeah, it's not fun. It's just so patronizing. <laughs> yeah, it's not fun, is it? Snip, snap. <laughs> uh, the um, the woman who did my hair. Yep. Burned me badly on my neck. I do remember that. Yeah. And the person who did my hair the next day looked. You. She looked at it and kept looking at it. She's like, "The fuck did I do that?" I was like, "That was me." Mm. I can't believe that. Burn yourself before you ever burn us. You should hire me doubly, <laughs> twice. I think I'm gonna be fighting a boss in a second. Okay. I will. Yep. Okay, no one has said that it is bad. Okay. Headphones are going on. The monster had bad news. But the mist was even worse. Oh, no mist. Cut you. And someone else's memories become yours. If you want to stay who you are, don't let it come near you. Oh, giant scorpion mech. I don't remember a scorpion mech in Oh Cray Claw, yeah. Okay, that's fun. I know it! It's that same attack from before. Reaches further than I thought it would. Thank you for the donation. Oh, ZP's got a little Caesar's pizza. Let me just tweet this out before I take another run at this dude. Oh, I, I've got to sing. Right. Let me do all my bookkeeping, all my housekeeping before I uh, do anything else. Okay, so update the browsers so that they now have current donation totals. Next, tweet out. 
tweet out that this is happening. Then I've got five songs, I guess. Technically. J Jana B, if you would like me to sing five songs, I'll do it. If you have a preference or a favorite song I could sing for you, I would I would be happy to do so. Uh, right, twi tweet. Twittering. Tweet, tweet. Right, let me tweet out a link real quick to the donation page. My donation page specifically, not just the team one. What an awesome year, folks. Like the number of people who are at their goal or near it this early into Sunday, like I don't know that we've ever had this wide this wide of a donation base. Like We've had times where, you know, a staff member participates and that's like half of what we raise as a, you know, as a team. But this year, it's not been that way. It's been, it's been everyone, all hands on deck. Oh, no. Nope. Uh, and let me just let ZP know to let me know when he's streaming. So I can switch the streams. Okay, so let me get a song going. Let me check and see if anyone said anything about what they want to hear. See anything in chat? No. Anything in my Twitch chat? No. So, oh, dealer's choice then. I don't think I've done Ocean Avenue yet. I don't think I've done Ocean Avenue yet. So, let's do that. Oh, I haven't done any Lincoln Park. And I also have. Oh. Hey. Hey, Jen. Would you be down for an Evanescence duet? Think about it. Can you what? You can be the screamy man, and I could be the, the lady. Just a second. Let me, uh, I'm going to do a different song first. Doing Linkin Park. But get the, get the selections. Yep. Let's go with, uh, in the end. Now let's try and take down this boss. It starts with one thing. I don't know why. It doesn't even matter how hard you try. Keep that in mind. I designed this rhyme to explain in due time. All I know. Time is a valuable thing. Watch it fly by as the engine room swings. Watch it count down to the end of the day. The clock ticks life away. It's so unreal. <laughs> out below, watch the time go right out the window. Time to hold on. I didn't even know. Wasted it all just to watch you go. Tie, but even though I tried, it all fell apart. What it meant to me will eventually be a memory of a time I tried so hard and got so far. But in the end, it doesn't even matter. I had to fall to lose it all. But in the end, it doesn't even matter. One thing. 
I don't know why. It doesn't even matter how hard you try. Keep that in mind. I designed this rhyme to explain myself how I tried so hard. Hey, you were mocking me, acting like I was part of your proper titty. Hey, you pop with me. After times I got so far, things aren't the way they were before. You wouldn't even recognize me anymore. Not that you knew me back then, but it all comes back to me in the end. No, I tried. It all fell apart. What it meant to me will eventually be a memory of a time I tried so hard and got so far. But in the end, it doesn't even matter. I had too far to lose it all. But in the end, it doesn't even matter. I put my trust in you pushed as far as i can go for all this there's only one thing you should know i put my trust in you pushed as far as i can go and for all this there's only one thing you should know. I tried so hard and got so far. But in the end, it doesn't even matter. I had to fall to lose it all. But in the end, it doesn't even matter. All right, now one more Lincoln Park bop. Tired of being what you want me to be Feeling so faithless, lost under the surface Don't know what you expecting of me I'm under the pressure of walking in your shoe Caught in the undertow, I'm caught in the undertow Every step that I take is another mistake to you It's caught in the undertow I've become so numb, I can't feel you there. Become so tired, so much more aware. I'm becoming this, all I want to do is be more like me and be less like you. Can't you see that you're smothering me? Holding too tightly, afraid to lose control. But everything that you thought I would be has fallen apart right in front of you. In the undertow, just caught in the undertow. Every step that I take is another mistake to you. In the undertow, just caught in the undertow. Every second I waste is more than I can take. I've become so numb, I can't feel you there. Become so tired, so much more aware. Becoming this, all I want to do is be more like me, be less like you. And I know I may end up failing to and I know you were just like me with someone disappointed in you I've become so numb I can't feel you there become so tired so much more aware becoming this all i want to do is be more like me and be less like i've become so numb tired of being what you want me to be 
I've become so numb, I can't feel you there. Tired of being what you want me to be. Burn, 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 burn. Okay, this thing has a wide hit. Wide field of damage. Okay, we got... I, I can do one more song if folks want it in chat. If folks don't want it, I could do a few more. I'm going to put my headphones in. I'll let, I'll let chat speak. Ow. Ow, my neck. Okay, it looks like ZP is potentially on. I will I will maybe swap to his stream in a bit. I'll let him know, let him tell me when he's good and ready. This enemy's tough. He's just big and hits hard. Like my breaker, I I usually feel like I'm in a pretty good spot as long as I'm using Like this is my Longest ranged attack. Oof. 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 That move hits hard. It's cool to see a giant mechanical Cray Claw, though. This is one of the easier fights in FF5. Uh, Okay. Is there anything I can do here to make my make my man stronger? I guess I can do nimble thrust. Increase his attack speed, sure. Uh breaker affinity up. Nope, can't afford can't afford most of these. Oh, um, my two compatriots. Okay, she's job level 30 with Red Mage now. Knight Sword Fighter. I mean, Red Mage is fine. And you're level 30 with Black Mage. Could make you a Dragoon, but I don't think Dragoon is actually that helpful for this fight. I think the ranged classes are what we want. Ah, Wave Cannon immediately. Root. That hits hard. That should have hit. I'll drink as much as I want, Sophia. Ah. Ah. This music's very good. Okay, I'm gonna swap, uh, to swap CP in. Back, then back to killing Crayclaw. I keep thinking I've got something on my neck or like my collar's too tight but I forget I have a chain choker on. <laughs> Trident just have a, uh... Oh, imbue lightning, yeah.
okay. All right, ZP is now in, and I am now stuck against the stupid cray claw for a bit. So, uh, I'll I'll get some. Uh, I'll get a poll up in chat for what uh, what nail polish color people want to see. Make some attempts at cray claw before we do that. You know, I I didn't know that we would get to nail polish levels. I didn't know that we'd get this far. AoE on those attacks is far. Just a sec. Let me just win or lose. Should be, should know if I'm gonna win or lose soon. This music's very good. Oh, that killed me. This music's very good. Okay, let's let's swap camera angles. Okay. Let's let's get options and I will make a poll. We can also do combos, yeah. folks. Why shoot? Okay, I'll get a poll up. What uh, so, so we've got Can you come closer? They can't hear you from that far away, I don't think. Okay, what are the options? So, in my mind, in my mind, um, the mood is either black or neon, like generally speaking. That's right? fair. Black or neon, yep. So, got black, obviously. And there's this. I also, oh, this is just like what I had. So. Yeah, this is. I can't believe you didn't uh, purchase a bunch of nail polish specifically for this cause. I would have. I just wasn't prepared. Um, we've got an orange. We've got orange for Halloween vibes. And this isn't quite neon, but it it feels like it's just about the right shade of green. We've got green for your... I mean, I feel like green and black, there's a lot of that yeah. at your at your Vans, your local yes. Vans dealer. Exactly. And that's that's what we're going for. Um, is this too happy? That might be too happy. Things too happy. It's a too happy it's of a blue. I have to like a neonish blue, but it might be too. Yeah, I mean, I think it counts. Spring I think it counts. Look, there's no good, there's no good suggestions in a brainstorm. No bad suggestions in a brainstorm. <laughs> there's no bad suggestions in a brainstorm. Um, and then if you want like a pop of white to make the sadness stand out. And then know? there's just white, you know. MCR, they loved it. Yeah, Everyone um, loves Tim Burton, white and black. I don't know. I have some sparkly stuff, but like, I don't know. Um, oh, this color silver might be the right, have the right mood. Silver, orange, um, neon, green, blue. blue. So I think that's enough options for yeah, folks. Yeah, I think those are good. That's so this options. is the silver, yeah. silver option. Okay, it create custom kinda, poll. It looks like oh, and then mix. Yeah. <laughs> create custom poll. Mix. So I mean, all of them? It, it com a combination. Oh my God. Okay. Gotta put my creative, creative hat on. Okay, poll is up. See if we get anyone voting. 
So far, no votes coming in. No votes. No one, no one wanted to do. No one wanted their hand on the dagger. Uh, I think, personally, mm -hmm. okay. I think that with the the green with the green the green with all of this the green or perhaps the not the orange the green the white or the uh, or the black. What are these three? I don't think these three are good. Okay. I mean, we could get some get real Tim Burtony up in this this match. We could. Right. I mean, white and green would Tim Burton it pretty well. I don't know that the. Yes. Oh yeah, yeah. We could do the whole thing. We could do the whole thing. What are you saying? You're right. When you're right, yes. you're right. Gotcha. Okay, so. And how do you want to do this? How do I want to do like this? Video game. Uh, Did you think about this? I I, I guess I paused for a bit. How long will it take? Do you think? Uh, like. Mm, five to ten minutes. Five to ten minutes, and then I need to just not, get my nails on things. Okay, so okay. I'm gonna <laughs> so, I'm gonna give you one hand, and I'm gonna try and beat this boss with okay. the other hand. All right, let's uh, let's make this fun. Let's do a little like tutorial. Shall I mean, we? there's no downside to be dying repeatedly. No. This seems impossible. You don't need to trim my cuticles. Just work around them. Owies. That hurts? It's not pleasant. I'm like, what? Don't even. Okay, that's really, that's the biggest offender just, right oh, there. Oh, ah. I'm trying to. This is not a good thing. Yes, uh, I'm just... Darndest to play the game. The controls for this game are not uh, amenable to what I'm trying to do here. Um, oh, right. What I needed to do was change the camera back to game mode. So yeah, I'm going to be continuing to make attempts on this boss, but the odds of me beating it with one hand, this is not a one hand control game. With my right hand I might have better success. imagine someone saying, both hands on the table, please. Where's the other hand? Ew, is that a thing? Yes. Come on. Uh, yep. Give me a fucking break. Putting my faith in you. Hey, we're gonna start with a simple ABC pattern, you know, and then go from there. So I've gotten to the point where I can definitely lock on to the enemy. So that's pretty good. I sometimes even attack it.
I like how you're just like picking which fingers. Oh, this one's yes. No, I just said blind. what I was doing. I know it's it, it's picking which finger. That's the like. It's an ABC. I know that it's easy as one, two, three. That's all I know. And Del Rey. Can anyone else vouch for me? Did you learn patterns by using the alphabet like A, B, C, D? Because I didn't make it up. Oops. But you know, it also adds to the mood, I think. Much like that. <laughs> okay. I'm continuing to technically play the game. Thing. What? Like doing. I do my own nails. Like. I thought like at at sleepovers like no, doing each other's. No, yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. Each other. No, that's a phrase. It's not what's done. It's not what's done. Gender is a construct, but also we have secrets. I'm not dead yet. money situation though. Ah. Ah, I, died. Ah, I almost I almost got it down to a form. That's pretty good. All considered. I think some of this polish is better than other t polishes, right? So funnily enough, the, the black and white are the fancy polishes. Those are the fancy polishes? Really? But I think they have more pigment in them. Like... Oh. So they're thicker? Yeah. So do you need my other hand now? I mean, there's, there's clearly a missed spot. Oh, my fucking God. I'm sorry. I, well, uh, I would never be... <laughs> you... <laughs> Are you happy? Yes. <laughs> you fucking baby. Okay, now you need the other hand? I'm doing this for the kids, okay? You are doing it for the kids. No, then. no, I need your pinky. You need my pinky? Yeah. Okay, second code. Second code. Do we have one of those uh, UV things you put your hands under? No, this is not gel. Oh, you need that for you gel. Air dry. Okay. How long do they take to air dry? <sighs> Take a while. How long is a while? Mm -hmm. Like half hour or so. Half hour or so. Mm -hmm. What? Yeah. Otherwise, you're gonna smudge it. This is not a good look. <sighs> okay. Really well, let's, here, here you go. So you can A B. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a different A B C D. I think. Okay. So don't. Yeah. Don't do that. I like that you're saying quietly to yourself. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I'll come on this side. Okay. That's 
flies in. Yep. It's all been an elaborate long con for this moment. Yes? Bad at me. Okay, maybe you could be bad at me. Turns out the left hand was the easier hand for the controls. Most of the buttons are thumbable, thumbable with the left hand. The right hand is mostly pinky. Did you ever watch Pinky in the Brain? There's tension in my body. Relax. I feel tense. Did you get it? I did. I got what you were saying. We watched Zoolander together. I was there. I like that his origin story is that he was a, like, band member of that band. Mugatu. It mostly holds up, though. It does. It does hold up. Okay, there's just a white nail left. Just one Coke nail. Can't tell it's you're even apologizing for it. So. Oh, I thought I splashed it. You did not. Not this time. Does samurai get no? Dragoon is max. Oh, no. What happened? Rookie mistake. What'd you do? <laughs> Look at your your point of paper. Oh no. You, okay. I was like, I don't even see what you did. Looks fine to me. You touched it. As long as it wasn't me. So can I try and play with these? But I just need to not touch, your nail touch my nail on this. anything. Yes. Wait, I need to do pop coat. Pop coat? Yeah. What's pop to coat? To protect it. To protect it? This doesn't look bad. Like, this is not, not a bad choice. Definitely very, like, Beetlejuicy, Tim Burton. Yes, very Tim burton -y. This is, and I'm going to put on the speed setter top coat, so it'll help them dry a little bit faster. Okay. Top coat me. Yeah. Oh, no. Should it be, should it have webbing like that? Uh, you know. So oh, is, no. This is, <laughs> this is not doing this last time I used it. This has uh, been maybe sitting for too long. I guess, but I well, I think because it's a speed setter, it like it doesn't last as long. Hmm. I see. Huh. So, what do you think I should how just do keep you going? Okay. We're committed. All right. It looks like a hot glue gun. It does. It was used. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Definitely. 
is hmm I want to know if ZP is eating the pizza I'm gonna see if let me get into yes let me just go ahead and put voice call can you put my headphones on on me oh uh -oh. what, what? <laughs> okay maybe you need to wait for it to dry a little more yep. can you put my headphones uh, on me and it's taunt me <laughs> that sound I was like oh no well, I have to increase the volume. I'm sorry. Give me a minute. Hello. Can you hear me? I now have headphones on. Can you hear me? Continue talking again. I Hello. I the output volume. I'm here. Can you hear me? A little bit more. Okay. That's not a good nail, Jen. I can remove it and redo it. No, don't remove it and redo it. Oh boy. Um, it's been through shit, you know. It's fine. Like your, like your sad soul. Let's like see how you sound soul. with game audio. So can you try talking now? Hello, can you hear me? Hello. Yes, this you sounds can, okay. You can hear me now. Um, there's no music slider. I can just turn music on or off, and uh, that seems like a bad design choice. Your game. This thing right. needs to be quick set, right? Yes, I'm just gonna yeah. put this too. All right. Out of the way. Oh, are you doing the you're doing the thing, huh? You hear that? Yeah, I heard that. Can you hear me? Yep. Yes, you can oh, hear fuck. me. I need to get a vessel for this, huh? Yeah. Uh, Gino, I'm going to get a bowl. Could you explain to chat what uh, I'm about to do? So ZP had a $50 donation incentive to pick toppings for his pizza. But like a, like a fool, he decided to uh, not limit it to toppings that are available at Little Caesars Pizza. And so he uh, left open this uh, terrible back door uh, into which I uh, injected yeah. chaos because uh, I am playing the chaos game. Not so back door. I don't think this is going to be that bad. So, well, I mean, I had worse options and I I chose one that was more humane. Um so some of the things that were that you are going to be trying on your pizza slices. Uh this one I call the gamer's french dip. It is a pizza slice dipped in Mountain Dew gamer fuel. The Gamer's French oh, Dip. It's pink. Oh, good. It's pink. It's 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 slightly pink. The Gamer Fuel. Oh, I got cherry. This smells like a cool pop thing. You got the wrong Mountain Dew. You got the wrong Mountain it Dew. Like cough syrup. ZP, can you hear me? I, I got. Gator, I got gamer. There's, there were multiple flavors. There are multiple d gamer fuels now. Yes, I got, I got what, what, what. I'm asking. That's a question. Yeah, there's more than one flavor. There was red, green, blue. Oh, I thought there was only one. Game fuel used to just be one thing. I didn't realize I got that. Red. You got red game fuel. Okay, fair enough. I thought that it was still just one thing. Do you know, I, I, have you been living in a rock your entire life? Like, if you Google game fuel, it will show you different colored cans. I don't drink Mountain Dew. Right. I, I, I bought this pizza. Um, it was a bit of an ordeal because uh, it turns out that turns out that um pizza places don't like to uh start working at 10 a.m or earlier weird but uh i found one that was opened at 10 even though it was a bit of a drive um, <laughs> ah. you know what damn it feels good to be a gangster i was actually number one on the list until someone decided to boost abby a little I, I think both of us are going to pass Abby. 
Because I, I know oh, that... I'm going to eat one slice with game fuel. I'm going to eat one with game fuel without the sesame seed oil, and then I'm going to eat another one with game fuel with, uh, with the sesame seed oil. Can you hear me? Here's the bowl. I, I, um, someone's asking, do we have a camera? I, I don't feel, uh, oh, there's a, del oh, I know why that there's a slight delay on this. Can you, can you hear me? Do people in your chat acknowledge my existence? I know why there was a delay. I had my headset stuck on my uh, laptop and not the live feed. I was trying to do a test on the Twitch. Okay, so that's why you're not reacting to me in real time. Yes, I am now reacting to you in real time. I have my headset stuck, and uh, this is this is I I I'm gonna say I opened it up. I ate one slice. I said I was only gonna eat one slice, and then it was so delicious, but I had to eat three slices. It's it's literally one of the most cost efficient, high quality pizzas you can buy in this fair country, the United States. I would take six dollars on this hot and ready over your god awful, overpriced dog shit in New York. Any of that fucking St. Louis bullshit. Deep dish is its own thing. Deep dish is a casserole. But uh, this is some delicious pizza that we're about to uh, ruin. Okay. Good. Ruin Here the pizza. Go, jet, jet, you know. I have both of my hands it? back. Can you hear that? Kinda. I can't hear it. Oh, it's soggy. Weird. Let me... Kinda. Oh, cray claw. Ah. Ah. Uh, this tastes like cough syrup. Why do you, uh, why do you honk? When you're eating a slice. You can actually talk to my mom. My mom is confident that I've always been a loud eater. It's mostly the honking that, that's confused me. So, the part of this that is distressing me the most, it's not what you think, you know? It's the fact that it has kind of like a well-baked, crispy, soft on the inside crispy on the outside crust and now it's literally like disintegrating because it's just being locked with water. Excellent. Yeah, red tastes like cough syrup. This is bad. Blame the French. that Mountain Dew is supposed to be grapefruit flavor? Like, default Mountain what? Dew? What? Really? Yeah. No. No, really. Mountain Dew, I went to the, this is funny, but I went to the, so you went to the, next to a soda bottling facility. I had multiple friends and family members who worked in Pepsi, but also there was a, there were other, I, I lived right across from next to a chemical processing facility for Shasta Cola. Oh. Um, so I know what the smell of processing sugar is. Not a great smell. The reason why my parents moved away from this. Uh, but anyways, um, no, yeah, I live next to multiple soda processing facilities. And yeah, Mountain Dew, default Mountain Dew is supposed to be great. For no. Is it grapefruit in the way that, like, nerds or banana runts are supposed to be banana? Like, is was well, there an... Don't, don't you know the story of... I do. I was going to say, is there an ancestral grapefruit that Mountain Dew is supposed to taste like? Like, it's not... It's definitely not the grapefruit I know and love. Oh, the second claw. Where the fuck is Jeff? I want him to get a real-time reaction. We're, we're in a call with ourselves. Can you invite Jeff? Uh, He's about to do his sesame seed dog shit. 
Okay, I'll try to add him. Let me d try and add him to the call. Boop. 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 Create group. My nails are currently drying, by the way. Do we have to play it weird? Hey, uh, Gino? I'm being very delicate on the controller, yes. Just to put this out there, mm -hmm. I think that overall... I had a positive experience with um, liking returns. I don't think you're gonna like it, but I had a I had an overall positive experience. Have you ever, Gina? Have you ever played Valkyrie Profile? No. Okay. But I know that Lightning's a Valkyrie, so. Well, all right, Jeff. Let me get this bottle of bullshit. Hi. Hey, good morning. You. I uh. I, my whole house has been moved around. I have, I have finally moved all of my video game and office shit from as opposed to two. Don't have a microphone set up. Joining you on my. Is this on your phone? Yeah, I'm talking to you on a note. Nice. Love. Shout out to Finn. Yeah, I did get a donation that asked me to put banana slices. I think I'm going to eat one with banana slices without sesame seed oil. Very finish thing. There's okay. a pizza bacon in Sweden called an Afrikaner. So I've got bananas and a pizza. Let's go ahead and eat. Let's, I already pre-sliced the banana. Do uh, you think I should just put them on so there's one, two, three, four, five, six? Can you, can you fill me in on the base of this? This is just a, a, a Little Caesars hot and ready, I'm assuming, pepperoni. Yep. Yeah, just pepperoni. So I'm going to put... You put meats on this? On top of the... I'm going to put banana slices on top of the pepperonis. Why would you... You knew what was getting added to it. Why would you put meats on it? We have... Okay. Let's eat it with bananas now. Uh... Huh. That's... How familiar are any of you of Filipino food? Yeah. Yes? Non-zero? Yeah, yeah. Uh, if you put bananas on a regular pepperoni pizza, it tastes shockingly similar to banana ketchup. Alright. Huh. Yeah, this is basically... This is, uh, I have a friend of mine who's Filipino. His, uh, I spent the night at his place and his mom made uh, spaghetti with bananas and mangoes huh. and banana ketchup as the base. And I was told that that is called Filipino spaghetti. Yeah, I, oh, I grew boy. up in one years. I uh, experienced, that was like three years of a lot of Filipino version stuff. Banana ketchup is not my favorite thing, but... You know, I, I don't think it's the worst. Yeah, this is just putting putting banana slices on top of uh, of pepperoni pizza. This is shockingly very similar in terms of the taste profile. Yeah, shout out to all the Filipinos in the audience. I have a shocking amount of stories about bathtub wampum dog. Oh. So. What am I going to do a ube ice cream? I mean, you, you should just be doing that recreationally. The ice cream. Well, ice cream. Hey, this is a quick question. You guys watch the anime? No, I don't. I just watched um, about a fifth of the last. You know how in most animes, there's the summer episode? Yes. Everyone eats popsicles? Yes. Yeah, like Kingdom Hearts 2. Yeah. So, the thing that I've always wondered. Animes always depict the yeah. popsicles as bright neon sky blue. Yes. What the fuck flavor is sky blue neon blue? Well, what in in Kingdom Hearts, it's sea salt ice cream. Yeah, it's sea salt ice cream. What the fuck is sea salt ice cream? What the fuck are you talking about? Sea salt ice cream. Learn a little. Get you some culture. Yeah, Kingdom Hearts culture. What flavor is sea salt ice cream? I'm, I'm gonna wager it's supposed to be some sort of shitty blue. 
Uh, I'm now looking at, at multiple blue ice cream and saying that it's sea salt ice cream. I thought that was an anime thing. What the fuck is this? I've had that, um, god, what, what's that moon ice cream? Like, Dippin' um, Dots? Astronaut ice cream? Astronaut ice cream? No, 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 no. There's some sort of, like, not Dip. blue moon. There's a special blue ice cream that it's, like, called blue something. Um, the Blue Danube. I think it is called Blue Moon. It's like a Midwest, Midwestern thing. It tastes like marshmallows. Oh, Moon Pop? Moon Pop, yeah. A Moon Pop. Okay. But anyways. That's a thing. Yeah, Blue Moon ice cream is an unusual thing. It has like a... Because it has... I'm pretty sure it has um, some sort of uh, marshmallowy thing. If you don't like marshmallows, which I'm not a huge fan of marshmallows. How dare you? Like, I don't like peep. How dare you? Wait, you're a pro peeps person? Yeah, I'm a peep peep. I'm Richie one of them peeps. I'm one of them peep right. peeps. I got three slices left. I guess I'm fucking them up with this seed, sesame seed. Hell yeah. Good for you. Take your brain, bitch. gonna regret that yep um i'm gonna be honest with you when i have things that use sesame seed oil it's usually like asian takeout and it usually but, asks you to not put very much what does this taste like sesame seeds what do sesame seeds taste like uh, you're just your family is at least partially Japanese. How do you not know? Well, I mean, usually these things have multiple different things in them. Okay, so here's the thing. Sesame seeds taste very like a mild nut. Yes. Peak oil is that flavor concentrated, and you... So it's going to taste like strong, toasted nut. Oh, okay, like cashew. No. Uh, oh, but... Uh, like in that chestnuts, like roasted chestnuts. Yes, that's chestnuts. closer. It smells smoky. Yeah, the, that's what the smell is strong. Oh. All that rope. Good. All right, so we got three slices left. If anyone, I've got 100% cocoa powder. We've got a grapefruit over here. Ugh. This cray claw is no joke. What's I was actually much of this stuff in here. Yeah, you, yeah, the, the right amount is about, like, a... I think I ruined this pizza. Yeah, a thimble of sesame seed pow uh, oil is probably enough. There's, like, a puddle on top of this one, pepper. Oh, no, that's, you did that's too much. <laughs> I knew this was a good idea. This is... So to be fair, this is another yet another situation where had ZP ever encountered food before, he would have known. Similar to like the time he put, um, similar to the time he had edamame and then just didn't take the shell like the pods off, and he was like, "This tastes like garbage." And we were like, "What are you even doing?" He's like, "The pods are so hard to eat," and we were like, "Well, yeah, because you take the pods off." Oh god, I gotta eat like two more slices of this. Is it good though? No. <laughs> Is it on. good though? I, um, I think that it's good if I had done the right amount. I like the woody, kind of smoky flavor. Like, it, it's basically liquid nut flavor. Liquid nut! Fuck, Fuck me. Camera, please. Camera, camera, please. There we go. So, uh, yeah, I blew up its leg. All right. Kids, you know. Oh, ah, I was close that time. 
Okay, I, I think I've got the uh, the tactics for Cray Claw here. Yo, ZP. They made a robot version of uh, oh, that wow. crayfish enemy from uh, Final Fantasy V. Let me ask you this. I've, uh, I've not uh, a lot of this game on me. How much of this is Final Fantasy I? Like, clearly it's not... I know. How much of it is Final Fantasy I? Um, yeah. So, I would. How much do you want me to tell you? I mean, I guess I'm gonna play this probably really. Um, the so, maybe not too much. The story is definitely couched in Final Fantasy 1. It definitely uses Final Fantasy 1 to. The framework of that story is 100% of this game. Uh. Now, whether it stays that way, Fuck me. is another question. Oh. That was somehow worse than the gamer feel. Well, yeah, you put way too much. Two slices left. I've got 100% cocoa powder. I've got spicy jelly beans. Motherfuckers. I have Sambald. I'll put Sambald on this shit if you donate 50 bucks. Sambald's delicious. I put it on something that I drenched with, uh... Stop shooting me with guns. Evil Crayclaw. I think it's not fair that this game has an enemy who has guns. This is just someone from my Twitch chat saying, this is pure cinematic gold, and this is anti-ASMR. <laughs> oh, donation came into someone. Let me see who got a donation. Let's play this game. Uh, so it just, um, I, it just I, I went to the guess, team. Uh, G Gino, you are definitely unfamiliar with uh, Six Ages and also King of Dragon Pass. Jeff, how familiar are you with uh, King of Dragon Pass? Conceptually. Hmm. Conceptually? Okay. So, let's go ahead and click play. Oh, that's right. Guy said if he's gonna make more games after this. Is that a threat or is that a thing you would want? Uh, let's just play uh, OG vanilla ride like the wind. And the turbulent god war. God's war. There are opportunities for humans to change the world forever. Coming next. Lights going out. Can you survive when the world is broken and the gods are dead? Sounds like Final Fantasy Lightning the world reborn episode three rebuild a shattered land and bring a glorious new dawn to the world no one can make me bring a new dawn to anything oh goodness okay i'm gonna bounce enjoy your pizza All right, I am now back in my own chat. I think my nails are mostly dry. I've been playing the playing the game now. I think I was actually having more success technically when I was uh Oh, I should not be in thief mode. I should be in breaker mode. Because I actually want to be very far from this enemy. I want to be poking. Oh, the stupid... That double double stab in the front messes me up. Okay, I accidentally equipped the wrong weapon there, so... 
Let me try a different one. Reminder, I am now uh, about $100 away from having to do, I think, $100 away? I, okay, I'm about $200 away from having to style my hair however you sickos want me to. Oh, I didn't want Chakra. I wanted Lancet. What? That's never how it. That's never what its pattern is. It uses. It usually uses repulsion field. And then it uses wave cannon. Fucked up, Cray Claw. Spin move. Let me out of your arms, please. Get him. Missile barrage, go. Yes, wave cannon. Yeah, blow its arms up. Blow it up. Ah, uh, no. Get him, crew. Yes. Ah, one of the hairs is touching my nose. Okay, phase two. Take a graviton. Ah, died. Giga graviton, that's messed up. Gotta watch out for that. Okay, but I've got a good strategy now. And it involves poking it. Always be hitting this thing in the side. It does not fear us. It does not fear us. Please let me out of your your cray claws. Use 
music's real good. Oh, that one just barely touched me. Damn it. Just barely just nicked me. Drat. Blockable versus unblockable attack. Do you a word game? I wish I could do something to get my lance just like a little bit more punch to it. Please don't go after me. Oh no! Oh right, I can't scratch my head. Mash him. Okay, get about 100 HP back per attack. Oh, no. Ah, oh, the stupid tail. I can't believe this is the, like, next level after Merolith. Difficulty spike. Just due to damage output. Ugh. Got pinned and got wrecked. I felt a donation vibration. Heh. <laughs> ah. Oh. Rory created another page for himself and donated ten dollars to it. Now he's got two different <laughs> two different puppy pictures. Blood weapon, lancet. Get out of the way of this wave cannon. Pop off with my team. Ah, uh, that shit. About missed me. Ah, uh, the wind up for its different moves look very similar. Yes, blow up.
That'll do it. Second form. Oh no! Camera. Camera against big enemies with low ceilings. Like, just make the ceiling higher. You know? Just make the ceiling higher. But I got a breaker upgrade, so... Let's go to the job tree, see what I can get. Overpower. A powerful long-range attack can only be used by Lightbringers active using this will end lightbringer okay i don't necessarily want that action ability mp costs minus six Ooh. increases physical damage dealt um starfall hit the ground with your axe that's an axe move let's do that If I use Anima, oh, it takes a lot of Anima to level this up. Don't want to waste my Anima on this. Excellent. This thing is crazy tail guns. Come on! When it corners itself, it really makes it tough to actually hurt it. Magic might... Honestly, I'm not using my uh, thief at all. So maybe if I um, get my second job and instead of making it thief, let's try... Oh, can I actually... I mean, it doesn't much matter which weapon I'm equipped with. As long as it can be a black mage... Black Mage, yep. And then Magister's Club instead. What's Black Mage look like? That is the swirly thing. Imbue Lightning, yep. That's what I want. Let's try Black Mage. Maybe that's the secret.
Okay, magics. Magic seemed like the seems like this was the correct approach. Uh. Optical camouflage does definitely make it hard to tell what move it's going to do. That is as articulated. Oh, we got some donations have come in. Jan got a donation. I mean, ZP got a donation from Jan. Cool. Did I get anything? No. Okay, let's take this thing out. I think just getting a black mage involved is a pretty significant upgrade over what I've been doing. Oh, that really hit me? Oh, that shouldn't have hit. Yes, use wave cannon. That'll do it. Down it goes. First form down. Second form time. Rip this thing up. Missile barrage, huh? Okay, it's coming after me. Really coming after me. Keep thundogging it. Boom. Yes, I'm keeping track of the potions. Giga Graviton, nope. Oh, no! Okay, that one was going pretty well until the last second there. Dang.
think I've got its I think I've got its number now though. Got to its second form. I am getting more MP every time I beat its first form. Oh awesome, wave cannon to start. Great. I'm not the one you want to get, dude. They're messing you up. does not fear us. Boom. Let's jack up magics. Yeah. First form down. Yeah, I was really trying to do this the hard way. This is really a magic fight. Oh, no. with the good stuff. No, I think I'm going to drink it like water. Oh, I'll go down. Oh, no. Damn it. I was like, ah, oh, damn it, race. Very end of the fight. I got the no. I thought I was gonna kill it right there. Thank you for using wave cannon first, my friend. Get him. Yeah, first form down. Let's take this thing out. your good shit. Oh, I thought that would do it. I thought that would give me another spell. There we go. Oh, no. Oh. 
Yeah! Get got, Crayclaw. Uh-oh. It's gonna blow up. Crystallized. Yeah! Magics. Jed, no. Uh oh. What? Just tell me what you need me to do. No, no, Dad, stop it. Shut up. But if I become a warrior of light, where would I come back? Ain't nobody around here anyway. What? So it looks like Jed and Jack, look at their budding relationship. Magister's Club. Anima Shards. Memories of Water. Okay, I've got the water level coming up. Oh, it's, it's the Mako Reactor. That looks like the Mako Reactor. Sunken Shrine. Well, before I do that, let's go to the job trees. I think I can level some stuff up. Black Mage. Spark Strike. Tall Strike. Frost Swing. I guess I'll work my way towards Sage. Unlocks Meteor. Sweet. Let's talk to people. Biggs and Wedge. Reports say the pirates are running amok nearby. Uh, whatever you call them. Be on alert for those murder. <laughs> I understand the pirates have slaughtered their way nearly to the city wall. Just one out. <laughs> Farm done for. Your ship has swallowed my crop. The violent storms wash away what little's left. I see a sign. The land screaming for the water to take fire. Oh no. What will happen if the harvest fails? Should be obvious. Greedy folks are always. Thanks for those greedy fools hoarding supplies. My Dinner table's looking mighty bare. Why isn't the king doing anything? Too busy up on his lofty throne to help us simple folk. Mm, getting texts. Why isn't the king? Jack, please restore the crystal and it's true. We're your warriors of light, aren't we? It's your duty to save us. Like those villainous scoundrels over at Provence are trying to shirk their loot. We should seal off the bridge before they come across the loot and plunder. These nails are ridiculous. Okay, 
Okay, Sunken Shrine. I think it's worth me doing a side quest or something. I could use some Anima Shards, even if, like, the items are useless. Just getting some levels. Good old Dimension 2. At the far side of it, any major rumors speak of a world steeped in cunning artifice. Rules by a sovereign with a penchant for precious tyranny. This cozy little keep was modeled on the location of great significance to said despot. So I'm told if that's true, it must be a potent nexus of energy to twist this world to my erstwhile master's design. Of course, it's only true if I continue to play the part of the faithful tool. Uh, so that's got to be Dark Knight. Um, let me actually if switch to Thief. Let's get some Thief levels. Oh, what was the mission? Defeat a Ravenous Coral. Okay. Oh no. You're out of the woods yet. Ravenous coral. Is this Ooh, trove of tears? Let's be quick. Come on, follow me. Snore. Okay. I'll take that. I got bubble tape and Tic Tacs, but I shouldn't eat. I shouldn't eat on stream. I shouldn't. I definitely shouldn't chew gum on stream. Meats made it. Nice. Glad to see it. These skeletons up. I think I get more experience for killing them the explodey way, as well as just more loot. Assume, just loot, just loot. This level is the closest this game gets to uh, Souls kind of semi-organic design. <laughs> Goblin, you can't hurt me. Oh, 
Ah. Okay, is the coral here? No, crimson ramparts. I can unpass most of these things. Treasure chest. Treasure. So this is the direction to go. I'm just gonna run past most of this stuff. I just need to find the door and then move on. Ooh, I got an Automa shard. Automa shards are what I'm looking for. Reminder, this is a community fundraiser for Pencils of Promise, a charity that builds schools, trains teachers, and sends kids to school in developing nations. For $20, I will sing you an emo ballad from one of my many, one of the many emo songs I learned for the purposes of this stream. I also am $200 away from styling my hair however y'all choose. Fauxhawk, some sort of anime style. You know, it's really up to you. Stay on them. Um, bam. For only $20. Look at how ridiculous I already look. You can make it even worse. How do I get down there? That is clearly where I need to go. I saw a coral down there. Does this door not open? This door doesn't open. So there's got to be another path. There's clearly a door downstairs. Can I fall down or jump down? Oh, there's stairs. Okay. This music's not bad. Hey, Ravenous Coral. Right back at you, you dummy. Rock their jaw, Jack. Boom explosion. Got the mission. Oh, I'm going to have to break down some items for sure. Ooh, we got more donations coming in. Hey! Nice to see from uh, Meets of Evil. Hitting their goal. Let's go to the smithy and break, dismantle stuff. Okay, dismantle. Oh, select all. Uh, dismantle all. And then here. Come down and dismantle the 
most of the cheap stuff. Basically everything other lo under level 50 is useless now. I have outscaled it. It's amazing they give you so much stuff when it all gets so outclassed so fast. Like why bother giving me so many items? Job tree. Mage. Ooh, mage leveled up. Unlock Mage's Metal. Thief. Nice, I can unlock Assassin. Ooh, cool. I'll keep leveling up the Thief because I would like a Ninja as well. Scarlet Memories of the Savior. Okay. Sure. Let's do this mission. Good old Dimension 2. Let's loot this place clean. Shall we get this expedition underway? Ah. Fine, jerk. I was gonna just cast a spell. But no. Oh, this is a short mission. Nice. Punch. Punch, punch, punchy, punch, punch. Oh, get up, Jack. Puke more out. No, 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 no. You're not reloading. That's not a thing that's happening. Next room. Ah, cubes. <laughs> Incredible. Every time they say it, it's great. Ah, cubes. As we go downstairs and take on the next enemy.
have sworn I had blood weapons. There we go. Spit more enemies out. can't hurt me fast enough that I can't just heal through it. Spit out more enemies. more enemies. There we go. Last enemy. What's up? Is that everything? What's the last enemy? It's a boss, I assume. Like an honest to goodness boss. I like this. This is a short little mission. The other ones have had a lot more exploration. Look, cubes. Boss, what do we got? Black Knight again. This thing is a real uh, Dark Souls enemy. A uh, real Elden Ring enemy, more than anything. There goes your horsey. Dead. Bye, Black Knight. Oh, no. Guess you're done. <laughs> Job to level up. Nice. Able to do, uh, get my thief levels without having to do too much crazy stuff. Without just getting worked endlessly. Um, what was it that I wanted to... Right. So, job trees. Let's upgrade. Nah, can't upgrade thief anymore. The Wicked Arbor. I don't have a second mission there. Boo. Set me back to the FF9 level. Don't have a second mission in the FF10 level either. Indigo Memories, The Humiliated. Okay. Red to 13, yep. A Darkness Generator. Let's go. Beat all flans. Well, I had to go this way anyway. Next. Beat the crap. 
crap out of that flan. One flan down. I flan bait it. There has to have been a Final Fantasy enemy called Flan Bay by now, right? Some sort of fire flan. Down the wolves. More wolves. Is that where I came from? No, I don't think so. I think I came from that way. No flans over here. There's a flan. Here we are. Let's take out that flan. Flan number two, dead. Nice try, Crawler. No water elemental. You're not going to get to cast spells on me. So let me travel somewhere. Here's another flaunt. Another one. Marlboro two. <laughs> Meteor. Sweet. <laughs> that texture did not even know what to do. More, of those cubes. Let's More cubes. Flan. One more flan left. Probably up this rope. These missions are real cleanup duty. There it is. Only have to take out the flaunt, so just go after the focus on this. Oh no, I died. Gross. Oh, I can upgrade my thief, I think, now. More thief stuff. Let's get mug. Get up this rope. Beeline for the flan. Make the and that'll do it. Mission over.
Horror of Current. What does this do? It, the game doesn't really give give me any explanation for what the hell those things are. I know what the Anima Shark does. I don't know what anything else does. Oh, ZP got a uh, $15 donation. Cool. Reminder, $20, $20 donation. Happy to sing. Sing you an emo song. Completed. Completed. Smith's Hammer. One? Okay, sure. These seem to be fast. Fool's Missive. Defeat all Master Tomberries. You're not Tomberries. You're not Tomberries. Don't need that. Not Tonberries. There's a Tonberry. Oh, you. Okay, y'all still hit hard. <laughs> okay. Tonberries still hit like a truck. Even low level Tonberries. Kill it. Bye, Tom Barry. Running past them is not that much faster than just punching them to death. Tomberry this way. Took down one Master Tomberry. Okay. It's another set of cubes. I'm glad they chose this uh, section of Final Fantasy 13 because it's one of the better um, it's one of the better songs, I think. And FF thirteen. Let's see what's inside. There you are. There's the plants, there's the cubes. Dry this out now that I'm on the other side. Now we can go down the hole. Tomberries. There's a Tomberry.
Oh, wow. Master's knife just kills you. One hit. Just can't get hit. Okay. Everyone's grudge. Get him. No. Damn it. Master's knife is no joke. <laughs> Thank you. Of course. Thank you so much, BT Evil. Uh, have a good, uh, Rest of your day, get some much earned, some well earned rest. Oh, this thing just one hit kills you. Oh, someone got a donation. ZP got a donation. Take out these tomberries. Don't want to get stabbed. Can't get stabbed. Oh no, numb. Was the master tomberry listening to uh, my rendition of Lincoln Park's "Numb"? Who's to say? I don't feel like I crossed any any threshold that would have gotten me knocked down. Am I dead? I'm dead. This sucks. Oh, Rio's in. Let me bop that over. Did someone just donate to me? Or does he pee again? Someone got a donation. Also ZP. Oh, the totals just didn't calculate. All right, let me get Rio in. Just going to make that change, and then I'll kill these Tomberries. Shadow down. Second shadow. Getting the shit punched out of it. Shadow down. Third shadow. Down.
No. Oh, I, I parried the master's knife. Ah, oh, I didn't parry that one, though. Everyone's grudge hits hard. Like, even when I rush this thing down, it if it just uses one of the moves where it can't take damage. Oh, no, no, no. All right, looks like Rory's coming in. Nice. Let's see what's inside. Let's not see what's inside. Oh, I survived that one. Uh, uh, sometimes it gets stunned, sometimes it doesn't. I don't know when the Master Tomberries, or Tomberries will get stunned by me just wailing on them, and when they just bounce off of it. It's very unclear to me. I am slowed. Please actually focus on the Tonberry. Oof. There's so many attacks. Oh, I'm dead now. Alright, what can I do here? Definition of insanity, so... Quagga. Quagga again. Get him, girls. Teleporting to me? Rude. No! Yes. Pet the Tonberry. It's a real, you pet it, and then it's like, I don't feel so good, Mr. Jack. That's how Barry's dead. Now I guess I come back up here. Use the cube and hit the weather controls. See if that opens up anything to me. So I can't go down there anymore. Can go over here though. 
Ah, oh, there's pirates. I don't remember there being pirates here before. Oh, dang it, that's, that's how I get to this area again. Just made a big old circle. But maybe I can go back that way that I just did. Go up here, drop down, and is there a Tonberry up here? In this direction? Pirates. Okay, yep, that's what I need to do. I need to make it watery. Then I need to come over here. Piratas. Just hit that guy to hit him. Didn't even need to. Just seemed like a putz. Pirates, I guess crystallizing the pirates was just a step too far for this game. Can't crystallize people. There should be a Tonberry at the end of this, I would think. Let's be quick. Come on, follow me. There it is. Oh, hit me. Nope. Ah. Stupid pirates. My pirate one. Nope. My pirate two. I knocked it off the cliff. Great. Donations start to come in, probably for Rory. Yep. Can I see what a silver plate or, or Smith's hammer... Oh, I can now upgrade stuff at the smith. I was mostly doing this for the Anima shards. Sunken Shrine. Okay, so before I go in there, let's go to the job tree. Let's upgrade my Black Mage. Yeah, let's get Dark... Oh, I already unlocked Dark Knight. Um, Black Mage Mastery. Unlock Sage. Upgrade some stuff for Knuckles, because I use them a lot. Battle settings. I mean, that's fine. This looks like a uh, Mako reactor. When in doubt. A facility for harvesting energy of the planet. Not unusual in Dimension 7, the place that inspired this particular work. In fact, that harvesting mechanism is modeled in detail here to serve as a safety repository for the water crystal. Using collected energy as a power source, the crystal was intended to control the waters of the world in an attempt to maintain balance. The great power of water to nourish causes the absorption of too much energy and prayer. 
However, regardless of whether good or ill, in this end, this will cause the crystal to fall to corruption, and its fall and its fall will twist the world to dark ends. something to confess, just like Ben did. You see, I'm not like you guys. I was born here. <gasps> For the longest time, I couldn't remember how I got here. But now I do. The one who gave it to me, her name's Astra. I remember meeting oh, no. her in the Chaos Star. She gave me the crystal and told me I'd be needing it. I took it from her and yielded to the darkness. The next thing I knew, you guys were there. That sure beats my confession. I felt like I had been waiting for that moment for a long time. But I don't remember much anymore. All I know now is that I want to see this through to the end. And I want it just as badly as you guys do. I won't give up. I know we can do this together. Find something weird and you're out. <laughs> right. Don't do anything weird. Nice. Let me actually, while I'm here, you could stand to be a knight for a second. Or a sword fighter. Yeah. And then you could stand to be a mage because getting those stats up will eventually help. Looks like we're near it'll, it'll make their red mages abilities and those other abilities stronger. Yeah. Mess them up. Uh. Make them say, uh. Uh. Deny, deny. I'll take that. Doesn't. Oh. I gotta get a card key. Because this is the FF7 level. I think donations came in. I'm not sure who for, though. Just get a regular email. Yep, just got a regular email. Check in. Make sure I'm not missing anything. Right. 
Oh. That is indeed an exploding canister. safe into the animation. Just cast some water. Yeah, just just hold still. Just stand right there. Smoke here. Must be sure it comes with. Donations coming in, it looks like. R Rory, if I had to guess. <laughs> They're giving me cubes real fast now. <laughs> I know those things. Princess said it on a loop. Oh god. But it caught the devil. Everyone from there. Do you know that yet? No, don't show me. Yes. Gigant axe. Oh, treasure chests are good again. And I actually want to open them. And if you were thinking, yes, I am in fact just kind of running around with my characters in their underwear. Yeah, dumpster this guy. Uh. Look at all the electricity coming out of that thing. We should definitely keep a wipe on it. No, no white winding yourself. Take out the sea devil. Boom. Crystallize everything. Yeah, mess up that generator. Way to go, Jack. You beat the crap out of that inanimate object. I don't know what's good against the corals. Okay, it's Earth. Yeah. Oh. 
Gotta take out the soldier before it gets up. Stormbreaker. Stormbreaker not that good. I I should really should really try um, unlocking the other elemental attacks. Dara is good enough. Dundaga. Ah, stop knocking me down. Me alone. Oh, wow. That thing really hits hard. Can't go that way yet. Oh, I I did level some stuff up, so let's spend some points. Black Mage level up. Where's the lightning strike? Spark strike. Equip that. Aftershock element earth. I want spark strike. Stat bonus spirit raises to your mace and a CL enemy instead of flying. Let's do fire. Frost swing, lightbreaker duration, elemental break damage. Yep, those are the only two. I can unlock anything. The game's pretty smart about telling you you have points, but not enough to do anything with them. Let's go. More traps to this place, Got another thief job level. That was the room with the weird generator. Let's be quick. Come on, follow me. Oh, I can open the shortcut. That was the bad room. Dumpster him. Dumpster this one. Oh, did I die? Dang it. I looked down because I saw a donation and said, hey, donation ping. And then I 
did not even pay attention to what was going on on the screen. Dang it. Donations are flowing in. But where's the shortcut? I opened the shortcut. There we go. Good level design, like good, good use of uh, shortcuts. Good use of. Um, okay, can't open that yet. Well, at least they all have elemental vulnerabilities I can exploit. But this is a real dangerous location. Time to go to war with you. I love the way Jack runs with this club. to water spray. Ah! Oh, I got hit while I was on the ground. Boo. This runs so good. Do I even have to kill all these dudes? Can I just run past them? I think I can. I can. Yeah. There's nothing stopping me from running past them. the generator. I haven't found any keys yet. Hey Jack, what <laughs> do you think of Princess Dara? What? At least let's not talk of the past. I'm asking about you now. I've got no interest in her as a person, but I know I have to protect her at all costs. Well, she is the symbol of hope and peace in Cornelia, after all. So you really want to put something on the map? Then how about becoming a knight? That's up to the royal family. Even if you were a knight. <laughs> I 
Let's pretend we didn't see this submarine thing. Must be the key to that door. Right. That means we can continue our search. There we go. Use keys to open doors. White materia, black materia, white card key, black card key. By the way, why were those pirates so upset? By now they are at the mercy of the winds. But if we revive the water custom, we can restore the balance. Sea will be itself again. Be itself? I admit I'm unclear on the details. <laughs> I doubt those pirates know either. Something tells me they would be in a bad mood either way. This looks good. Let's take it. We've come pretty far down. Water crystal can't be too far off now. Let's go. Black card key. Looks like this key won't work. Where is it? We're safe for now. I can keep going. I heard cactar sounds, but I can't see the cactar. Neon.
Oh no! Ah! Uh, this thing has a ton of HP. Just a ton. Okay. Oh, this opens now. Is this a shortcut? Okay. Lufenian logs. The powerful hatred of chaos has been implanted in the strangers provide the drive to seek out and destroy darkness we had attempted direct control through them during previous cycles but though initial results were promising the experiment had ended in utter failure when a single stranger was possessed by darkness and transformed into chaos until this point chaos was understood to be a mere concept we paid a heavy price to learn that if conditions are right it can manifest into a physical vessel and cause significant and sustained disruption by weighing the balance heavily in favor of darkness a more troublesome hiccup however was the abilities given to strangers backfired on us appears that any stranger possessed by darkness will leave behind echoes of their memories that somehow cannot be scrubbed even by a world reset. Further research is required to discover methods by which these stains can be purged. There's a shortcut. We can cross over to the other side now. Ah, oh, cubes. I'll check it out. Ah, cubes. This is definitely the biggest environment I've been in. Okay, and that's where I felt the Sahaj increased. This is where I went after. Try and go get that Marlboro. See if I can take it out. It is very strong, though. But this time I've got MP to soften it up before I go down after it. Look at it sleeping, just hanging out. Big fire. Oh, I thought I blocked that. Uh, I guess I'll try this way. I've gone the other ways already. I'm just so concerned about Pisca demons that I have not, not gone this way. Open that yet. All right. So there's not actually anything to go this way. Anything to do over here. This is where you are, Jatsu? Nope, there's a Tonberry. 
if you want to chat, I can hop into one of the chats. Um, let me go into. I don't know if you want to. I'm in stream commentary. Howdy. Hello there. Whoa. Hang on, I need to change this thing. All right, I need to go back down here and then to the left. Dock of Planet's Woes. So do you have any idea what's going on yet? Because I don't know what the hell's going on yet in this game. Yeah, so um, these people came from some other world. Uh... That seems to be controlled by some folks called the Lethenians, which may or may not have something to do with Final Fantasy Opera Omnia. I am not clear on that because, like I said before, Lethenia is a thing from Opera Omnia. I don't know if Opera Omnia got it from this or vice versa or if it's like a Dissidia thing because I have not played that much Dissidia. But there's basically this other world that these characters are pulled in from and then once they are pulled in, they are brainwashed, basically, to kill chaos. Like, they are filled with the insatiable need to kill chaos because this world is uh, balanced such that light and dark are always in balance. When they're in balance, everything's good. But if at any point... Yeah, and... Uh... What do you mean? Uh, I said the word reset. Is it self-aware? So, the game, so far, it looks... Um... Where is this enemy? I hear a cactuar. Where is it? It's bouncing around. Yeah, those things are very sneaky. They're always hiding all over the place. Um, so cool. yeah, Where the when Hello the world you. like the world has these two um it's got light and dark. Light and dark need to be in balance. If they are not in balance, bad stuff happens. Ah. Ah, stop messing me up. Good explosions. I just want to confirm. So, have you purified all four crystals? I've purified three crystals. I this is the oh, okay. fourth. Okay, so this is where the fourth crystal gets yes. purified. Yes. Okay, because I did purify the next crystal. It's just after this I stopped. So. Yeah. So, basically, there are four, um, four crystals. Each of the crystals controls an element, but they are mostly there to like make this world. Like, I don't know how to describe it. Like, imbalance. Like, balance is all that matters. Um, if there's too much light, bad stuff happens. If there's too much dark, bad stuff happens. So, these strangers have been put here with the insatiable urge to defeat chaos, to keep darkness at bay. Um, because, I guess, things, uh, if left to their own devices, edge towards darkness by default. So... The strangers, the titular strangers of paradise. Oh no, did I get put to sleep? No. The titular strangers are from another world, put into this world specifically to deal with chaos and darkness. Sounds to me like this is just Kingdom Hearts. Yes, kinda. It's all about balance. It, it's also FF3, kinda. FF3 also has a big, like, actually... All light is also bad. You need balance. That makes sense. Balance in the force, you see. Balance in all things. Yes. It's something a StarCraft character says, I think. Maybe. Die! <laughs> you noxious beast. Please. But I see that you have... So you have the fifth character at this point too. Yeah, yes. you have to. Yes, I get the you get the fifth character from beating Tiamat. Cuz she is Tiamat. Yeah, they make it painfully obvious that like these people are becoming these fiends. Yes. So, oh, oh, I thought I was going to die there for a second. Even if the people themselves don't realize it. Yeah, so it, it the uh, log that I just saw basically said um, if you are if you're one of these people who's sent into this world, 
um, you, like, once you get there, if you get overtaken by chaos uh, or darkness, you become a fiend. Oh, let's see. Uh, through the total qualities of darkness and light are managed directly on site, and we receive regular updates from agents. We have yet to return any results of significance. When the information our collaborator shared with us, it is uncertain and uh, uh, unstable nature of human emotions that is the primary cause for a lack of success. To expand on this, our collaborator has expanded that the light of order and the darkness of chaos have but one source. The emotions generated by the human heart, the balance of the world, can easily tip towards light or dark so long as humans exist to weigh the scales. It's my humble opinion that a drastic solution to the human problem is necessary to s solve this particularly thorny issue. So whoever uh, is writing these logs is just like, yo, kill all the people. The only, what if everyone was dead? The only way to be sure is to kill all the people. If there are no humans, then there's no darkness or light. Yes. There's just nothing. There's only the abyss. Get back here, Cactua. Ah, I shot it in the wrong direction. Get over it. Hold still. Cactuars. Ah, it killed me. This sucks. Ah, now I gotta go back there. See where we are at. And a reminder, this is a charity stream. For $20, I will sing an emo ballad. That is my donation, ongoing donation incentive. Um, I am trying to reach $2,500, and I am at over 2000 which means I've painted my nails now, as per my donation incentives. Ah, damn. That meant that I was I was fighting one boss with just my left hand and then just my right hand for a while. Normally people are doing that for very different reasons. I know. When my wife was doing my nails, I was like, you know, normally when people say hand check, I need to see both of your hands on the table. It's very mm -hmm. different reasons. And she said, is that a real thing? And I'm like, yes. She's just, and then she just replied, men are gross. You know, technically, women could be asked yep. to have a hand check as well. That's that's true. Technically, anyone. You know, yeah, it anyone brings us all together. Parts. Anyone, anyone with, with hands. Parts. All parts. Anyone with hands can be asked for a hand check. Even where... if you have hooks for hands, technically. Ah! That would be ah! dangerously. Oh, so, uh, you still feeling good on this game? Like, you think this is yes. a good game? Yes. Yes. I have two large concerns. One, we got two FF12 levels. Why? Yeah, that is a little weird. Why 12? Why that one? And one uh, of them was straight up just... A, it was just that temple... The, what, the Tomb of the King or something like that? Yeah, but, I mean, the tomb... The tomb of, uh... Right? Hmm... Wraith, King Wraithwall's yeah, tomb. It also had the it also had the tower. The Pharaoh's lighthouse. So it had. It had the lighthouse. It had the. Uh, so it was the lighthouse and King Wraithwall's tomb, like you said. That's a. Um, that's a lot for FF12. I'm not a big yes. 12 person. I agree. So I would have liked, you know, a second 10 level instead, perhaps. Which, uh, what did it say this level was based on? This is 7. This is the Mako Reactor. Ah, uh, yes, okay. You're right, you're right. Okay, now I'm seeing it now, yeah. I'm not sure if you've gotten to it yet or not, but there's one that says, like, oh, this one really should have based up, been based off of Dimension 5, but instead they just did something random, and you're like, well, why did you even tell us that? Then? How did I get hit? Oh, you followed me here. How did you... I was like, how did I even get electrocuted? I thought that was a trap. Oh, oh. I got... I got lost here for a while. This is a very big level. Yeah, this part specifically, it kind of wants you to do some sort of weird like thing where you're going back and forth to activate bridges so you can keep going down. It's just... Yeah. Um, the Mako reactor thing... I get it. This is a this is easily the biggest level I've been in so far. Uh, okay, so I don't want to go there yet. 
I was able to finally open that door, and that got me a sweet samurai sword, which maybe I do that instead of black mage. I mean, experimenting is always uh, interesting in this game. I, I, it I is. Like doing it. Yeah, rarity five. And I like how they let you have two jobs active at once. So, like, worst case scenario, if you're in a tight spot, you can switch to something you're more comfortable with. Yeah. It's just weird. Like this, I feel like this is the best Final Fantasy game that's been released in years, and I'm I'm sad about it. It's seven. Seven remake is very good. That is that is true. Seven remake is very good. It's this game and Seven remake, the two best Final Fantasy games in years. Ha. Zantetsuken's fun. I don't know that it's good, but it is definitely fun. Is that the one where you, uh... You just hold still, and if... If you get them, they just explode. Oh, shit. Watch. Oh, that's right. That's ha! After something that's like Odin's move. Odin does? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm dead. Dang it. I Zantetsuken two of them, and the one that didn't explode killed me so zantetsuken in the, in the next. if you use this move and it's lethal they explode into they get crystallized that's a nice touch and it does intense uh break damage but this game is insane to me like just everything about this game is insane to me that it's good that it's it's well made like so yeah. I was thinking last night, because after you play a game for 12 hours, that's all you're allowed to think about. Um, mm -hmm. I was thinking, you know, what makes this work for me when the Kingdom Hearts storytelling doesn't, right? So they're both like, what's a flimsy pretext we can have for running through levels or places that people remember from other popular works, right? So like, this is running you through Final Fantasy worlds. Um, Kingdom Hearts is running you through Disney World. Why does the Disney World stuff in Kingdom Hearts bother me, but this doesn't? And um, I think the root cause of why I like what they do here, <clears throat> as opposed to what they do in Kingdom Hearts, is that there's no character building in this game. Like, it's not trying to do... Like, retell the stories of Final Fantasies. It's just giving you, like, hey, here's a location you recognize. So they take the easiest, most recognizable parts of... Like, they take levels. They don't take people or story or any of that. So in that case, yeah. if you want to give me... You need to come up with reasons why, like, your character's running through the Mako reactor. And what they did was, like, okay, this world is this weird artificial thing... So, it, it's it's very much like a machine version of Final Fantasy VII. It's not actually Final Fantasy VII. Whereas uh, Kingdom Hearts is like, no, Sora, Donald, and Goofy are in hanging out with Aladdin, doing Aladdin's story. Yeah, like you're not reenacting the story to Final. Like you're not you're not in that tree like watching Exodeth kill Galef or yes. you know, watching Tella suicide himself with Meteor or even watching Aerith get stabbed with you know they're, they're, not, they're not saying like oh look at these cool moments that you remember yes we're just doing them again they're they're doing their own thing yes just using familiar locations they're saying hey here are these familiar locations and wait isn't something weird going on that you recognize all these locations that's real yeah. weird and it's not overt at first. No. Like, if you're not paying attention to those loading screens, you wouldn't even notice. And then at a certain point, you're just like, wait a minute, I recognize this song. This looks like... I recognize this place. Final Fantasy X. That's weird. Oh, there's the Faith. What the hell's going on here? Or, like, you know, it, it's saying, like, here are these locations from other games, and boy, isn't it weird that they're here and they're all just a little off. It also helps that the arrangement, the musical arrangements they do are just really well made. They're really well made. Like, a lot of what they're doing from a story perspective, they have come up with a connective tissue, and it's... The game is about the connective tissue, but they're not... They're not beating you over, over the head with the original... Like, the stories from the other games. So this doesn't feel like a distraction. Yeah. 
And I think Final Fantasy 1 works perfectly for that because really what is the story for Final Fantasy 1? Yeah. It kind of puts you in a case where they think, oh, this is a remake, and then they kind of pull the wool from underneath you, and you're like, wait a minute, there's something weird going on. And they've also already, like, Final Fantasy 9 is kind of a retelling of Final Fantasy 1. Like, there are so many games in the Final Fantasy series that boy, when you boil down to it are like, here's Final Fantasy 1 again. 4 also does this. Like, there's four fiends, there's darkness, we need to defeat darkness, right? Yep. Uh, I don't think Breaker is good against bosses. It's kind of like the Bioshock trick at the end, where it's like, oh, there's always a lighthouse, there's always this. Exactly. Thing. Instead of the Final Fantasy games, there's always a Sid, there's always a Chocobo. Yes. Darkness, chaos, death. Dark chaos, yeah, exactly. So, like, get with that in mind, I think that this works way better than a lot of the other games in this vein because like specifically kingdom hearts because kingdom hearts at a certain point they stop even doing disney worlds it's all about their weird bullshit this game feels like it's coming to a head um but it's still very much referential Mm -hmm. Um, this game is still working towards its goals uh i don't have a sage yet and if I'm being honest, I never really liked Kingdom Hearts' weird bullshit. It just seemed like super, like, the most generic yes. anime, like, oh, the darkness. It's the even darkness more inscrutable than this, too, is the thing. Yeah, which I think, ironically, I, when I woke up from my second, or my first nap today, because I'm trying to, I'm trying to... Sleep? Trying to, I'm trying to, like, survive this day, basically, at this point. I, I mean, I'm good now. I, I had a good rest, and mm-hmm. that rest, like, helped me a lot. And now it's just a case of, like, I'm done streaming, so... I'm just going to relax, take it easy. Mm-hmm. But um, Kingdom Hearts 4 was announced today? Yes. And, and I'm it, like, what? Did you see it? What? <laughs> I saw it. It looks weird. It looks like they're showing off like a like a mobile gotcha game at first, and then it's yep. just like, no, this is... Well, they Kingdom did. Hearts 4. There was a gotcha game. game, and there were two different gotcha games, and then this. Kingdom Hearts 4. Ooh. Here comes Water oh, Dude. Kraken. That means you have already fought the Lich, correct? Yes. I beat Marilith and Lich. The guy's like, I am the... I don't give a fuck who yep. you are. Yep. <laughs> okay, seeing this man jump around naked is hilarious. Yep. All right, let's find out what the Kraken's deal is. I bet if I cast lightning at it, it, it doesn't like that. Ah! We must avoid getting hit at all costs. costs. Your word? Whoa. Mm. I remember the second form of this fight being annoying. But I feel like that's the same for all of them. A lot of them, yeah. <laughs> Let's lop off those tentacles. Weakness is its tentacles in its face. Its weakness is lightning. Cast good spells on it. Can we can we cast lightning, guys? Please, cast lightning. I like how they're casting anything but lightning. It's like, well, uh, what if I cast quake? Quake's cool, right? Please, lightning. This weird flips. That's so funny. Neon, get up. Sophia casts. There we go. Oh, he's weak to water, to wind too. Actually, I'm trying to think. It, the first Final Fantasy game, it wasn't actually crystals, right? It was orbs, or am I? No, it was crystals. Well? It's always okay. been crystals. Get him. Some weird squiggly moves. 
Yeah. First form dead? Yeah, pretty close. First form dead. Okay. Let's rip his tentacles off, I guess. Yep. That sounds like something Jack would do. Uh, now he's covered in blood. Oh, now he's in the water. Jump on out. Oh, okay. Okay. That's... That was rough. But oh, he yeah. It jumped out and it looked like it killed you instantaneously he, almost. Yeah. He jumped out of the water and was like, what if I gave you a little... Little water hug? Okay. First form, fine. Second form, got it. Okay. So, the way that I beat the previous enemy who was weak to electricity was I went to my spears and I've got this trident that imbues lightning. Oh, okay. And I changed my job. I could do it. I could be a breaker. Sure. So I got a cool trident. I didn't even think about that. I, I now that I remember about it, yeah, there are weapons with elemental like affinities on them, aren't there? There are, and the game, you know, it usually doesn't matter. Yeah. But the last two bosses, the Crayclaw and this dude, both of which uh, are weak against lightning, so. Zap. I remember having a real tough time with the zombie dragon in this. Zombie dragon gave me a lot of trouble. It was just, it, it, that pool of death that it drops, that, like... I think it puts some sort of like deadly poison on you, which is yeah, it just poisons poison. you a lot. Just real frustrating to fight against. Yep. Just keep hitting him. Zap his shit. Dealing weakness damage. Uh, does quite a bit more. Stop flipping at me. Oh. Dealing weakness damage helps a lot. For sure. The way this thing crawls around is real good. I hate it. Okay, first form down. Time for second form. Okay, so second form, I don't know what to do when it goes underwater. Oh, they should really... I should equip their better jobs now. That's part of the problem here. Okay, so what do I do here? Okay. So when it's underwater, I can't do anything to it. But when it jumps out of the water, I can uh, avoid thunder. Uh, the Looks like it does a, a very big AOE, but if you're far enough away from it, you're typically fine. Yep. Quit flipping at me. Oh, what? Okay, his second flip, he can actually do quite a bit more. Ah! Okay, I, I think I could beat this dude. No problem. Um, let me also equip my characters with their better jobs. I didn't even realize. I put them both in uh, weaker jobs just because getting those jobs up increases their overall capabilities. But this oh, fight... Oh, yeah, yeah. I remember that now. There's uh, they have, Typically, I think by the end of this, this four crystal thing, they have three jobs each. Yes, they have three jobs each. And if it's any, if they're leveling up works like my leveling up then they should like get better um better abilities if you um unlock multiples of these jobs yeah but. because theoretically if they've maxed those jobs they have all those passives that like raise they get all the passives the exactly attack. this is the the affinity ah this will probably, probably, probably kill me this will probably kill me yep that'll kill me <laughs> Yeah, so if they if they do, you know, get the same passives that I do, then it was worthwhile to level up their secondary skills 
but I don't want them to be those jobs against this guy. I want them to have maximum abilities. Get him. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, no. Let go of her. Ah. I, I think like it's pretty hard. funny that it looks like so the men are basically like in their underwear but it looks like the women are wearing pajamas yes they're wearing pajamas and my wife was like you know shirts don't work like this and I was like yep shirts don't work like this yeah that's true shirts don't like uh, very carefully fit around <laughs> the poofs that is not a uh, that is not how any fabric lies on a human form I mean, it, it will do that if it's too small for you, but then you're just living in constant discomfort. But then it's evenly stretched. It's not like just the boobs are, like, expanded across. Yeah, that, that's true. That's true. Just keep casting magics. Oh. I'm honestly surprised they didn't go full, like, no, they're just straight up in bikinis. And good on them for not doing that. Good on them. It was a real easy opportunity for them to do such a thing, and they chose not to. Way to go. Coming from Team Ninja, notorious oh, like horny dang it. Team Ninja. Yep. Oh, this is bad. Um, the less MP I have in this fight, the more I'm going to need to actually like electrocute, uh, uh, actually fight him, <laughs> instead of just hurling spells. So what if what if y'all like cast spells on him? Huh? Yeah. I mean, it is I completely kinda... forgot. I was going to check to see where we were at as a team right now. It looks like we're at $12,656. That's a large amount of money. It is. Stop melee attack. Oh, wow. This is not the way I thought they would go with Kraken, honestly. Yeah, I thought they would do something like, you know... What FL I was FF expecting, like, did, tentacles or popping nine up did. from the, the floor or something. Like, that seems like something, like, a real easy pull. Yeah, uh, in 9, he's kind of this big, squishy thing. That's kind of what I was expecting. There was a lot of things in 9 that just kind of flew over my head that I did not realize. Like, I played it, and I hadn't paid attention enough to not re to realize that they retold that story of that guy from Final Fantasy II. Joseph? Until, like, the third time I've seen it. And I was like, wait a minute. Yeah. This is familiar. Yeah, Joseph. Honestly, the more, the more I think about Nine's story, the more I kind of see how they've pulled a lot of like yo we really like this aspect of this Final Fantasy we really like this aspect of this Final Fantasy but they also do a, like a real good job of just telling their own story too yeah get him zap him zap him girls Nova Splash that move's messed up Hold still. Thank you for holding still. Stop flipping at me, you weirdo. Hey, I'm trying to figure out the physics of that. Like, he's jumping down with for enough force to, like, stop for a second and hurt you, but then also still, like, backflip again, or, like, yeah. flip again. He's, he's very nimble for a big fish man. Ah, you hit me with the second one. Yes, I used all of them. I'm sorry. Do you see the big fish man? <laughs> Ladies. Yes, rush. Oh. Do 
y'all see the big fish, man? I don't think you do. Yes. Hey, you're, you're real close. You're real close. Use your good spells, please. Get him. No. No. Almost got him. Get him. Get him, girls. Oh, he's so low. Don't get killed by tsunami. Get him. Get him, girls. Yeah. <laughs> you guys get get in there. Yes, yeah, punch the shit out of him. Okay, Charlie. Get him, angels. <laughs> be a weird reboot of Charlie's Angels if it was just sick him. <laughs> Final Fantasy Origins Universe or Stranger of Paradise Universe. Yeah, they do spells, which is a pretty big upgrade. Over the other guys. Hmm. Way to go, Crystal Egg. Uh-oh. There's another dude. So most of the fiends are strangers who have been uh, overcome by darkness. Can you do a point. Now we do it on donations. I think the next the next bit that comes up is pretty funny, just in terms of. Well, you'll see. You're, I'll you're see. literally right about to happen. Okay. All right. Proceed. Oh. Bat. Oh, the bat saved me again. It's done. It's over, right? Well, white bat this time. Yep. So that means the sea's got to live. So now what? Keep leaving. <laughs> you pull Zane head before they eat the weevil out of your boy. Yeah. Yeah, right. Something wrong? Oh, thank you. Thank you for the donation. I have not done Sweetness by Jimmy Eat World. I don't know Sweetness by Jimmy Eat World, though. Does anyone really know Sweetness by Jimmy Eat World? It's just kind of going like, oh, a bunch. I've done the middle. I, I will put it on, though. Oh, that. Yeah. That one. Okay. It is the most hummable song I've ever heard that is considered emo. I think it's hilarious. I don't think anyone actually knows the words the words to it. Not even the band. I can still feel that sense of perfect gladness. Maybe it's just my voice. We have to kill Astos. Well, I am satisfied with the check. Let's report to the king. I feel like it's eventually gonna have to come to that, right? Like... Yeah. Astos is like he knows too much. He's not of this world. That much is clear. Yeah, I got some dauntless hoes. 
Oh, there's only one mission left. In Col Cornelia. Okay. Um, I think I've maxed out Black Mage. No. Almost. Thief, I can get Ninja now. Drop rate plus 4%. Instant ability rarely increase increase the likelihood of capturing more uses of an instant ability. Oh, that's for stealing. Where's the stuff that makes it so that increased critical damage? Now that's a good one. Drop rate up. Let's let's increase critical damage. But I'm pretty Drop sure rate up sounds good, but it just means you're gonna get more clothes. Yeah, more garbage, <laughs> like clothes, which I do really enjoy coming over to the smithy going to here and uh, dismantle. I mean, I have been dismantling everything. At this point, should I save some of it? I've got, I've got enough. I can save some of it. I guess. I, I feel like the nature of this, of the way gear works in this game, is that essentially just... everything is fungible it's kind just... of like the mmo problem where every piece of gear except for like the last level's gear is pretty much probably worthless right yeah i mean that is definitely the case for a lot of these uh i've got it's assassin now. stepping stone to the next bit of gear oh assassin doesn't feed into anything else assassin's a final form oh shit what is the ability that assassin gives me invisible temporarily makes enemies less likely to attack you and boost the effects of critical hits. Ooh, that's a good one. Oh, and it's lances and punching and knives. I need to... Yes. I'm going to need to I learn like assassin. like the idea of a spear assassin. Just kind of like... Shh. <laughs> I'm very sneaky with my giant spear. It's a huge spear. Shut, shut the fuck. Shut up. Just sh shut up. You uh, saw nothing. You saw nothing here. I saw you. You put a big stick through him. I move like the shadows. Not really, man. Let's use Anima. I don't like Samurai. I'm just going to go ahead and upgrade Samurai. Let's try to get to... Ugh, I need to unlock so much to get Ninja. I need to use Samurai. I don't want to. But let me let me sing sweetness before I start Corneria, because it seems like story is <laughs> gonna happen at me. I'm gonna I'm unplugging my headphones so I can listen to the song in my in my headset back in a sec. All right, man. Good luck with the sweet with the sweetness. Look up Jimmy Eat World. Sweetness. The Sanin. Whoa. 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 If I did by this will greatness will bury me. Listening, whoa, and it back, whoa. I found you by the room, by the bus, that's my feet. Whoa! Whoa! There's a meaning, but it's no meaning. Whoa! Whoa! Let's straight it back. Whoa! This little sweetness is the burning me. Yeah! Whoa, 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 whoa. 
Listening. Are you listening? Listening. Whoa. And then, whoa, listening. Back. Whoa. Are you listening? All right. Hey, whoa. Whoa. Okay, you're going to need. A living game, whoa, whoa, finna fry, whoa, feel the sweetness of loving me. Is it there? Whoa, oh, 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 is this it? Hurting me. Ordinance will not be concerned with me. The sweetness will not be concerned with me. Oh, and it's got that nice 90s fade out wine. All right, there you go. Sweetness by Jimmy Eat World. Tried my best. Boy, you are not wrong. It is almost impossible to understand what the fuck anyone's saying in that song. Yeah, he's basically just kind of going like... Whoa! Whoa. 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 Literally just repeat that about 15 times and you've sung the whole song. Man, yeah, I don't even think you need like to hear it. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's go to Cornelia. Start the mission. I'm gonna there he's gonna be like, Do you wanna be do you wanna marry my, my daughter? Let's see. Ah, Cornelia, the joyous city with its proud alabaster castle. Though it lives in the shadow of chaos, its noble people greet the dawn with held held high. The spirits of Cornelia's common folk are sustained by the royal family. The wise worlds of Lucan foretelling warriors like yep. So Cornelia is the only part of this that is FF1. Every other part, um, other than the character names, um, are from other places. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey, folks. Something bad is going on, and it's not hard to tell. We've risked our lives to restore life to the crystal realm. More brightly than ever before. Is this not what you wanted? Huh. Return to clear the sun's inner curtain. So these shirts have to have boob pockets, right? Yeah, it has to. I mean, pretty much, yeah. It's almost like those shirts are just winged huskers or whatever those things are called. Mm hmm. Who wants to go? <laughs> Which of you townsfolk want to fight? Oh, that's what I thought. Those townsfolk really turned on them real quick, eh? Yep. I'm not sure I feel as welcome. Let's head to the castle. We should get a warmer reception there. I'm sure the king will be understanding. Almost certainly. It is. It seems like Abby's stream had even more people than the the Rory Giant Bomb official stream. Abby, uh, from what I understand, Abby was actually like quite a 
successful like Twitch streamer in her own regard, right? Yes, hundred so. percent. That makes sense. Like her not being around for a while because I. Yep. I also think she got Saturday a job night. G four or something. Yep, she's on X Play. Oh, I I've never actually I haven't watched X Play in twenty years, so good for her. She's a producer. Exactly what you told us to do. We found the lost crystals and restored their light. It shocks me that G4 is alive, but, you know, I'm glad it's employing people that are, you know, they do good work. That's cool. Yep. I'm sure it's just the crystals doing their thing. It might take some time to get used to it. But I bet this is what this world is supposed to be like. <laughs> Turns out, there's way more. Speak of you as demons in the time below. They call you dark servants of chaos. We, we turned the crystals up. What up, Sarah and Mia? That was rude. I hope they are okay now. It's I think I deserve. I do like this. You literally did what they told you to do, and now everyone's just angry at you. Yep. Wasn't lurking in the shadows with them. Yes, the crystal's light has been restored, but we cannot escape the prosperity of our lost golden age to reappear overnight. Hmm. My wife got me Reese's potato chip big cups. I have heard about those recently. I have no idea if they're any good. I'm going to try one. Is it not our responsibility to be the light of hope? What if we led instead of just, like, sending people to go, you know, die trying to restore crystals? Nope. That's not how this works. Too much effort. There's a prophecy, you know? What if we took a progressive taxation structure? Gave the citizens aid? Hmm. No, nope, can't protect the farmland so people have food. It's, it's Chaos' fault. Just get rid of Chaos. Go kill it. Kill the demon. Fighting's what I live for. <laughs> Burn the witch. That's what this is coming down to, isn't it? It's solid. Solid. What up, Sarah? Hell yeah, Sarah. Oh, but the crystals. Please, don't let the people come to harm. You suck, advisor man. I think it was dark matter that attracted me to the Medicai village, serving the throne. I was a fool. Just You're just generally a fool. You fool and destroyed. That man was never nice to you, so no. he's just kind of a dick now. It's like, oh, oh there we go. I'm stupid. <laughs> I apologize for all those times when I was pissing off all you and your friends, but now that I realize that you're the only thing keeping me from dying. I had an epiphany suddenly. I've learned that you're cooler than I thought. You're very handsome. I think the king in this game looks absolutely ridiculous. Yeah. Any reward I imagine, huh? Bye, characters who have personalities. <laughs> totally real personalities. Oh, yeah. I mean, Jack has a personality. Yes. His personality is what I look like. Mm -hmm. I hate everything. Oh, I'm just so sick of chaos. I hate him. Chaos is bullshit. Every second wasted is a second we're not killing chaos. Yes. Every second we're talking is a second chaos yet lives. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Yeah, shit's getting oh. real dark. Oh, no, not veteran. Biggs and Wedge. Thanks, oh, Biggs and Wedge. The, the Grizzled Veteran and the, the guys are just regular. Never mind. Grizzled Veteran and Fresh Face Recruit are Biggs and Wedge. From They should have just called them that. The cowards. They, they say it. Um, if you talk to them enough, they do say that they oh. are Biggs and Wedge. One of them says, you know, Biggs, Biggs is uh, up to stuff. And I was like, what? 
It's like, you know, bigs. Let's go, pirates. You think you're hard? These pirates are evil. Oh. I mean, that pirate was so mad it turned into a sea devil. That pirate was so angry it turned into a Sahajin. Yeah, you either, you know. You die young or you live long enough to see yourself become a Sahajin. Ah. Ah. Stop it. I'll keep my head on straight. Breaker, like... It kills dudes fast. <laughs> As the name would imply. Hey, uh... How do you feel about, um... Zantetsuken? Uh... Oh, that's a Sahajin priest. Uh, Prince. Okay, got it. You're the tougher type. Um, Breaker also gives them intense uh, debuffs as well. I know I died. I See, I have not even seen a class that can debuff in this game yet. Um... Yeah, Breaker does uh, defense down debuffs. Okay. When uh, I, uh, physical damage I mean, I'm, I'm pretty hard. much at the same point you are at right now. Um, I leaned heavily into the warrior class because I learned early on that that war cry thing is super useful because it heals you over time. Mm. I'm just doing this. Uh. Just dead. Just straight up murdering fools. How come I can't crystallize the pirates? Yeah, that was the one thing that annoyed me. It's like, you should let me crystallize these pirates. I guess oh. the idea is that you're not actually killing them. You're just making them disappear into nothingness, which, at that point, you might as well just crystallize yeah. them anyways. Like, what's the difference? I, I punched him with the crystallization button. I feel like, you know, just let me see the animation. Bop. <laughs> I don't know that... Um, Zantetsuken, I mean, it doesn't seem to work against bosses very well, but boy, does it work against regular mooks very well. Ah! Blah, 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 whoa. Damn it. This is your fault. Now it's just stuck in your head, eh? Yep. <laughs> Scooby boop. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nope, you're gonna, then you're gonna dive at me? Nope. You think at a certain point, like, what, what was it? I already forgot the name of him. Jimmy Eat World? Sweetness, Jimmy, Jimmy Eat World. World. Yeah. You think at a certain point, like, if the band members are just drunk enough during a show that they just do that, they're just like, eh, nah, nah, nah. Whoa. Spooby boop, Scott boop, bop, weeby boop. Haha, ha, you just didn't reach me, you dummy. Shocking! <laughs> oh, he moved. How dare you move. Hold still. Oh. Ah, well, ah. that's cool. I got a donation, even though I'm... I am done. No, that's nice, that's nice. Very nice. Much respect. How am I doing? Any donations? Uh, Since you? I'm just going to go to the most recent donations. I donated to a bunch of people. Mm, I can check. Before these Sahajins jump me, let me... I can take a look. I've got my page open. I'm sitting at 2042 bucks still. Okay. I am $200 a... away from having to style this hair. <laughs> Do they get to choose the stylings? Yes. That could end dangerously. I know. Why is it so perfect? It restored the crystal. It's not Wh stainless steel. The world's 
Looks like we've gotten a bunch of donations just in general. Um, it's funny, I think there's people who are donating to Rory's stream, but they're not donating to Rory, they're just donating to the Giant Bomb community, which, I mean, it's the same thing. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> it doesn't matter. I don't know if Rory didn't um, do a good job on the stream of explaining, like, how to donate properly. Oh, boom. All three of them dead. I, I think he's, like, constantly posting the link every once in a while. I know. Is, which I... is, I think, good enough. Yeah. I mean, currently he's at $140 raised. Perfect. But also, there's two of him? Yeah, I don't know why he did that. He made another one this morning. Does he just want to, like, fill this with puppies? Is that what this is? I don't... I'm fine with it. That's but... what I kind of thought was happening. I kind of assumed that he was going to just keep posting more and more Rory's. Oh, I died again. This is a rough just section. That constant one-off Rory accounts that have fifty dollars each and just a different puppy. Yep, that's what I thought it was gonna. That's where I thought this was going. Uh, Breaker, I guess. Indomitable Spear. That sounds pretty good. Breaker Affinity Up sounds good. Overpower sounds good. Uh, Zantetsu can insta kills a lot of stuff here, so maybe I'll. What should my second part, my second job be? Um, I mean, I think I've got a good combo. Did I max out Black Mage already, though? Maybe I'll swap for another job. Another magic job. Yeah, Red Mage. Uh, have you unlocked Sage? No. But I've been told that uh, I should. Sage is pretty good. Oh, let me beat them down with my red mage weapons oh red mage right doesn't need to equip maces necessarily i forgot i can yeah, equip I other stuff mages can equip swords as well yeah they've got like a weird a weird smattering of weapons they can equip okay let me see so red mage what weapons can i equip and be a red mage Uh, daggers, swords, shields, maces. Okay. So it seems like Red Mage, the big thing is you can cast haste. Ah! Haste and shell and protect and regen. Okay. I can cast regen. Your regen's pretty good. Yeah, break him. Ah! I definitely did a lot of the thing where I have um i guess white mage as my secondary class where i would just start all fights by buffing myself and then just charging in with a different class yeah chain spell just allowing you to do stuff instantly instead of having to charge it it's useful dang pirates Regen. Haste. Protect. Get him. Blood weapon. Zantetsuken. Get got. Oh, even these animations play faster. That's good. Yeah, just everything moves quicker. That's how they, they made it work. Like, just everything. Go quick. Gotta go fast.
Jack, a big fan of Sonic the Hedgehog. Gotta go fast. Break his back. I'll break Chaos's back like this. Just like Batman. Jack, just a super big fan of Bane. Yes. Have you watched uh, Harley Quinn? Uh, the show? The show on HBO. Uh, I've seen the first season and most of the second season. Okay, because that show is real good. Okay, let's yeah, see. I do like uh, Bane's like kind of like the the sad like. Yeah, everyone I, hates actually, him. I'm not sure I'm describing it properly. Everyone hates him. He's just like. Whoa. Why are you they, not they listening lean to me? They heavily into the uh, the Dark Knight Rises version of his yes. voice. Yes, I love that they leaned into the Dark Knight Rises version of his voice. I love that they've gone with like this sad sack. Did you get the uh, Bane episode in, in season two? Did you get to that yet? Oh God! I probably did. I I think I stopped literally just before the season ended. Okay. And it was mostly just because I was like, this is going to end poorly for Kite Man, and I don't want to see him hurt. <gasps> Poor Kite Man. Kite Man's great. They did a real good job making you like Kite Man. They did. You feel for Kite Man. Poor guy. Yeah. I know it's I know it's going to end badly. I know it's not going to end well for him. Just waiting for the, the shoe to drop. Kite Man is... Look, he's he's reserved... The wedding location, he's done all the research. Hey, Pisca Demon. Piece of shit. No, I, I don't think I will be mind drained. Oh. I didn't get mind drained, but I got mind blasted. Ah. Ah. There's a lot of real bad enemy types. Oh, God. No. Yeah, there are some real pain in the butt enemies. Oh, there's just a... <laughs> That is definitely not something you want to turn around and see right behind you. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm, let's just, ki let's consider them killed. Let's just, yeah, let's consider all those things dead. You know? Yeah, you, you did the Dark Souls thing where you get to run by enemies that you don't feel like fighting anymore. I don't want to fight y'all. There's, look, there's a lot of you. This seems like where a boss might be. I respect your opinions, enemies. You know what? I get it. Corneria kind of sucks. Yep. Oh, no. Captain Bicke. No way. He's been taken by the darkness. Not Captain Bicke. The possessed. <laughs> He's just got a weapon from... Um, Final Fantasy 14. Haste, protect. Get him. Ha! Okay, that does good damage. I'm afraid I am beyond you, Captain Dick A. You know, Final Fantasy fourteen is the only Final Fantasy I've never tried at all. I have tried it. Um, I did not like. I did not love it. It's. It looks like an MMO. Yeah, so it's an MMO. It's like, yeah, it's an MMO. It's an MMO, and apparently the it. story in this MMO is better than most MMO stories. But I am not an MMO player, so I'm not a MMO player. So not a MMO player. Yeah. So it's. It's hard for me to say that, like, this is a better story than previous MMOs. I mean, I have to imagine. I saw someone beat the the latest, I guess, expansion or whatever, like, story they have in Final Fantasy XIV. Yep. And they were getting, like, emotional at character deaths and stuff. So I was like, well, I mean, clearly... They care. This person cares about these characters, so good on them for doing that, right? Get got, Captain Big A. Yeah, you're not, you're not tough anymore. 
Job level up. Did you beat Captain Big A already? I, I did beat Captain Big A. You, you are at the point where I am at in this game. Okay. Get uh, got. I mean, I have done other things, but I was doing stuff like... Uh, I did some side quests earlier. Yeah, I was doing side quests. Uh, a bunch of things unlocked that when you beat them, I unlock extra, you unlock extra classes for your party members, so I was doing those. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but a lot of them are just... It, they're just boss rushes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, my, my experience with Final Fantasy XIV was getting a CD key for it, saying, well, maybe I'll try this, realizing I had to make a Square Enix account, and going, eh, I don't feel like it. Mm -hmm. Oh, Captain Pick, eh? Looks like we're at chaos. Just, just under thirteen hundred dollars. Well, actually, no. Um, my my vision's a little blurred. We're at twelve thousand eight hundred and ninety-six dollars right now total. Yep. Oh no. Oh no. Astos. Captain Pique, no. Your big Final Fantasy fourteen weapon won't help you here. I'm surprised we didn't get any dwarves in this one. Though I guess the dwarves, are they in four? Or three? Dwarves are, they're definitely in four, I know that. I never completed three. I don't remember ever meeting dwarves in three. I believe the Rally Ho dwarves are in three. Tell us where to go. Tell us where we can find Astos. Follow the bat. <laughs> Oh, the bats. He's Batman? Astos is just Batman. He's been Batman this whole time. He's the world's greatest detective? Got it. I'm mad that video game people realize they have to do the, like, bicep vein. This may sound odd coming from an old corsair like me, but don't give in to old Pete. Ash's body is ridiculous. <laughs> That is a body that, like, you need to basically not eat to obtain. Yes. That man has... But first, has... you need to eat a lot, work out a lot, and then just stop eating while still working out a lot. Ash is, uh... He's got no water in him. He's very dehydrated. Just constantly parched. Yep. You put him in water, he sinks. I've never needed this thing before. Zero buoyancy. Yep. I've never made it this far before. That was that. We kill chaos. Dive head first into the unknown. Jack Garland. All right, let's get a move on. I didn't expect Kraken to be flippy. <laughs> the false warriors completed. I got some Anima shards. Schemes of the past, level 88, huh? Chaos Shrine. Flying Fortress, I've got a new mission there. I don't. I want a reason to go back to the FF9 and 10 levels. I gotta say Mount Golg. Um, I'm a little disappointed in that one. Which one was Mount Golg? It's the 8 level. It's the Fire Cavern. Oh, yeah, the, uh, the Ifrit-themed place, yeah. Yeah, the fire cavern. Now, part of that's just because the fire cavern in eight is not 
like some iconic location but also it's kind of a bummer yeah it's kind of just like yo this is the test for the exam but like everyone just rushed through it specifically like the look of that area is just hey it's it's fire level yeah it is it is the floor is lava the level like i could notice for other games like the 10 level i'm like oh this is where you fight seymour oh this is the part where in nine you get to drink water and then it it heals you yeah it uh that was the i I keep forgetting the place dark evil forest woods evil Evil forest Forest, something like that yeah it's the evil forest which is the first place where blanc gets turned to stone and then gets cured do they explain how he gets cured uh you get the super soft you do a whole mission oh that's right there is a mission I think it's it's something you can skip though, and he just shows up anyways. No, no, no. It's uh, Garnet and Steiner have to go get the super soft. It's uh, how they get back to um, Alexandria. Okay. After you run away, they get the super soft, and then they go back to Alexandria, and then they get captured. In my defense, when I finally finished that game, I was incredibly sleep deprived. That's fair. The ancient tower, the facility they sent here, is a tower of legend in. Final Fantasy XI is filled with a great machine. Uh, singularity can be woken up and reshaped the very laws of the cosmos. While the moments of despair do not yet echo full in the t- air, the time is not yet ripe to open the gates of Armageddon. But with my subtle guidance, I do not expect the adventure advent of the true despair to be far off. So this has to be Astos. Just all Astos. Being evil. Oops, all Astos. Yep. I did not play enough Eleven to know this location. Yeah, my uh, my experience with Eleven was starting as a human, my friend starting as an elf, and us spending a week trying to reach get, each other. Trying to get to each other, yeah. I have no need. And then just not wanting to play the game anymore. <laughs> yep. And then when you get to each other, you're like, oh, well, it's still not very good. Let's find Astos and kick his Astos. Take that tormented soul. Blunt damage. I have never blocked a cursed claw. Not once. They take you to the ground and start stabbing you? No, not that one. They're absorbable move. I have never absorbed it. Hmm. Is this an enemy? The hell is this? Is it a mimic pot? Is it supposed to be a mimic pot? What are you? Well, it's dead now, so I guess I don't worry about it. It slowed us, and I don't like that. Ah! I'm sure that Final Fantasy XI aficionados are going like, huh? It's a pot. Of course it's a... It's a sentient pot that kills you. Yeah, I'm sure that they are having the same reaction I had when I got to the little, like, potable water thing in the FF9 level. And I was like, oh, this water thing. I bet it heals you. It does heal you. What? Yeah, I think my moment in this game for that was when we were, when I was in the Final Fantasy IV themed level, hearing the blue whale music and then looking out a window and seeing that you're in space. You are in space? Blue whale. I did not realize it. Or sorry, Lunar Whale? The Lunar I, Whale. You think I remember it? It's my favorite thought. Ah! Game. Cursed Claw is messed up. It's fast. Yeah, um. But I haven't seen a 6 level yet. 6 is the only one that's left. Yeah, though technically I don't think you've saw, seen a Final Fantasy V level either. I did. Five was the um, five was the one before uh, Kraken with Crayclaw. They have to fight the crayfish oh. enemy. Yes, now I'm remembering it. Now. It's yes, you're correct. It's the underground fortress where the um, Earth Crystal is. Just opportunity, they could have done a thing where you cross the bridge from Corneria and done the big, the big bridge thing. They could have. I, I really I, just want a, a different version of that song. 
Yeah, I will say the um, the five level was probably my least uh, felt like the biggest missed opportunity to me. Oh boy, this level's messed up. Someone is pinging. What is what is going on? Apparently, one of us will get flipped in for Rory in a bit. Cool. Any new donations? No. Okay. Back to chat. Getting worked in this level. Yeah, I don't know enough of three to know if, like, the three level's good. Okay, I parried two of them. Haha! -ha. I never got very far in three. It's not the best. Ah! Curse Claw is so fast. I am interested in the pixel remaster of it because I hear they remove the thing that let that doesn't let you change jobs without being punished. Oh, that's good, I guess. Zantetsukin! Have some of that! I mean, I'm the same. I'm the type of fool who decided to like. Oh, oh I'm gonna play God. Final Fantasy three in Japanese because. Oh no! Know, my Japanese is not good enough. I can't figure this out. No, I I've. I got the FF nine Ultimania and was like, oh, let me. You know. I got the Ultimania. I'm like, oh, it's in Japanese, but I'll. This will be a reason for me to practice my Japanese more. Dog, the amount of kanji that I have to learn yeah. just to read any pages is too much. It's I too much kanji. I was thinking, you know, I know some. I know katakana pretty well. I know. Uh, yeah, I know hiragana, hiragana pretty well. Let's I've got start, a dictionary. Here's all this kanji. Here's all this kanji, and even if it has furigana, it's not enough. It's so small. Oh, there's no Furigana in FF3, though. You wouldn't have any Furigana. Uh. When I attempted to do it, it was just... It was taking so long to get through any, like, dialogue at all. It's like, mm -hmm, okay, yep. This means this. This means this. Mm -hmm. I, I'm just not there yet when it comes to Japanese. And at this point, I don't think I will be. But, you know, oh. I tried. Good. It's the effort that counts. Stop it. Stop it, ancient bat. That freaking sonic attack those bats have are, is super annoying. It is. You can't dodge it. You just have to, like, take the opportunity to parry it. Stop supersonic waving. I feel like I'm outside of that thing's range. Or I should be. Job level, sweet. Oh, was this the... Ah! So if I had gone left, I would have fought bats. Since I went right, I fought skeletons. Yo, you branching paths in a Final Fantasy game. Let's be quick. The uh, dichotomy, the true dichotomy, skeletons versus bats. Ah! Turned around and... Bat was there. Ah! Stop it! Ow! What? Goddamn bats. Fucking bats. You know, I can't remember. I don't think I've run into a mimic in this game. I haven't either. Hmm. I hope they have a mimic. I hope they don't. I hate mimics. I, I just think it's funny. <laughs> it is. A, it's a well, funny I mean, the first, first time. time. It's funny. Then it gets annoying. You know, in these games, it's funnier than in, like, a Souls game. Well, in a Souls game, you usually just straight up You die. just die immediately and then have to backtrack. Ah, stop using Leech. Fucking bats. It essentially gets to the point where once you learn that Mimic exists, every treasure chest you see, you first stab it. Yeah, you stab it. And then it's like, ah, gotcha. I don't get to trust anything I find. Cool. I love being scared of treasure chests. 
I I said just this yesterday. Constant fear. Yeah. I remember talking to someone who was saying how like eventually you learn in um, Souls games, you know, you learn how to tell, you know when an ambush is coming and all that sort of stuff. And I'm like, if by you learn, you mean you realize that they are always trying to fuck you over and you eventually become suspicious of everything in the world, then yes, you eventually, you know, learn. But it's not because there's any reason you should think like you're not safe in a given spot. It's just simply yeah, like, you get uh... burned enough times that you realize that even if the stove has no lights on and, you know, you didn't turn the stove on, the stove is always hot. What's up? What? Doing the end stream, end of the day thing, where we're all together in the same conversation and multiple people are playing. How's it oh. going? To narrate my game. So the Anyarlings tried to circle around us, but our missiles took a pull on them. What shall we do next? Shall we fight cautiously? Do a berserker attack. Berserker Sorry. attack. Table folds. Fight and wait for opportunities. Hold our ground or fight fiercely. Do a berserker attack. Always. People don't know what a berserker attack is. Do it. You could actually be fucking me over. Do it. Oh god, even the chat wants to do a berserker attack. Do a attack. berserker attack. Do a berserker attack. Yeah, always go berserker attack. Yes. That's what my character has been for a while now. Consequences be damned. Berserker attack. Well, we already have the advantage. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, wow. We uh, took massive damage. Thanks, okay. guys. So? Howling, Ram, did Warriors. they take massive her? They gained the upper hand. Tardeni said that perhaps they had gotten lucky. Hold our ground. Did, did, wait. You took massive damage, but did they take yeah. even well, massive her damage? Thanks, guys. You just totally murdered my entire family. Thanks, guys. Did, but are they dead, too? You no. Know, death is inevitable. No, they actually won, and they took stuff, so, well, well, what, way to go. You, you might have just completely fucked this entire... You're welcome. You asked for our input, and we told you the correct answer. Yeah, the only answer, actually. I like to think that you were freed of your family. Did you like that family? No. The burdens of all the responsibilities and, you know... Yeah. Now you can go on without them. Stronger. Better. Handsomer. The brilliant hooves who would rather raid others in toil and fields hit the flint hearts last season in the Earthlings just now. Both times they emerged victorious, leaving the field with cows and bushels of barley. We strive to be more like them. Bushels of barley. Bushels of barley. Bushels of barley. That's fun to say. Um, oh, I can't magic. Uh, I can't earth this hill, Gigas. Get him. Ah! Does Antetsu could work on you? Ha! It did. Ah, oh, yeah. sweet. I can do a ritual. Awesome. Right, okay, we're gonna do the best part of this game. We're gonna do a ritual. What happens if you do a ritual? Uh, you get blessings the from the gods. You get blessings from the gods. Are they fun gods? Or are they, like, angry uh, gods? It's a... It's, oh. it's a... Do these gods like to party? They hungry gods. <laughs> this is Dostal the Elk Hunter. Is that a do I need? is that the name the of a hero god? Must be male and worship Dostal with high food and combat skill. Food renowned, combat very good. Anyone else who's Dostal? What up, Dostal? very good at food and very good at combat but he's renowned the only problem is he's old hey arbitrary that's, that's just ageist yeah i killed uh kraken 
Yeah. I killed Kraken. I, I, I see you're still running around naked. Yep. Captain Bicke is dead. Yeah. You're you're pretty close to the end of the game. Excellent. You're you're only Let's a few levels. This. All right. You embark on a ritual to send one of your members to the Elmal side. Do you seek the aid of the riders? Three chieftains agreed to send priests, saying we were well prepared to find the sun path. Our priests said that their help could be a major factor in the success of our ritual. You also seek the assistance of the wheels. Though they tell odd versions of many sacred stories, their Elmal lore is likely to be more or less correct. Four charioteer chieftains express zeal for a solar blessing. The devotee of Elmal or Osara typically attempts this ritual. It calls for someone adept in leadership and combat. Wait, no. Wait, no. Did I click the wrong one? Get him. I thought I clicked the right one. Damn it. I clicked the wrong one. Don't click the wrong one, click the right one. Oh no. <laughs> Ugh. Don't get grabbed by Hill Gigas. Got it. I don't have to kill any of these things. I'm just going to run past them. Damn it. I've done this one before. I accidentally clicked the same one as last time. I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry, guys. Can you do a berserker uh, attack on this no, ritual? Stop. I'm, I'm actually kind of disappointed. I actually not everyone can run around naked like you, Gino. Hell yeah. Um, Actively defying mechanics. I'm saying I'm a naked samurai. That's my favorite. Anime. It just sounds like a Yakuza character. Yeah, that's my favorite anime, Tale of the Naked Samurai. Oh, shit. I failed one of the skill checks, and so we're on a different part of the branch. Yeah, I've, I've, I've seen that on a... No, Crunchy roll. ...scenes flashed by Angkar until he arrives at a battle between Imperial Infantry and Legendary Bird Riders. Uh, they're riding Toucan Sam like a fucking horse. Awesome. They worship an avian god called Rimak, as with your own gold golden city of Nivora. The Emperor's forces made the Rimak part of his empire. Anga Khan must have tumbled back to the days of conquest. Secret door. Now I notice. Now I see. Oh, shortcut. Super bombed, I accidentally killed. I, I'm ki still kicking myself about that one. Darn. Yeah. About the ritual or the family dying? Yeah, I'm. I'm just kind of bummed about that. Um. I. 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 I, I, uh, I don't know. Train scenes flash by Angkor, blah, 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 blah. He does not fear us. Fight those bird riders. They shall sing songs All of right. the naked samurai. Yeah, we failed it. Damn it. So I failed that. Um and that just happens. And now I've lost my chief diplomat. Cool. That sounds bad. Yeah, sure is. Is this a strategy game you're playing? There's one. It's complicated. Ah, it's a strategy clan management sim slash choose your own adventure slash. Is 
slash something else. Something else. His family says that they're disappointed that there's no one represented in here, but... Parnan. I need a Parnan family member. You need a Karnov family member? Ah, great. Um, actually, he, he would be useful. Let's be he quick. Be ready for well, that was a bummer. But hey, shit. It, shit happens. In games with dice rolls, shit always happens. Uh, no, that was on me, and that's the disappointing thing. Um, oh. I need goods. I will give. What do we have again? We have a lot of goats and cattle. I don't. I don't play dice roll games anymore. I only play game. I only play the video game equivalent of uh, a resource management heavy euro game. Can I send a caravan? Oh, it's the dark season. I can't send someone out for a caravan because it's the dark season. Oh, of course, the dark yeah, season. Yeah, it's winter. They're not going to live. Okay, so. Alright, this here was a bummer. Lesson learned. Ha! Ah. Ritual. Oh, I see. I clicked. I did click the wrong one. Dang it! Have you Dang considered it. clicking the right one? Yeah. Stop, guys. Oh no! I'm locked in here. I'm a bad person. <laughs> um... Jacked saying. There's got to be a way out of here. Analyze. Observe. So, magic. Analyze. Observe. Foragers gather more food. That's... Ugh, this room's bad. I'm screwed. Wow. I went back the way I came from. Dang it. Watch it carefully. The door is mocking us, daring us to find an answer to its riddle. <laughs> this door is mocking us, daring us to find an answer to its riddle. Perhaps a key? Treasure chest. Do you think these people are wild boars? Okay. Bird of Lucania in the yard? It's a fairy tale, right? Seasonal market. Some less friendlier clans claim this is because we are sacred to leave scared to leave our community. Oh, fuck. Soon overshadows Nagel. Your shaman's report encountering fell spirits haunting your scrublands. They would have caused horse miscarriages. The shamans did not succeeded in driving them off. Your shamans wish to add new bangles to their ritual costumes, strengthening them against the possible return of these spirits. Occasionally, it becomes necessary to add new items when the old ones lose their potency. I got a, like, evil, demonic, possessed sword in Final Fantasy Origins, and I'm pretty sure that I, like, now the trash that I'm getting from these, like, random enemies is better than it because of how this game works. Oh, CP dropped. Oh, yeah, he did. I suppose he... He seems very upset about uh, the Berserk attack. 
Which I blame as much on Chad as us. I mean, this is once again proof that peer pressure is bad. Sometimes the, the most obvious answer isn't the right one. Can't blame people for that. If the answer isn't to just charge in completely recklessly, I don't want to know what the answer is. If charging in recklessly is wrong, I don't want to be right. Oh, I died. Damn it. Stupid. Yep, we are $50 away from... You charge in recklessly? Uh, I did. I wanted to use Antetsuken, which is an ability that really, truly... I, I can't imagine using against a boss. It does... I mean, it. even if you if you hit a boss with it, it still, like, inflicts vulnerability status effects on them. Yeah, it I does. Mean, it also helps if you are able to take, let's say, more than three attacks from any boss. That's dumb. That's silly. That's impossible. I feel like that, that, that might, you know, change one's opinion. It's a shame that that's impossible. Yeah. Yeah, it's a shame that there's no there's no way of it's a shame wearing that this, any sort of armor. This game was... Uh, it's a shame that it was sponsored by Calvin Klein, and so everyone must be in underwear at all times. Yeah, I understand. You're you're a real gamer. You're a, you're a real Dark Souls gamer. I just appreciate the works of Calvin and Klein. I found a secret door. Oh, it was a shortcut. I don't know this FF11 level, so. I never finished my story about the Lufenians. There's not much left. Oh, are the Lufenians in FF1? Year after year they lost ground to the Fenris. It was then I was going to You are asking the wrong person. I, I d yeah, I I don't recall Lufenians in anything. So. I'm just asking the the people who have uh, potentially internet available to them. Tom are way less scary when you've got a pillar to put between you and them. Oh no, they got me. Everyone's grudge might be the strongest attack in this game. Yeah, no. Tonberry is gonna fuck you up. Just like in real life. Yep. Oh no. I've been slowed and stunned. Get him. Get away, Doom and Gloom. Ah, numb. Have some of this. Hell yeah. Explode that thing. Uh, I don't want to fight you. I have no, I have no quarrel with you. Random enemies wandering this hall. Excuse me. You, Sophia. Excuse me, big uh, hill gigas. I just need to get this treasure chest. Just scooch on by. <laughs> Another locked door? Who would lock doors? What sort of monsters? Uh, I guess I'll level up Whirling Vortex. So I guess uh, the upgrades that you get in this game, uh, the ones that are like related to weapons do stick, regardless of what class you're in. Uh, like the ones that are, uh, the special moves do. The ones that are like using this button combination combo will restore health or something. That is per class. Oh, okay. They're testing us, those bastards. And 
then class affinity is basically most uh, of how you get your stat increases. Yep. A lot of which comes from armor. And weapons and a little bit of skills. It's a shame they didn't put armor in the game. Take that, he'll get us. Ah! Leave her alone. This kick is just mad. I mean, wouldn't you be? Yep. If, if one of your Jack arms was... and his posse came up to you and started talking mess. I'd be mad if one of my arms was so much bigger than the other one. I mean, that's just that's just life as a hill giga. Oh. It's weird because his right arm is massive, but he uses the axe in the other arm. He does. He's got to protect his... Uh... Uh, I got a maiden's key. Does that mean that he's left-handed? I guess. Oh, found an elevator. Wonder where this elevator takes me. It's funny that they did... I mean, it's a little Souls design, but not too much. You know? Yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty soulsy. You just don't lose your experience. I just mean in terms of like shortcuts and all oh, that yeah. sort of stuff. Like it's it, a little it is bit the same. It is Neo level design. I think I can just Zantetsuken the Walliness. Yeah, the breaker really makes these fights easy. That was quick. Foregone conclusion. Ooh, another crystal. Second crystal activated. Are we done yet? <laughs> Alright, I need to find I'm gonna guess four crystals. This game could use a map. I haven't gotten lost much, but it wouldn't hurt. Oh, okay, the sixth dark crystal. When a strong will bearer of a dark crystal merges with the ten tenebrous emotions of the world, it is a gamble whether or not they can withstand the transformation into fiend. Curious, though, I might be to learn the answer to this question, whether or not she could endure this process remains a mystery for now. Then again, it is unlikely she would ever suffer herself to be joined in any way to the darkness. Even still, to achieve the future my dear friend so desperately seeks, this scenario must come to pass. She is the final piece of the puzzle, and perhaps even the most potent of them all. You know what I think's happening, y'all? What do you think's happening? I think that uh, Princess Sarah is a significant, a person of significance in this world. I think Princess Sarah is going to be a key part. When they say she, I think they mean Princess Sarah. You, better tread carefully. you don't have to say anything. Because <laughs> we've got five characters. We don't have a sixth. But she's... The game keeps talking about her. Oh, fire crystal. I mean, it can't be BK, because he just... He died, right? He's dead. Yeah, BK's dead. Okay. So can I only break these walls from one side? BK's dead. Um, I mean, there's only so many characters in this game that have names, right? Does the king have a name, or is he just king? I think he's got a name.
He might have a name. It, it's not important. <laughs> so I found three crystals. There's got to be one more. I don't know where it is, though. I think I've used all of the keys that I found so far. And I've broken through all the walls that I've seen. I don't want to fight the Mad Gigas again. I guess the Mad Gigas was like, look, if I'm going to be using a weapon in one hand, I got to... I gotta strengthen up my blind side. You know? Could be that. He's just looking for equilibrium. Yep. Sword so heavy, can't. Uh -oh. Sword heavy, on spaghetti. Yep. Oh, the seat of I'm actually planet. not even sure if this is near the end of the game. This this is basically where I'm at at the game. I, I tried to beat it last weekend, but I did not have the... You time. you are pretty close. I have beaten the game. You are a couple levels away, I think. Okay. We are at $12,950. Oh, what do I have to fight? Ooh, it's an iron giant. Ah, yes, my favorite Brad Bird film. Yes. Let's go, iron giant. Is this one also voiced by Vin Diesel? Yes. He says, I am Groot. <laughs> that would be incredible. Okay, it's weak to lightning because it's a robot. Oh, that kills me. <laughs> what else is new? Okay, so this guy's got magics. I mean, it's it's weak to lightning, so I guess I will again change to a black mage <laughs> as my secondary class. Immune, holy, 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 holy. There we go, immune lightning. Change job to black mage. And I guess I could level up my... Is it worth me getting sage? Sage is incredibly good. I am not going to lie. You white the... magic and black magic. And then yeah. if you level up, you can cast ultima, which is just broken. Does it uh, bring down your total amount of MP like Meteor nope. does? Oh, no. <laughs> no, you just have to cast three light spells and three dark spells. And then you can cast Ultima. In a row, or just like... For three. Just, uh, I mean, the way the Sage works is you basically get... As you cast spells of the same type, you get stacks. Stacks on stacks on stacks. Okay, so it's, it's like Red Mage in 14. I mean, it's like, uh, it's like Sage in Final Fantasy 3, but, yeah. Okay, let me see if I can unlock Sage. So, Sage is at the end of White Mage and Black Mage, right? So, yeah. let's go to... We'll Jeff. say, once you told me that uh, Sage can do Ultima, I definitely cheesed at least three bosses with it. Yeah, no, that, I, it, it's very cheesable. It is a high dairy class. It turns out black aid. it is, in fact, easy being cheesy. Hey, I got Sage. Master the ultimate magic, Ultima. Hold R2 to cast Magic Sigil, then press L to toggle between white and black. The more emblems you have, the quicker you will cast things. That seems messed up. Okay. Let's go ahead and... Swap. Like, even if you couldn't cast Ultima, it would still be probably the best magic class. Sage, and this one's got Imbued Lightning. That's exactly what I want. And Hero Shield. Do I have a shield that's good for Sages? I do not. That's a shame. But that's fine. Uh, and then I guess I'll spend some Anima on, on Sage. Right? get some sage levels 
Okay, so do I want teleport? Teleport's all right. Do I want to go... You get more iframes in your dodge when you proc it. Do I want to go down magic damage up? Potion recovery amount, action ability up. Ult, uh, I want to unlock Ultima. Okay. What if instead I unlocked Ultima? Let's unlock Ultima. <laughs> and let's try that. I 100% I like this game more than I like uh, Elden Ring. Not even close anymore. It's just fun. It's dumb and fun. I mean, it has Final Fantasy in it. It has Final Fantasy in it. It's simpler. Congratulations, nerd. You got... They they got ya. Oh, yeah, and I'm sure the folks who are like, Elden Ring's the second coming of, uh, of open world games. It was not... It was because of the unique innovations to the open world formula, and not just because it was a Dark Souls version of an open world game. See, what if this game is just the dark, you know... What's what's the term? Like the entry drug for the Dark Souls that you didn't expect. Suddenly you're gonna have urges to just be playing games with difficult combat and all that will be left is Elden Ring. <laughs> Cause it never ends. All this played it. For playing card drafting roguelites on the hardest difficulty and Elden Ring. <laughs> Nothing else oh. will sate his bloodlust. <laughs> How long until they just make an Elden Ring card game? <sighs> They did make a Dark Souls around. card game. No, but not not in the way you would expect. You're just you're just running around the world, but you fight enemies with cards. Oh, that'd be pretty. Isn't good. that that just that uh that Witcher three mod that replaces every single combat with Gwent? That's a great idea for a mod. Oh, what I have it's to cast? Very funny. I have to cast White Magic what first. Is significantly longer. Oh, it just turns it into a Yu-Gi-Oh story, where all all conflicts are resolved via card game. Gwent, yeah. a Yu-Gi-Oh story. Yeah. Ah, the savage. Only, the only way to, the, we resolve all of our conflicts peacefully in this ancient Egyptian society through a gentleman's game of cards. With card I've, games. I mean, aside from the part where they banish people's souls, sure. Yeah, well, yeah, sometimes game. sometimes Yami gotta kill people just to let them know who's boss. If he didn't do that, he wouldn't be able to assert dominance. You gotta keep the people in fear so that they could they don't you rise see, up against you. If you don't have a monopoly on violence, you're not even a government. Exactly. Uh this guy is kicking my shit. I am currently looking at a image of a club wielding dinosaur. And I, I don't know. I don't. I just don't know. <laughs> okay, come on. Let's focus on them. Focus on them, my guy. Thundaga. Why am I not locked on? Get him. Get in there. Frostblade. Okay. <laughs> Swordplay and magic? Not bad for a robot. Get in, get out. Kirby right back at ya. Heska. Oh, oh, oh. I wish this was a bigger arena. <laughs> From what I understand, this game has not necessarily done well in Japan, right? I mean, this... Oh, no, this... I mean, console games in general sell like shit in Japan these days. That are not... Especially ones that aren't on Switch. 
So it's not necessarily that people don't like this game, it's just that people are kind of over console games in Japan. Okay. Yeah, like, no one... I, I the, the understanding I have is that Japan has very much gotten to, like, reached a point where if it ain't, like, they don't even give a shit about the PS5 that if, much. If you can't play it on a train, it is useless. Yeah, you can't play it on a train because you're a sad, overworked salary man. And all you have left is Kirby. That's all I have left. This is, yeah. So should I be... I mean, that's just true. Should I... Hmm. It seems like my secondary class should actually not be... Well, Breaker maybe, but I shouldn't be using Tridents. I actually want to be even close. I want to be either very close or very far against this guy. How's Assassin? Assassin is basically every critical hit you get, which is hitting them from the back, uh, creates stacks, and then you can hit them with them stacks on stacks on stacks. May backs on backs on backs? Yeah. I see. Hit him real so, hard. Let's let's up upgrade that. That sounds good. Let's use some anima and get my stacks up. Let's acquire. Some. Oh no, not white mage. Oh no, I put them in the wrong job. Edit undo. Now you have to get Paladin instead. Expert job. Assat. Oh, no. <sighs> that hurt. I spent a lot of time getting Paladin in this game, and then I did not like the class. Does Invisible work? Paladin's not that good. Does it's Invisible like, actually hey, work? You want to do holy damage? Yeah, that's that's pretty much it. It's like, yep. No. And I'm like, no, what if I game. what if I picked Breaker instead and did a Zen 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 Tetsuken. Tetsuken. Zen Tetsuken. Z Zerb Bourbon. Yes. What if you did anime attack? Yeah. You see I have taken a big sword out, and that big sword, if it cuts you, you die. I like big sword. And oh. I cannot lie. Oh, it looks like Rory is playing Magic the Gathering. Thundaga. Our games returns once again. I'm surprised this card game cannot game. be escaped. I'm surprised this guy. Just leave? What? Leave what? This chat? Yeah. The chat? Yeah, he left the chat a while ago. I said it. Oh. Yeah, I think he wanted to focus. He wanted to like really focus on what he was doing. I assume. I mean, that's fair. That game is cool. Yeah, it, it looks pretty cool. As a, as a King of Dragon Pass, as a noted King of Dragon Pass pervert, it makes me glad that they made a, they made a second one, basically. Mm -hmm. Ah. Because ah. it's one of those fun, like, there's nothing else like it games. It's always fun when you find something like that, and it's good. It's just like, yeah. Hell yeah. Because the whole thing was, that game sold very poorly when it first came out, and then when they made it, they put it on Steam and iOS, it did, like, pretty big numbers because of its cult reputation. And so they kickstarted basically a spiritual successor slash sequel. That's that's pretty much the psycho not story if you think about it, but yeah. yeah. Except this game seems well, I don't I'm not a I don't hate psycho not by any means, <laughs> but like this this is something you know, it's its own thing. Rude. Psychonauts is straight up like, yo, this is Mario. Well, Mario sixty four ish. Psychonauts is well listen, Tim Schafer doesn't know how to actually make a game that's fun to play, but by golly, it will be fairly funny. Rude. 
I enjoyed playing Psychonauts. I also enjoyed playing Stacking. Okay. I remember Stacking. Yeah, I know. I remember Stacking. Who could, I remember who that could game that has stacking. two names because of copyrights. Yes. No, that's I, Iron Brigade games. slash Trench. Still Trench to me, damn it. Oh, boy. This guy hits hard. Yeah. Maybe you should hit him. I'm trying to hit him. I don't have yeah, enough MP. Should... Yeah, well, if only... I didn't run from all those combats. If only you weren't... If only there wasn't, like, a, a, a uh, self-imposed handicap that made fighting hit hard-hitting bosses harder. But, eh, such a thing is beyond my, my mortal ken. Again, In his not... defense, it definitely fits with the, the motif he's doing this weekend. I'm just gonna let... I mean, have you seen the armor in this game? Actually, no, the, ar some no. Of the armor looks pretty cool. <laughs> have I seen the armor in this game? No! I, yeah. I, do, I do like how sometimes it's you, just like full on armor. Sometimes it's like Red and Mage, then fedora. sometimes it's like, here's a fedora, I don't know. Fedora is so good. It's up to you, Sophia. Get her. Yeah, cast Thundaga on him. Why are you casting Haste 3 and not... Oh, what the... What did even hit me there? That one, I don't even know what hit me. Come on now. I will say this. I think they significantly buffed the allies in this game in this release compared to like the demo yes yes the dem like in the demo i felt like the allies were constantly just dropping it, yes in in the pre-release like they definitely made some changes to the way the allies work also that initial chaos advent fight is way easier yeah by a lot compared to how it was in the the pre-release beta but hey, you know, that that's the same with like Neo. Even uh you know, there's still weirdos out there being like Oh god. Oh no. Smite smite. Um, Oof. Smite smite smite. <laughs> uh, I can't leave this level either. Get them, girls. It's weird. I mean, I beat Kraken on, like, my third or fourth try. Oh, boy. How much longer do you have on the timer? Oh, wait. You're going until uh, midnight Eastern, right? Yep. Yeah. Absolute loon. Hastega. Thundaga. Yeah, I am. I am absolutely done. I am not playing a video game for like a week. I am playing That's a video game right now. Someone swapped the streams. Edit unpaused. So I had to take my hands off the controller. It for looks a like ZP is done though. Cool. Ah, ah. No, 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 no. Ah. No, 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 no. Oh, dead. <laughs> Hate to see it. Okay. It's either that or he's got connection issues because he, see he keeps going live and then off and then live yeah. and okay. on again. It's one of those. Yep, it's connection issues. It's not. It does not seem to be intent. It is. Internet service provider. An internet service provider or ISP. ISP? The hell is that? Ah! At this point, I am essentially lying down in the bed with a headset on. Okay. And I, I cannot sleep, which is kind of funny considering how little I slept this week or this weekend. 
Yeah, it's a real... Like, every time I have slept, it's been very hard sleep. But, you know, it is what it is. Please, Sophia, cast magics. Rujenga. Get up in its face. <laughs> Skilled in swordplay and magic? Impressive for a machine. Oh no! That time I felt like I was I was firmly in its butt. Just hitting it. Okay, these big arcing attacks, I think I've got the right combo of classes. I think just like unloading on him with um with spells instead of just um keeping my buffs up is a mistake. And also ZP constantly blinking in and out of internet is really really messing with me because I have chat open so every time he blinks in or out the constant flash of purple yes like yo this stream started and here's the, the well, starting ad and purple also uh, every time he blinks in and out I think um, I don't want his you know stream eating up any bandwidth. So I have to, you know, bop out of what I'm doing to get rid of it. Uh, so where do I see how many stacks of whatever I need to cast Ultima I have? Uh... You can't switch jobs, also. Oh, That's the other okay. Thing. Yeah, from what you, you lose the stacks if you switch jobs. Okay, did not did yeah. not realize and that. And also, every time you let okay, let's say you have three white mage stacks, and yes. you switch to black mage, do two stacks, mm -hmm. and you switch back to the white mage spells, you lose a white mage st sp uh, stack. Oh, okay, so you need to be white mage, white mage, white mage, black mage, black mage, black mage. Yeah, you basically three do three, three, and three. Yeah. yeah, you do three and three, and then you cast Ultima. Okay. You, mm -hmm. you can't really... Uh, you commit to Sage. Yeah. It's not... I mean, it's not a real problem, because it kind of just works out in the sense that you're like, okay, I cast three... I either cast three buffs, or cast two buffs and an uh, offensive spell, and then cast three offensive spells, and then Ultima. How hard does Ultima hit? Huh? Pretty Very. hard. Okay. I'll try it. Let me try to go all in on Ultima this time. Ultima is how I killed the zombie dragon. Hey, if you if we get 30 Patreons for deep listens, maybe we will do something with Ultima, if you know what I'm saying, bro. Haste I think we might play Ultima 9. Protect Ga. Do you... Do you think them putting Ultima as a spell was an Ultima reference? Like, I think so. Might be. I mean, Ult Ult Ultima inspired. Ult yes. All sorts yeah, of like, stuff. Ultima actually had like some popularity in Japan too, right? Because it was. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. I would like to cast. Oh. I would like to cast haste. Get him. Get him, babes. My kung fu babes. Is Gino basically just reenacting like the villain from Hitman Absolution right now? Yeah, I just slit in women's throats. I might finish that game. I'm definitely going to put it on the poll because I reached 750 and they're therefore obligated to play through or play a significant amount of another game that I... How do I know that I've got Ultima charged up? It'll uh, be selectable. You have three and three. In the, in the bottom Ultima! Oh boy! 
Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I see. Do you see? Do you see? I do. So I just duck in, duck out, and then cast Ultima. Yeah. It, it is, if you want to get through a large chunk of this game uh, without a ton of difficulty, that that's the way to do it. Haste go. Kung Fu ladies, go. Protect Ga. Wind slash right back at you. Get him, Kung Fu ladies. I parried twice. Did you see that? Yeah. They said it couldn't be done. Not me. They said it. Ultima. Oh, it it got out of the Ultima. Oh no. Okay, I Ultima is good. Yeah. But that's really slow. That's a really slow way to win this fight. You cast haste on yourself. And then it's don't it don't take that long. To charge up. Well, now that I've got more bars, it's definitely going to be easier. Yeah. Side boss missions um, to earn like extra classes for the party members have only been difficult for me because I couldn't cheese the boss with Ultima because for some reason it, those missions lock you into specific points of mana. Well... Yeah, you start every mission with two bars of mana, and so the only way to get them is to beat the boss's first phase or just soul guard a bunch of attacks. Yeah, you basically need to be good at the game. Yeah. Like me. Just, just, just do what I do. It's all I have. Professional Final Fantasy Stranger of Origin player. Is, oh, I beat this game on hard. Take that, you piece of shit. Exactly. Piece of shit robot. Take it from here, Neon. Sick him. I'm pretty impre uh, impressed with like the radial button options. Like they're they're it's pretty snappy. They're doing a lot of stuff uh, quite well with the UI. Regenga. Playing this game makes me think that one day I actually should play Neo. Savage Blade, like, cool. One, one might say that Neo is the best game of 2017. Perhaps. I don't know who would say that. Some jerk ass with a list and opinions, probably. Okay. Uh, one might say that Neo 2 is the second best game of 2020. God, 2020 was a long time ago. Yeah, no. Hey, remember 2020? That was a while ago. I try Sorry, not to got, remember. Sorry, got bad news. Like, yeah. 
I have bad news. Uh, yeah, Shelvis? we're marching forward of time. Time, continues. yes, time continues. But I don't like that. <laughs> the ever, the ever-present specter of your mortality shall not escape death's grasp. Oh no! I changed jobs by accident. Dang it. I mean, that's how I feel when I get a promotion. Hey, oh. Ah, ah, ah. Uh, a little bit of office humor for you out there. <laughs> help. Yes, please do help Jack. Jokes that we all enjoy. Get it. Get it, my kung fu ladies. I would love to exploit their weakness, ladies. I would really like nothing more than to exploit its weakness. But I am way too low on HP. Ah! It redirects itself twice. I thought it would only redirect itself once. But, you know, at the very least, this combat is uh, getting me to actually parry instead of dodging everything. So that's good. I'm learning a lesson. You should play Sekiro. It's a game all about parrying. No, thank you. It turns... You become Parry the Platypus. Is there a platypus? I constantly... Keep getting sick. Oh, I'm sorry, Gino. Are you not aware of Perry's platypus? No. You're like, oh, too busy watching Crazy Ex Girlfriend to appreciate the artistry of Phineas and Ferb. I understand. Oh. You're a grown up. I, I, I don't even know what it is you're referencing. Perry the platypus? Of course. This is not uh, judgment on my side. I just don't know what you're talking about. I was not of the age for Perry the Platypus, but I have seen the internet well, that, that meme the matter. shit out of it. Do, do you think I was the right age for Phineas and Ferb? Maybe. I mean, I have no I'm idea. I'm in my late 20s. I turned 30 this year. I'm going to die alone. No, um. <laughs> Jesus, Matt. <laughs> Oh, I have to do when black magic first, right? The, the sudden backdrop of sudden. Oh God, my words. Hello, sudden darkness, backdrop of, my old friend. Yes, that song. It's come to Sound talk with you again. I mean, it's either that or. Oh, that one. Like you need yeah. to, you need to have like father issues for that one. Yeah. Oh, you know, it's been a while since I sang an emo song. Let me let me see if I've got a donation. I don't, but we're at thirteen thousand though, so that's good. Oh, nice. Because I, I death cab for cuties, uh, I will follow you into the dark. I I don't know if it counts technically, but I feel spiritually it must count. All right, you have another what? Five hours? Something like that. Okay. I, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna bounce for today because I'm just Power. I am tired. <laughs> oh damn it, I switched jobs. It's I know the feeling. And I wanna lie down, but it's too early to lie down and too late to take a nap. Yeah, it's it's the dark time when if you fall asleep now, you are going to screw up your sleep schedule entirely. Going to be destroyed forever, yes. Um, but also, my I can feel my th throat, my voice starting to go, and that's the other one. Yeah. So I, I wish you both well, Gino. Bye bye. Love you. Proud proud of proud of what you accomplished. Uh, 
if you get close to beating ZP, I will donate to make sure that he beats you. <laughs> alongside M. Rude. Okay, love you, bye. Bye. Everyone says they love me, and then they're like, but also, like, if you get close oh. to achieving your goals, um, I will stop you. I will stand yeah, directly will in your this. way. You know, sometimes they just want people that love you want you to grow as a person, so they throw adversity at you. That's what I tell myself. <laughs> sometimes. I died. Dang it. Uh, I feel like I should be hitting harder than I am. Does this is this thing not vulnerable to uh, punches? I'm I'm honestly not really sure. It could be that this thing's got some sort of weird magic resistance thing, because honestly, I feel like the Ultima, while it does do a, quite a bit of damage, I feel like every time I've used Ultima on a boss, it essentially just took a life bar out of him. Blood weapon. Get in there. Oh no! Smite is not a thing I can parry. Cannot parry smite. Well now I'm now I'm drunk on parrying. Living that life on on the edge of life and death, just like any mo any wrong move and you're dead. Yep. Bop bop. Blood weapon, just in case. Ah, the great wheel hits twice sometimes. That's a shame. Blood weapon. So I, I haven't been paying super hard attention, but is this uh, is there like a bet going on this year between you and CP? It's supposed to be. If I do better than him, um, he plays FF9 again. He did not tell me what happens if he does better than me. Oh, I just parry too much. Okay, if you parry too much, you do just get broken. Oh, okay. I can see why they might do that, because otherwise you would just literally parry everything. Yep. You can't parry everything. This game does not let you. Boom. Boom. Hit the shit out of it. Oh, right. Savage Blade cannot be parried. Some moves just can't be parried, too. Yeah, you gotta look for the glowing red stuff. So sometimes that's hard to see on certain enemies. I think I broke my record from last year. I don't really remember last year all too much. <laughs> We did quite well. Yes. Last year. And this year. But, like, last year as well. I forget if we got 15,000 last year or uh, 17. Get up in its grill. I can, I can check right now. But I know last year we, we technically did that extra weekend thing. Yes. We did do an extra weekend that put us over the top so that extra weekend was way easier than the original weekend yes just doing like specific time slots of like maybe an hour or two super easy to do zp is way better at pimping his stream than i am uh i'm gonna try the breaker i guess Let's try Breaker with a, a Katana. Yeah, that's a powerful Katana. Oh, okay. Yeah, so last year, 15,700. Oh, let's just say 15,800 last year. Okay. I think we're going to clear I that. Raised, yeah, I think we might clear that. Uh, we raised, or I mean, I raised $1,500 last year. Which this year, I raised 1700 Yeah, and I think I raised two last year. And this year, I'm raising... I'm already at... 
over two, and I'm pretty sure I'm in for uh, 200 more dollars that has not been donated yet, but I'm pretty sure is coming. Yeah, I'm looking at it, and it looks like almost everyone who was doing stuff last year has broken their records this year. Yeah, it's awesome. It's up to you, Sophia. Or at the very least, come Ooh. very close to the same number. I got broken. It is funny looking at this list and seeing Abby beat ZP by two dollars. Right now? Yep. Yep. It's it's, also it's funny like in both directions like because like Abby's beating ZP by you know, three dollars, but she's only beating him by three dollars. Which like and yeah. she's beating me by like what? Not that much more than that. No, like so the difference between you and him is like fifty dollars ish. So yeah, like it's not. Uh, it's pretty cool to see that like the runners who um, have been at this for a while now can like put up staff numbers or former staff numbers. Yeah, like I I'm legitimately surprised that I've been able to raise over a thousand dollars for the past three years, and it's just kind of it's always a pleasant surprise. I never expect to raise more than a thousand dollars, but. Yeah. Oh, it goes sideways, that attack. And I did, I don't know, I always feel like I tend to get, like, random donations from people at, like, 2 or 3 in the morning, too. Yeah. It is weird how that works. It's like the times when you expect that everyone's asleep. Oh, damn it. That felt like a good run, too. You know, the sage, the thing where I was just doing sage stuff, that sure did work. I was, like, going parry heavy, but what if instead I just cheese the boss? Haste, guh. Protect, guh. Regen, guh. Oh, I got broken. Oh, hello. Hi. How's it going? Yes, I have a soul patch. I have this ridiculous hair. I have this chain choker. Yep, I'm I'm living my best life. Uh, so, Jatsu, my sister is now here. Oh, you have your nails painted. I have my cool. nails painted. Um. She needed to witness this, right? She did. She so she donated fifty dollars and had a request from a couple of uh, from two days ago for a song. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, sing "Teenagers" by MCR now. All right. So she she's recording this right now, right? I don't know that she's I recording. That's this. why she came over. She's no. like, I need video evidence of this. No, I my dog I dog sit for her. Ah, okay. So let me just go ahead. I'm going to unplug my headphones for a second. Yeah, man. Uh, rock out, I guess. Okay. Here we go. Clean up your looks with all the lies in the books. They'll make a citizen out of you. Comes to to the gun. On you, son. I can touch all the things you do. Because the drugs never work, they're gonna give you a smirk. Cause they got methods of keeping you clean. Think about your bread, your aspirations to shreds. Another cog in the murder machine. They said, well, teenagers scare the living shit out of me. They could care less as long as someone will bleed. 
So darken your clothes and strike a violent pose. Maybe they'll leave you alone, but not me. The boys and girls in the clique, the awful names that'll stick. They're never gonna fit in much, kid. If you double and hurt, then what you got under your shirt will make them pay for the things that they did. They said, well, teenagers scare the living shit out of me. They could care less as long as someone will bleed. So darken your clothes and strike a violent pose. Maybe they'll leave you alone, but not me. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> they said, well, teenagers scare the living shit out of me. They could care less as long as someone will bleed. So darken your clothes and strike a violent pose. Maybe they'll leave you alone, but not me. All together now, teenagers scare the living shit out of me. They could care less as long as someone will bleed. So darken your clothes and strike a violent pose. Maybe they'll leave you alone, but not me. Teenagers scare the living shit out of me. They could care less as long as someone will bleed. So darken your clothes and strike a violent pose. Maybe they'll leave you alone, but not me. Oh, I'm gonna die. Nope. One sec. All right, there, sh there we go. Paid off. It is very funny how Ash is still like, ancient texture did a lot, but it's so, like, the game at this point has made clear that Nothing is ancient in this game. Yeah, this, I mean, I'm still not, I'm not sure where this is going. I, What's up? No. Yes, please. Ultima, taste it. Taste ga again. Yeah, you can kind of just run in, parry two things, get enough MP to do Boku damage, and then duck out. Yeah, that's that's certainly a strategy you can use. Oh no. But then you do get broken pretty easily. Regen. Ah, jerk. I wasn't paying attention All to about you. Managing that break gauge. I did enjoy how much, like, Arbitrary was like, you're not interacting with the break gauge at all. And I was like, yeah. And look at me at the end of the game. Getting to the end of the game just fine. Yeah, if you interact with the break gauge, it certainly makes things easier. Oh, almost got hit there. Uh, I feel like interacting with the break gauge just means being aware that it exists. Yeah, you really just don't need like, to. Oh wait, I I can't keep pairing. I need to back off for a bit. Just just for a second. Okay, Iron Giant first form down. Second form coming up. Kill screen coming up. Lop off its bottom half. If I were Jack Final Fantasy, I would simply uh, never stop. Oh, no. Never stop Superman punching these enemies? Uh, no, I would simply never stop um, 
crystallizing things. I mean, it seems like crystallizing stuff is pretty darn effective. I don't know. I'm waiting for this game to pull like a weird ah like near move and say like every time you've crystallized something you've lost a part of your soul. Yep. You committed a, a war crime every time you every time you crystallized anything. Here it comes. Oh, it hit it keeps going, huh? Oh, what the hell? I hate the second form of this thing. Oh, I leveled up Sage, right. Let me upgrade my stuff. Job trees, Sage. I unlocked Ultima. I can get my Sage affinity up, I guess. Magic damage, magic damage. Just a lot of magic damage abilities. Action ability MP cost is pretty good. Uh, but let's just get my Sage Affinity up. And, oh. Do I have a shield that increases Sage job affinity? Sage, 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 <laughs> Sage D. Nope, nothing. That sucks. Uh, well, I now have better passives. What passives did I get? Increases intellect and spirit. Increases MP. Oh. Oh. My MP up for parrying is now super high. Okay, let's go, Iron Giant. Do your little bullshit moves. Your first form no longer scares me. I just need to not be dumb. Haste Ga. Protect Ga. Regen Ga, so my, my colleagues do not die. Now, Thundaga. I think I heard you say Thundaga. Thundaga. That's the final form of thunder. Thundaga. Oh, th Thundaga. I thought you said, like, Thundaga. Like, yo, fun. We're having fun here. That'd be fun. There's fun, Thunda, and Thundaga. The three, the three levels of fun. One downside of Ultima, I can't tell what the hell is going on inside of the Ultima. Yeah, it's it's literally just a sphere of death. I think I think ZP is calling his mom. Again? Oh, I died because I tried to parry something that can't be parried. Dang it. I'm very close to hairstyling. Like, dangerously close. It could end up very dangerously, yeah. Protect Ga. Regen Ga. Get him. Like, if someone said, if they donated the amount of money and said, perm. Are you oh, no. Perm? No, I can't perm. I honestly don't even know how you perm. Uh, perming takes um, chemicals. Perms involve chemicals. Ah. You need to basically denature your hair. It, it's it's a whole thing. Yeah, that doesn't sound healthy. It's not. It's really bad for your hair. Oh, that's going to reach me in net. Yep. Regenga. Get him. Get him, Kung Fu ladies. I'm sure at one point there's going to be someone who beats this game by just standing back, constantly spamming, like, regen, and just letting the allies do everything. Yeah, I mean, why not? They're really good. They are quite good. They've got all of your abilities. Is 
That's how I beat Lich. I just kited the enemy around and uh, then let my Kung Fu ladies take him out. Boom. Far enough away that it can't mess me up, and then. Oh, no, not Thundaga. Ultima. <laughs> nice. Okay. First form down. On to the second form. <laughs> it doesn't know what it's doing. Forgive it, for it knows not what it does. Ah, what? Shit. That last attack is really strong. Oh, that lightning bolt I was not prepared for, and it huh. fucked me up bad. I guess I usually get killed by the, uh, the rest of that attack, so I never notice that there is a follow-up. Thing at the end. Haste go. Let's get fast. Then let's get protected. Then let's get regenified. And then uh, thunder on its head. Oh. Oh, I'm dead. I screwed up my parries, and that got me killed. So question. Arbitrary says he's very good at these games. What do you think is a better sign of skill? Him using all of the systems and the armor? Or running around as a Calvin Klein model? I mean, neither is, neither is a true test of skill, if you think about it. It's just one gives you more leeway than the other. I feel like one is slightly more... It's okay, you can call uh, him a coward. What's the term? Cowardly? <laughs> call him a coward. <laughs> one of them is more cowardly than the other. I'm I, I'm just still trying to figure out if it's mas ma was it masochist or sadist. Which is the one that likes to inflict pain on themselves? Masochist. So one is definitely more that, <laughs> but there's a certain amount of bravery to it as well. Captain know, Under. The weird thing to me is that I'm kind of watching you play, and I, and this is what's kind of freaking me out. If I'm being perfectly honest. I don't think there's that big of a difference in the damage they do to you. I don't think it is. And that's actually freaking me out more, because I thought, like, I was honestly pretty sure that you would be instantly destroyed by everything, just because, like, it's not like you can gain levels or increase your stats in any other way besides having gear. So the gear, um, it really just, uh, helps with, like, your affinities, which gives you better buffs. But like, yeah, and that's definitely powerful in this game. But yeah, but it's not the be all end all. Uh, re Regenga. Like when I was facing the Kraken, it would kill me in two hits if I wasn't careful. So it was more or less doing the same thing to you. Yeah. So it actually just kind of makes me wonder how the stats of this game actually work. I just think defense doesn't matter that much. Like, just playing the game correctly I mean, I don't think, matters more than the stats. I don't think that it doesn't matter. I think that... Hmm. It matters less it's than confusing. playing the game right. Yeah. 
Like, really, though. Like, if you learn the patterns. Like, Dark Souls and, like, the Souls games, there is a, like, you must be this tall to enter. Um, oh, I don't want to waste Ultima on this. Yeah, I mean, there's a certain degree of, like, okay, let's say you could compare this to playing Mega Man but not using the boss's weaknesses. Yeah, so, like... You're just Mega Bustering everything. Yeah, and Mega Buster does damage to all enemies. So, like, um... In Dark Souls or Elden Ring, you need to do a certain amount of leveling because otherwise you don't deal damage at all. Like, you cannot hurt enemies. In this game, you can hurt them even without all of the equipment and everything. Like, it's not actually required that you have all of the items and, you know, all the optimal choices. Yeah. Like this is so. This is this game is a far difference from say like, let's say you're playing. Well, the the, the best example I could think of is let's say you're playing Diablo, mm -hmm. and you know your character is really strong because of their gear, but yep. then for whatever reason, you die and you're you have to go get your corpse, so you can't, you don't have any of your gear until you pick up your corpse. At that point, your character is basically worthless. Whereas in this game, that is not the case. Yeah, if you do a good job of playing the game. You actually can, uh, like, you still deal damage, even if you've got the weak weapons in this game. You, you just deal less. Yeah. Um, whereas in Elden Ring, if you have the weak weapons, you deal zero damage because the enemies have a, like, minimum, you know, threshold, pretty much. Yeah, it's like a hard... It reminds me of like older, older school RPGs where it's just like, okay, my defense is 50 and their attack is 51, so I take one damage. damage yeah. Whereas in this game, if you have, um, you just have 50 damage, you know? Yeah. Like, you will deal 50 instead of 500. But you can eventually stack up them 50s and you will kill them. You know? Mm -hmm. Though at the same... I mean, at a certain point it doesn't become feasible. Even with stuff yeah. like that. Like your... 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 Um, your uh, not barrier to entry. Your um, margin for error is just so small that you can't feasibly do it. But um, in this game at least, you it's not because you... Um, you just have no choice, right? Like, you need to grind levels, because to not grind levels means you can't deal any damage at all. Yeah. I mean, it's kind of funny. There's, there's people who do the Dark Souls-style game in the exact opposite direction, where instead of them being like, oh, I refuse to use gear, they're saying, like, oh, I refuse to level my character up. And yeah. everything I do is based off of gear. But in this game, I mean, you can do a lot of stuff with not a lot of equipment. Which is cool. Get get them, Kung Fu girls. Get them, my Kung Fu ladies. Ooh, yeah. Get grabbed. Get them. Bye-bye. Got him. Bye, Iron Giant. Disappear. Shatter. I will stop playing this if I beat the game. <laughs> that would also stop my stream. Got no backup plan? Nope. I didn't think I could beat the game. I... In the amount of time I'm I mean, playing. I don't... Yeah, I don't think this game is that long i had no idea i literally avoided any and all information yeah oh this this is the year that i completed the least amount of games nice
Oh, that was Astos. She's like an evil princess, Sarah. Punch Astos. Where did that come from? This is my <laughs> field. Are you sure you want to know? For strangers, that means two things. <laughs> One, we're strangers to this world, and two, we're strangers to ourselves. Oh, wow. Remembering who we are. That's what makes us all catch your hesitation. Mm. The mercy that you get. But your word. It's actually good to not know who we're fighting or why. It doesn't matter. In the end, we are the ones we see. That'll just raise too many questions. Mm -hmm. All waste of time when you could just be killing chaos. Yep. Perhaps Astos can shed light on our fate. See you again, Peter Gaston. Can't you see I'm smiling? I'm laughing, actually. Ha 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 ha. I'm enjoying myself. Oh, let's talk to Jed. There's no mercy in forgetting you. No matter what you do. Time to face your past, Jack. What is up, Neon? T pose. What's. She. she they reused that line. What do you think I said to her? <laughs> you see, in peace, it'll all make sense. It'll all make sense in time. What's up, Astos? Oh, thanks for saving me. I mean, okay. What are you doing here? My eternal duty. Oh no. Work, monitoring the darkness, keeping track. Yes, I'm fast. What with your help. <sighs> fine, fine. But first, I need a little favor. Oh no. Step outside, and you'll see a strange. <laughs> <laughs> the place is rife with monsters born from chaos. Give them the old one two. They make it difficult. What? Oh, and if you see any other new edifices pop up, give them the same treatment, would you? Ideally, before they escape darkness and death to face the light. Using us for your own ends? Heavens no. You forget this is simply what you wanted from me. Now, I have work to do. What? <laughs> Man can teleport away but cannot defend himself. Okay, fool's missive. Do you have back to Cornelia? Cornelia? What did Astos tell me? It's just like. Go, go clear more dungeons. Basically. Uh, I mean, do you need anything else? Where? No. Guess not. It's just funny. Oh, ZP is now in front of Abby. Uh, yes. Okay, I got some equipment, but who cares? Remembering home. Okay. <laughs> he has a single dollar more raise than her. Yep. Are people saying anything in my chat? No. Okay, remembering home. There's still more levels, huh? Wait, let me see. Job tree. Sage? Did I get anything? Nope. Okay, I can't really. 
Can't really upgrade anything. Okay, let's change my classes. I suspect that whatever that is is probably the last area because the level cap is 100 there. But I could be wrong. This is just a guess. Yeah, I mean, it. who's to say that 100 is the last level? That That's true. You never know with these games. Video games be like that sometimes. Mm -hmm. Can I talk to my very good friends? Characters with names? For some reason, I thought like It Takes Two was between like five to six hours, and it turns out it's like 15. If you've seen you kill those things, well, your own great so, don't care sometimes you. games surprise you. Mm -hmm. May the Christmas blessing... Everyone's scared of you. I saw the lady. No warrior likes to serve. Oh, Fred, no. Fred's dead. Fred doesn't like you. Emmy doesn't like you. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Some of the people think that you're a monster. Some people think you're a savior. Which one's this one? Dimension 15. Ah. That's what I have to say about that. What if this was just in the car the whole time? That'd be great. We're you, still. You know what's weird? I've played. I've played something like 30 hours of Final Fantasy 15, mm -hmm. and it was more so not because I wanted to, but because it was just a case of like, yo, my friends are on PlayStation Network and want to talk, so mm -hmm. it's something to kill time with. Mm -hmm. And I do not know what's going on in that game, and it's not fun to play. <laughs> The FF15 people are always like, yo, the bros in the car do bro stuff in the car, and that's good enough for me, basically. I mean, that can be good. Don't get me wrong. It's just it's it's not fun to play. At least I, I couldn't find a fun way to play it. On purpose. It's not there anymore. <gasps> Jack's empty. Running on empty. Right. Oh boy, this is a big building. Okay, I can't go straight. In his defense, if I was in the world of Final Fantasy 15, I would lose all purpose as well. Yep. Why am I? Why is anyone? I would just, I would just be fishing in some lake and being like, well. This is a thing I can do. Skeletons again. I forget what curse does. Oh, curse, right. It lowers your uh, stamina. It lowers your, your break gauge. A barrier? There's no off switch, but I bet we need to beat the shit out of some skeletons. Oh, no. Assassinate. How do I know how many stacks I've put on enemies? For assassin. Uh, Did you get I think assassin? You can see it on their name, like just underneath their name bar or whatever the heck, you'll see like an icon. Okay. There's or probably a very tiny number there too, if I were to guess. Punch rush. I'm moving too fast to be able to tell. Ah. I'm just gonna punch you across the room. Ah, I got poisoned? Oh, there were black widows in the corner. It's like what even what even can poison me? Oh, let me start with 
hasting everyone and protecting everyone. Okay, now I see why you were so gung-ho about buffs. It definitely matters in the late game. I mean, I just like moving fast. Moving fast is pretty good. I don't know. I feel like this job or this weapon, like, you're always moving fast. But what if you moved faster? That's true. You can always move faster. It's essentially that whole, like, uh, what's the freaking new Star Wars movie called? The one before the newest. Uh, Last Jedi, where Last the guy's Jedi? screaming, more. <laughs> more! Can I get through this now? No? What the heck? I punched everything to death. Oh, is this a door? It doesn't look like a door. I guess that's not a door. Where am I supposed to go? Is this a door? Nope. This sure does look like an FF15 level. In that it looks completely uninteresting. Where am I supposed to go? I assume I can't go out this door at the entrance. Why? No. Hmm. A conundrum wrapped in an enigma. Do I need to punch a wall down? Can I punch the barrier? No, that's not it. Punch this. Is this a button? That is not a button. Uh, break the pillars. This game finally pulling a where do I go bit on you? I, uh, the oddity to me is that there's barely anything in this room. Oh, this thing, this pillar here. Maybe I punch this. I was like, this game doesn't seem to do that sort of thing. There's always yeah, a thing generating I mean the barrier. I guess it did have that level where you need to break the lava flow with things or... There's been a lot of, like, find the thing to punch so that you can get past stuff. Yeah. A lot of the level design is go to this place, find the thing that is punchable, punch it. Maverick Knuckles. Are they better than the Knuckles I've got equipped? They are, but they are not for my class. And it seems like a sa like affinity is as important or more important than uh, the other stats. Die water elemental. These water elementals are taking a lot more punching. And that bat killed me in one hit. Oh no, something's in my eye. And I can't touch it because of the eyeliner. Oh, this is the dark timeline. Oh no. I'm gonna see if I can bop in to... I'm going to ask if I can pop into chat. Is he is he done? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I'm towards the end of the game here. Okay, let's run past as much stuff as I can. The bosses are the bosses, and I still deal damage to the bosses. I don't think I need more levels, necessarily. I think I just need to break that thing. 
Let's go ahead and zap that thing. Oh no, don't die. I just want to break the thing that, no. No! What? <laughs> that bat! Bats are killing me. Bats are always a threat in this game. They didn't used to kill like me in one hit. I like reaction to your transformation. Oh, what is... Has something happened? Uh, Relkin in chat says, Oh, wow, I hadn't seen your transformation yet. Congrats, I hate it. I think he's speaking of the emo look. Yes. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah. I hate it. That's nailed it then. Oh, I'm dead. Behold. This is what I look like right now. This is when you respond with, this is also, me now. Yes. This is happening. This also, is real. This. Sometimes the truth is ugly. Congrats, I hate it. <laughs> yeah, so I am continuing Stranger of Paradise. I am apparently, like, a few levels from the end of the game. Um... I have unlocked most of the classes that do not involve defense. Now then. Ready to try again? Yes, I guess I am ready to try again. Drop Thundaga on the thing I need to destroy. Please. Please. Please target thing I need to destroy. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> Ugh. That room is full of death. I don't know what to do here. They they have this turned the this is the Dark Souls room of this game. Yeah, the early game I was just like hauling through. And there are only like twenty enemies in this game. If that. There's goblins, skeletons, elementals of every elemental combination. Um Is that the furthest reach I can get? Does that work? Oh, it's not far yeah, enough. Yeah, I mean, I'm trying to think myself, but the ones I've seen were, yeah, you're right, goblins, skeletons. Goblins, uh, jack skeletons. Yeah, bombs, bombs slimes. Slimes, tonberries, cactars. Yeah, the, uh, the robot dudes. Wolves. Pirates. Pirates, yeah. Sahajins. Uh, what else? I guess the wall, the wall butts. Yep, the, the wall walls. anuses. <laughs> nice nails with his whole look. I look like I'm ready for 11th grade. Yep. This is just back to the beginning of the level. Yep. Okay. Welcome to the FF15 level. I hate it here. I'm not on chat, right? Are those cubes? <laughs> Are those cubes? Uh, no. No, it's ZP and Rory right now on chat. Okay. They keep saying, are those cubes? A and they still yeah, have yeah, not explained what Every the hell the cubes are. By it, like, what? Cubes? Cubes? I love cubes. 
Uh, assassin job affinity, extended evade. Let's do this. Extended evade invincibility seems like my sort of deal. Yeah, more iframes. I love iframes. What are we even doing? <laughs> ah! I like what Jack's asking. What are we even doing here? What, well, we do this for Astos, and then he tells us what we want to know. What do we want to know? Uh, it, has he seriously lost all purpose? Like, is that what he's saying? Yeah. Well, he's realized. Just without the burning desire to fight chaos, he's just like, well. Yeah, like, who what? Who am I? What is even going on here? Just a confused child at this point. Pretty much. Uh, I feel like skeletons would be weak against fire. Nope. How's about wind? They're weak against wind. Skeletons hate wind. Everyone knows this. Fucking bats. Right back at you, bat. Idiot using a move that you're weak against. If I was an enemy, I would simply never use a move I'm weak against. Yesterday, Reki was asking... Um, like, why does the game sound like it's coming out of a tin can? And I didn't realize that the this is one of those games that cuts out the music when you're low on HP. So I was like, what the hell is wrong with my setup? Why is the game sounding like it's coming out of a tin can? But yeah, it's you're just... just constantly living on the edge of death. Yeah, it's because I'm almost it's the, dead all it's the time. The, uh, it's the path you chose. Yep. Because I'm one step closer to the edge, and I'm about to break! Oh. You know? <laughs> yep. Oh, this is a bad room. This is a bad room. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Yep. <laughs> that was a bad room. Just instant death. I think at, uh, at 6, I will sub in for ZP because he's been on chat for two hours. I'll tag in. All right, let's go past this room. Run into this room. Follow me. Ignore, ignore the skeletons. Follow me. Punch this pillar. Okay. Dodge, 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 dodge. We'll say there's there's a very interesting feeling that whenever I've done these, where like you're on chat and. It's four in the morning, and you're like, please, someone else just take the spot. Yep. <laughs> you're just like, anyway. I need to fade away into the... Into sleep. into nothingness. Please. Yeah. Let's, go. Let's, make this entertaining. Let's make this entertaining. I agree, Neon. Let's make this entertaining. What's... I, I remember very specifically one year. Um, it was when I was playing Mother 3. Where... I think I was set to be from like midnight to one mm -hmm. or something like that. And then the person who was supposed to replace me never showed up. Oh Lauren no. Was just like, well, Yatsu, I'm just going to leave you on. And I was like, but. But, nappies. Yeah, it's like I didn't have the heart to say no because like no one else was there. It's like, oh no. Punch the pillar. Punch the pillar, Jack. Punch the pill. Ah! Oh. Damn it, Jack! Not the enemies. The pillar. Have you gotten to the point where you're just like, no, I just need to break the. I need to unlock yes. the next room. Let's just yes. go. Yes, I just need the room. Jack, don't worry about the levels. The levels don't matter. At one point, are you going to find a way to Ultima that pillar? I don't have enough MP to Ultima the pillar. Oh, 
I don't know if these fists hit hard enough to break the pillar. You know, I could use the breaker class. Make this do it that way. Oh no. Sophia, you tracked bats into here. Okay, punch the pillar. Punch the shit out of the pillar. Oh god! Fucking bats. Oh, I had forgotten about the horses. <sighs> the horses suck. Um, I guess I'll swap to Katana. Oh, that thing, 91% affinity for Breaker? Hell yeah. What does that get me? Lots of stats. You know what all those stats might allow me to do? Just cleave these dudes in one hit. Hey, buddy. Uh, not quite one hit. Pretty close. Oh, I gotta save the queen. I know that from game. From game, I like. Oh no. Oh, I should have saved supersonic wave. It's really good for crowd control. Okay, I've got an extra potion. Now let's go into this room, and I will try to Zantetsuke in the pillar. Oh, horses. Nope. No horses. Nope. So, your plan at this point is to assassinate the pillar. Yes. I am trying to do exactly that. Zantetsuke in the pillar. Yes! We've decapitated their leader. Is and the pillar, the pillar of their whole strategy, the, the pillar. The, the pillar is in pillar. charge. If we take down the pillar, everything else falls. <laughs> All right, I am swapping myself into chat. It's going to take a second. Ugh. Okay, that is done, and now I need to make sure that chat did not reset and use up my bandwidth on my side. There we go. Hello, folks in chat. I am at near the end of Stranger Paradise, I think, probably. The other voice you hear is Jatsu, who has been a push-up maniac across. Yes, I have done 8,000 push-ups this one. Weekend. 1,000. I'm glad you did it over the course of the weekend and not a day, because I thought you were maybe doing it in one day. No, that's... I... No. I couldn't. It wouldn't work. I would die. Uh, look, I, I don't know what sort of push-up shape you're in. At my peak of fitness, I could probably do 40 in a sitting... Which would then, you know, 40 in a set, and I usually would do three sets. And then if I'm able to do multiple sets across the days, explode. Yeah. Thank you, canister. Yes, I did mean to do that. Zantetsuken. That is a very cool move. Get, get out of the way, girls. 
Oh no. What? No. It just took me back where I was. What happened? Is it one of those circular shortcut things? It can't be. No, this has to be where I have to go. I just must have made a wrong turn somewhere. But there was a treasure chest. I can't get the treasure chest. Okay, treasure chest. Is there something in the treasure chest? Where, where is it? Oh, the bats are following me. The bats are the only enemies in this game that fucking follow you like this. Bats are, in fact, relentless, yes. Have some supersonic wave of your own, you stupid bats. Oh, right, I can't. I can't parry leech. Okay. So that's... Oh, I can open the... Uh, no? Where? I opened the red door. Where? Where am I supposed to go? Was there another pillar I didn't see? Please. Pillar? No, this is back in the room I was in before. I can't break that. There's nothing over here. Where could I possibly go? Was there another red door that I didn't notice? If I'm being honest, I'm I'm not paying a huge amount of attention. That's fine. That's I'm kind of That's fair. That is totally fair. Uh okay, that's the I am door. I am surprised my eyes work at this point. Same. <laughs> Just Oh, there's another there was another red door. Okay. I will say this. It is well, I don't think it's surprising to me, but the amount of energy you can gain by just having another person to talk to is phenomenal. Yes, it is. Just shouting into the void. And chat, chat fulfills that if, if folks in chat are chatting. Yeah, absolutely. Loathe this game's design aesthetic. Uh. When one Matt Rory questioned whether or not I was actually playing Resident Evil 8. It filled me with an energy that <laughs> I absolutely needed. Oh, I just felt something. Someone, someone made a donation. Looks like I think ZP got over the $3,000 threshold, if I had to guess. Reminder, this is the Giant Bomb Community Endurance Run. We are raising money for Pencils of Promise, a charity that builds schools, trains teachers, and sets kids to school in developing nations. If you're in a position to donate, please do. For every $20 raised, I will sing you an emo song for my list of emo songs. And I am $200 away from having to style my hair into a, you know, whatever you choose. I will put something up in poll. I'll make a poll. You know, maybe it's, uh... I feel like my... You know, Fohawk. I mentioned something about you could donate $4 to ZP's page to make it a round number, and then someone donated $5 instead. Mm -hmm. So now it's 2101. And the OCD in my soul is just going, ah! You monsters. How Fuck. dare you give me more than I need? Ah! No! Stupid wind blast. We got this. Okay, that's not what we want. Randomly looking at Cyberpunk makes me think this is a game I may actually want to play, but I fear that I will just never have the time to play it completely. Yeah, I mean, Cyberpunk is definitely a game that it seems like you need to spend a lot of hours to beat. Is, is Rory playing Cyberpunk now? Uh, yes. He okay. is, in fact, yeah, Cyberpunk right now. 
Because I saw he was playing Magic before. Alright, let's, let's hit this thing and blow it up. So that seems like the actual secret to this level is go and hit the exploding barrels. It is the black of Final Fantasy Origin Stranger in Paradise. I am never going to get that name right. Final, Final Fantasy or happen. Stranger of Paradise. Final Fantasy Stranger Origins. Of Origin, Final Yes. Final Jack. Angry Man. Yes. Jack Final Fantasy's Final Fantasy Origin Stranger of Paradise. Boom, Zantetsuka. Zantetsuka. Touch of death. <laughs> oh, I've gotten a message from someone on Steam that has cut me to my soul. What is it? It is a person whom I used to play an MMO with many, many years ago. And it was asking me, like, have you given Final Fantasy XIV any thought? And I'm just like, no. Oh, no. No, I haven't. I can't. I can't do this. I'm not strong enough. Actually, strength has nothing to do with it. I just, I can't. Yeah. Now we've got an easy way back. You need some of yourself for yourself. Yes. You can't give it all to the MMOs. The MMOs. Oh, this, I've been here before. Like, the, the amount of relief I felt when I broke free of the MMO that I had played for 10 plus years was... Cool. Just great, you know? Always good when you're playing a game and then when you stop playing it, what you feel is relief. Yeah. Especially that one, because there was a certain level of stress to it. Was like, it RuneScape? Were you a RuneScape person? No, it was, um... It was Ragnarok Online. Ah, Ragnarok Online. So, uh, I actually had a friend who played Ragnarok Online and, like, bought it and, and was, like, fairly into it. Um, and I was like, Mom and Dad, can I get a Ragnarok Online account? Because what he was doing seemed fun. And they said no. And thank goodness they said no. Oh, absolutely. Like, that game... Oh, my God. Like, it, it, it had the whole... You know, there's, like, the joke sometimes when you see an MMO in a television show. And it's like, oh, we can't sleep. We need to do this. We need to do that. Yep. Ragnarok Online was that actual game. It, it had, like, territory control stuff that would happen at certain times of the day, so you needed to be on for that to defend your territory, and just like, wow. No, no, thank you. Up, oh, I got two more Anima shards. Uh, physical damage up? Yeah, let's do that. Please. More damage. Sounds good. I guess FF15 has bananas and coconuts? Uh, sure. Why not? I My time with Final Fantasy XV has been spent hunting random monsters and fishing. I thought you uh, didn't like FF12, but those are... That sounds like FF12 business to me. Oh no, web. Ah. Yep. Hmm. I don't hate FF12. I just don't like them, like at all. You don't like Vaughn? Oh, yeah. Yeah, like I. Uh, there's not much to like. He's got a. He's got a very. I mean, there's nothing. There's no. I don't hate him by any means, but it's like a constant. Like, why are you here? Like, they, he shouldn't be there. It's like the the one person who hangs around you, but like no one's really his friend. But like, yep. What? Like, what are you doing? Why are you here? Who are you? I almost again? feel mean. You know, like just... How, who invited you to this party? Oh no! I died. Oof. 
at least I got a save point, and now I've got to go through this terrarium, and I guess I don't need to kill those dudes. Oh, there was a treasure chest. Those were tall chairs. Let's see what's inside. Tall chairs, you say? They're, look, look at how tall these chairs are. Hang on a second. They're as tall as him. Oh, yeah, those are unreasonably high chairs. Jack wouldn't sit in that chair. That's a that's not, that, five foot. That's not a comfortable chair, chair to sit in. Oh wow! It's have you ever seen one of these plants? Uh, uh, I forget. I think it's no. a corpse flower, is what it's called. So these things bloom once a year, or it, it's once every. It's a very long time period. It's not a year. Um, they bloom very irregularly, and they apparently stink to high heaven. Um, but they're a very beautiful plant. Um, the New York Botanical Garden had one. And it, you know, blooms so irregularly, they make a big to-do every time it does. Kind of like hold an event when it happens, hey? Yep. Hmm. All right. They're like, hey, come. And it apparently smells, it's called a corpse plant because it smells of rotting flesh. Excellent. I'm sure that's some sort of, like, evolutionary protection that it has. Yep. Or I think it draws in flies. Oh, that might do it too, yeah. And that pollinates it. Uh, a desperate hunger gnawing at the stranger's heart was put there by Lefenians. The urge to destroy chaos is the principle that will guide them, and through the overall quality of darkness, and the world will be diminished. That's why he fights even now. What will become of him when chaos in its current forms is defeated? When he rediscovers his own links to Lefenia, what will be his reason to fight? If he cannot remember his final goal, it is then that my services as shepherd will truly be needed, though I genuinely hope he can recall his true mission without the need for my intervention. Okay. So, Jack, there's a higher cause for you. You are the stranger of paradise. I'm waiting for stranger of paradise to Jack returns. The jackening. Take that, all you suckers. Ha! It can't get through the door. It's too big. That is excellent. Sometimes things work out. Oh, one of my arms is too big. I'm too bulky. Wow. I didn't think we'd get through this way. One more secret. All I can see on Rory's screen right now is a corpse with its legs ripped off above its head. Yeah. And I just have questions. Ah. That sounds bad. Legs akimbo. Dual wielding your own legs doesn't turn out well. Can imagine. What's he in that town like? No idea. Whatever it was, he's not selling it. Mm -hmm. One thing's for certain. We're better off if we better run the other way, can't we? I've got to be close to the end of this section, right? I don't know if there's another anus. Another anus. Oh no. I did a bad job there. Uh, so I think I could just like run up Zantetsuka in that thing and, and be on my way for the most part. Oh, I need to go up. Up the elevator. Were the bugs in Cyberpunk over over exaggerated? No, they fixed it a lot. <laughs> it took them a year to pass cert. Like cert is usually a like perfunctory thing. You don't need to worry about. They needed to worry about it badly. Hall of Chosen Ones. Where's the walliness? Where you at? There it is. Oh, there's two of them. Over there. Destroy it. Be vigilant. I'll make it regret it. Oh no. No, don't kill me. Oh. Okay, the fact that there's two of them means that I probably can't just cheese it by running up to the wall and 
and hitting it, especially since it spits out a giant uh, ogre. It's mostly the giant ogre. Ah, I'm all turned around. Okay, it's not that way. It's this way. And then I need to call the elevator and go up. Any donations are much appreciated. Again, $200 away from hair, hair stuffs. Oh, I didn't even put my donation link in chat. I don't think. Uh, I have the page open. I could do that. I got it. Yeah, to those of you watching, you could force him to get a faux hawk. Like, yeah. Anytime you like. Anytime. Are there any other hairstyles on the table that you are aware of? Beyond faux hawk? Yeah. Um. Like, is, is a bowl cut? I, no, I'm not going to No, gonna I'm not going to cut my hair. Not. Oh, st you're right. Style your hair. Style I will style it. So you could do the slick back. I could. I was thinking there's also the kind of anime spiky hair. Yeah. You could do the forced part. Like could. the parting of the hair. Oh, no. Oh. Well, I blew up one of the anuses, so every time I blow one of them up, this, this fight gets easier. Because it will spawn fewer enemies. One anus away from freedom. Two anuses away from freedom. There was a third... Anus, oh, I didn't even anus. see. I didn't even see the third, the third one. It's the third one that gets you. Yeah. The first two you're prepared for, but it's the third one that gets you. You need to plug all three of the anuses. Uh, something tells me that you might want to keep one available just so, you know, you could still function, but... No, 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 no. You need to plug all three. Oh, you should be dead. No. I... You were down. No. Lock onto the actual thing I'm trying to target, please. Ah! I thought it was low enough. I hit the circle button, and then the enemies were like, here it comes. They, they lulled you into a false sense of security they to did. get you near them. They did. The anus puckered, and I was like, yes, now is the time. And then it it started healing. It went full Venus flytrap on you. Yep. Hmm. Did ZP already eat his nightmare pizza? Yes, he did. Uh, he said that the worst thing that he did was uh, sesame oil because ZP doesn't know how to add condiments to anything. So he had no mm -hmm. idea that um, sesame oil is really a, like, it's a little. You only need a little. Okay, two down. Now just one, and so now it should just be this ogre, this mad gigas. I'm actually just super glad no one decided to do, like, the, the stealth, like, really mean one where they're like, oh, we need you to put, like, this hot Italian, you know, pepper oil or something. Yeah. Because that could, I mean, some people like that, but that could also be incredibly dangerous for someone who doesn't like meat. Well, the sesame oil, if he had just um, actually used, like, the doctor recommended amount of it, he would have been fine. The problem was that he did not realize how much is enough. So he just, like, put a, a huge dollop of it. And just, like, slathered it in oil, He basically. slathered it. And have you ever had sesame oil? Um, 
Not that I'm aware of. It's a very strong flavor. Um, it's a very nutty flavor, very strong. You really only need a little, and you're – it's like an extract almost in that way. Mm-hmm. Okay. So you My really don't need growing much. Up, we're all more about olive oil, so that was pretty much just on everything and available as a condiment, which a lot yes. of people look at and go, like, what? what are you doing? Yes, it's awesome. It's great. It's a great condiment. Oh, no, it's good. I love it for cooking, like putting a little bit of it on stuff. But my family would literally just boil potatoes and like, well, now this is just potatoes and olive oil. For olive oil. Potatoes and olive oil is a new one. I, I mean, bread and olive oil, bread, olive oil, salt, pepper. That's a meal for me. Oh, yeah, that's that's really good. Extra virgin olive oil, bread, salt, pepper. That That's all I need to be happy in this world. Ability break damage. Okay, I've almost got another ability break damage up. So I'll hold on for that. Because that's what allows me to Zantetsuke and things to death. We got this. Oh, it's a manticore. A behemoth. <sighs> How do I know that it's a behemoth? Behemoths don't usually have wings. Look like a behemoth? It does, except the wings. Hmm. How do I know the Final Fantasy stuff? Oh, Comet. It does have Comet. It has Rush. Uh, let's cheese this thing. Haste ga. Protect ga. Regen ga. Up, oh, it's got heave. Uh, Blazaga, maybe? I don't know what it's weak against. I think the behemoth's thing is that it's just resistant to everything. That's usually what it is in these games. It usually doesn't have a weakness. Yeah, it's just a super strong monster that'll mess you up if you're not careful. This is a really small level to be fighting something this big on. Oh no. My MP's low now. Do you always start with Comet? Oh boy. Heave seems messed up. Haste, go. You know, I'm trying to go. think. Was there a Final Fantasy II reference in that game? Which game? In Sorry, in this game. In Stranger of Paradise. There is a two level, yeah. The two level is like the second level. But it's... um. Oh, so the, the BK level. No, oh, sorry. Third level, then. Um, oh, okay. It's Astos's level. Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. It's pandemonium. Like, I, I honestly had not realized that they were doing that thing until I got to the Final Fantasy um, 13 level, and I recognized the music. Mm hmm Yeah, it took me... Like, the 13 level was just so clearly 13. Oh, yeah, it was very... It was pretty much just that. It was absolutely that level. Water? Are you weak to water? What are you weak against? Tell me your secrets. Oh, boy! Meteor. Jack doesn't have time to scan. It would be very funny if they gave Jack scan. What are you doing, Jack? I'm learning. Oh, no. See, I would like them to give him scan, but every time you use it, he just, like, fights against the player. It's like, oh, it's a waste of time. We just need to kill Chaos. Fuck. I would love to know what this thing's weak against. Uh, so, yep, it's got... It's got all the behemoth moves. It's got Meteor. It's got Heave. Oh no. Ah ah Okay, Rush Rush just insta kills me. Don't don't get hit by Rush. Much like the band Rush. Just Getty Lee showing up and messing you up. Yep. Da dun da dun da dun da dun da dun dun. That's not that's not Rush, but 
think the easiest rush tune would be like da 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 Something. If, I mean, I could try assassin, Maverick Knuckles with assassin. I haven't done Monk in a while. Sonic the Hedgehog Knuckles, and change my job to my boy Monk. See, I knew I knew Jack was a fan of Sonic. That's why he's got the son the knuckles. Yep, the Sonic and Knuckles. Sonic Knuckles. The Sonic and Knuckles. Focus up. What I like about Monk is that it has a buff duration up. Oh no. Blood weapon. Okay. All right, that that can work. Um, I just need to learn its patterns, and I'll I, as long as I can parry like one or two attacks, I should be able to hit it pretty darn hard, pretty fast. Um, and focus lasts forever. Sounds like ZP is going for about thirty more minutes, so and then stop. Cool. Oh boy. It may end up being yourself, Rory, and Rio. Rio's still going? Last yeah, Rio's still going. Wow. I thought Rio was uh, scheduled to be done already. Work the ribs, uh, Jack. I think he probably was, but I think he has, he's, he's gotten too into this AM2R, and now he's going for it. He just wants to beat it. Okay. Please don't come after me. It's shocking how well made this fan game is. What is it? The uh, so AM2R is a remake of Metroid 2 for the Game Boy. Hmm. It, it kind of looks like Metroid Fusion in the style of Metroid Fusion. Oh goodness! <laughs> Stop it! Leave me alone. Go after my ladies. Uh, got broken. Oh, I'm somehow not dead yet. Oh my goodness, it staggers. It staggers I believe so one fast. of the classes in this game has an ability where you can't be one shot. It will literally just leave you at 1 HP if you get <laughs> hit by something that would kill you normally. That is an interesting ability. I don't know that I need that. Yeah, I just kind of got reminded of it but because yeah, it that like is you cool. survived with 1 HP. That seems like a paladin sort of deal. Okay, let's, let's level up. Focus up. Lightning. Oh, lightning's right around me. Okay. Oh, no. Blood weapon. Leave yourself exposed, please. Duck and weave. This is working better. Uh, who 
are you targeting? Not me. Okay, who are you coming at? Not me. Sweet. Blood weapon. Invisible. So it shouldn't come after me, and I get bonuses to critting. Wow. They actually made it so that invisible kind of works. Is it a case that they literally just can't see you, or is it a case that... It's not targeting me. Okay. That's kind of cool. I don't know if it can't see me, but I'll say this. It ain't targeting me. Hot damn. <laughs> yeah. Get fucked. Oh no. The Ur Dragon King? Stay invisible. Punch rush. Take down. So you just made it stronger with the crystals. God damn. Stay invisible. I do like how your current strategy is. Pretend you don't see me, please. For the love of God. It isn't. It's not seeing me. That seems like a very effective strategy. Invisible, and then healing, and boom! <laughs> yeah! Well, that worked. <laughs> Invisible, and then... <laughs> so because Monk has a extended duration on buffs, I was just invisible for an incredibly long time without needing to reapply. Uh-oh, he's gonna remember. He's gonna become chaos. We finally partitioned ourselves off from that vile, obsolete world. We cannot allow them to reestablish the connection from their end. That is why we need to keep monitoring the dark oh, no. and darkness. If it looks like it will crumble, then we inject darkness to reverse the course, or reset the world if need be. Mm. Lucenia is as little in jewels, a utopia. Uncontrollable variables have no place here. Oh no, it's a fascist government. The division's on its way, Phoenix. The true chaos fascism. Uh, the true chaos fascism. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm just another one of their dicks. Astos is the bats. Yep. Got teleported away. Any donations? Nope. We've been sitting at 13,000 for a while. Maverick Knuckles, yeah. Uh, main mission, The Suffering of Fools. Have you given me a good... Uh, um, job trees. I got some anima shards. So, I guess I'll... 
Let's He's just taking a quick look at GB uh, Giant Bomb Chat. We currently have 69 viewers in chat. Nice. Where's the upgrade for So if anyone visible? wants to donate $69, just it's... know. Nice. Nice. Um, Assassin. I don't want Assassin Affinity. Hello. I'm I'm live. I have people behind me and they're laughing at me. They're laughing with me. That's just gonna make you more emo. Yes. Their their derision <laughs> only makes me more court, emo. Like, it only no makes me likes, stronger. No one really likes me anymore. Yep. It's a vicious cycle. The more emo you get, the more loner you get, the more emo yes. you get. It says on the front, I'm dead, in Japanese and English. <laughs> oh, this is the first time I'm seeing the skull. Oh, you haven't seen the skull? Have you seen the back? The back skull? That's pretty good. It's three skulls. Oh my god. It's triple the amount of skull. It's three skulls stacked, yes. It's too powerful for one skull. Well, now that I've been mocked. That just pushes me one step closer to the edge, and I'm about to break. Speaking of pushing people one step closer, any donation you could uh, put towards uh, that penguino here could go towards styling of his hair. Yes. Faux hawk, you perhaps. You could force a faux hawk. Oh, yep, here's uh, FF6. Spiky hair. They call this place a facility. A facility, like calling a planet a rock. Accurate, yes, but it doesn't do it justice. An island, a massive continent. It was chosen this time for the vast stores of quasi-magical energy Energy stored here. Dimension 6, where legends of this land still linger. It is a harbinger of the end times. Likely as not, the energy lying untapped here has something to do with that. Ooh, the floating continent. See, they get the floating continent, and FF9 got, like, the evil forest. What what would your choice for FF9 have been? Uh, the Ifa Tree. Hmm. Yeah, I could see that. Why? I like the Ifa Tree. I like um. To be accomplished. Well, if it's not gonna just end up like another, you know, part of me would have hoped that the moon would have been it too. But Terra, you mean? This really uh, yeah, that. That world, yeah, that that's a really weird one. Tarot would have worked. Um, I think that uh, God, this, this, is just this angle just makes it look like Jack is naked. The darkness. He's just holding back for his superiors. Let's kill these monsters yeah. and try some answers out of them. Um, I think uh, Ibsen's castle would have been cool. The upside down castle. But a lot of these like are cool concepts that I think like the FF5 level showed me they probably would not have uh, necessarily executed well. That island's floating? The back flew off in that direction. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, but I mean so and now that I'm thinking about it I couldn't think of another location that they should have done for FF6. This is like yeah, 100%. Yeah, this is like the climax of that game. Uh I I would say they could have, if they so chose, they could have done, like, um, one of the castles or something. You know, they could have done a number of lesser locations, but I feel like it would have been a missed opportunity. Is yeah, this, this a This is barrier? the most unique the most unique thing about Final Fantasy VI is this location. Oh, are we doing every the three paths? Every game has castles. Every game has, you know, caves, dungeons, the fire dungeon, that sort of thing. Am I taking damage? Oh, yeah. There's there's fire on the ground. Imagine you're a worm swarming in the mud. The Lucrenians are birds soaring through the sky. I do really like the Final Fantasy IV choice. The only other location I would have suggested for Final Fantasy IV would have been like the Summoner's Realm. 
or the sorry the uh, yeah the, uh, I guess the Esper's realm or the whatever those things were called yeah the, the game. realm of Esper's. <laughs> well, this works. I'm turning myself invisible and then running past everything. That looks like Rio called in the night. Good call. Oh, hey, there's an Arimon. There's a new enemy type. I'm invisible. You shouldn't be able to hit me. Oh, I'm doomed. Oh, boy. Okay, so... I would need to actually take these things out. Okay, zap him. Oh, no. Oh, what even happened there? Get it? Oh. This is a bad place. Oh, okay. So this is um, you you beat six, right? Yes. They did the. They're doing the three pathways thing. Come on, follow me. Oh. This um. That's cool. This anus is on top of one of the statues of the three. Uh, see. Kind of waiting for this game to pull a secret. Guess what? The final stage is Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. Hell yeah! Yo, they made a Final Fantasy Mystic Quest card in the FFTCG now. I saw that. I was I, I was shocked at what that character's name was. And Benjamin. I don't remember what it is now. Benjamin. Benjamin. Yes. Okay. It's just like, what is the most American name? Ah, yes, Benjamin. Like Ben Franklin. Yeah. In fact, I'm surprised he wasn't just Benjamin Franklin. Oh, I hit it in its eye, so now I can't. I can't do eye magics. The second Final Fantasy game I ever beat, Mystic Quest. Really? Yep. I played four, Mystic Quest, six, five, and then seven, eight, nine. The rest is just like when it shows up, right? Yep. I'm not dead yet. Oh, I'm dead now. This is such a bad situation. What do I even do here? These enemies, I usually just like hit the anus as fast as I possibly can, but it's... It is too powerful. I'm invisible. You can't hit me. Ah! It does AoE attacks that don't care. But I'm invisible.
invisible. Oh, did I die again? I died again. Okay, so I come up, I Zantetsuke in it, then I switch to um, Assassin and, and go ham from there. Oh, what the? The camera does not love what I'm doing. Seeing those enemies rendered in 3D kind of just reminds me of Mike Wazowski at this point. Yep. Mike Wazowski Except with, with wings. little wings. Square Enix should sue. Just get absolutely litigious. Get Mike the rights for Mike Wazowski. Put him in the next Final Fantasy. Yes. Finally. Who needs the Kingdom Hearts universe when you could just integrate him into the most important universe that they have? Come on now. You know, that's another enemy we didn't... I don't think we mentioned is the worms. What about them? Like, that's an enemy type that... Oh, exists. I just kind of forgot was in this game. Yep, there's worms. The spiders. We also didn't say the spiders. Well, that's right, the spiders. The corals. Mm hmm yeah. At this point, I'm just trying to compare in my head if this game actually has more enemy variety than, let's just say, Dark Souls. Uh, Dark Souls itself, maybe? I don't know. Elden Ring? Yeah. Elden Ring has less than you think. Yeah, that, that doesn't surprise me. It's a big world, but a lot of times the world is more what they work on as opposed to, you know, the, the fodder enemies, yeah. quote unquote. I'm thinking about Dark Souls, and I remember stuff like, okay, there's skeletons, zombie dudes, the 70 different version, variations of the knights. Yes. Bye-bye, Doom Anus. Bye-bye, statue of this guy. How do, I, how do I move? Back the way I came, I guess? Teleport? Yeah. Hello. Who goes there? Ah. Seven minutes left. It's me. This is a good game. Uh, I the, the I, I gotta say the uh, comment on one of the reviews or that said that if you fail any of your skill checks or military campaigns, you should just hard reset is totally true because uh, even though I spent hours trying to undo all of the damage that I did when I listened to your dumbass advice, Gino. Mm. Even though I knew it was wrong, uh, I was never able to fully recover from that. Mm. I regret nothing. Berserker attack always. No, actually, in this game, it's the complete opposite. I, I, and I knew that that's not what you're supposed to ever do. Um, that it would punish you? Yeah, I knew that it would punish being exciting? You. But anyways, um, this game's great. All right. Is it actually Fuck. great? Yo, no, actually, this is this game's got so much moxie. The fact that you you read up about it that this game and like Kingdom Dragon Pass were made with like less than half a million dollars back in the time when like that was unheard of. Like think about modern video games. Like and this is pre-ish. This is 
is like in the early, late 90s, early 2000s. Make a video game with like less than a million dollars. Like they even printed their own cartridges, pressed their own discs, and made their own boxes. Oh wow! Sold brick and mortar stores. Fucking amazing! And it was like a team of like eight dudes. Oh hell yes! Anyway, Sonic Knuckles. I got one last slice of pizza. This is for you. Okay. It's got sesame seed oil. Ugh. It's got cocoa powder. Ugh. It's got uh, banana slices, and it's got a little uh. Did you dip it? So this is not everything. I just heard something wet to... on the other side of the microphone. That's that's all I heard. Just something wet moving. You hear that? Uh, kinda. Not in a good way. Not in a good way. So, I don't know how much longer you're going, Gino. I think you said nine or four more hours. That seems bad. Oh, uh, I don't know uh, if I need... So, I, I don't know how close to the end of the game I am. I am currently in uh, a level that is seems to be inspired by the floating continent. That seems like a natural top place for this game to end does, doesn't it? Huh? It does, doesn't it? Uh-huh. I'm gonna eat this. Oh, it's disgusting. If you can still talk, it's not disgusting enough. Oh, fuck. It's the banana and chocolate, oddly enough, that's the worst. I don't think that's odd at all. Yeah, I, I could see that. It's just the case of like, oh, welcome to all this sweetness. Too many flavors. And everything else is savory. Super, super off-putting sometimes. Stupid mind flares. Oh. Oh. Did something happen? Rory said thanks oh. all. Oh, got some donations, it looks like. Thirteen thousand dollars is good. Uh, we're not done yet. What do you mean we're not done yet? We're not done yet. There's still oh, right. more time. Gotta kill chaos. I've gotta kill chaos. I better get to fight fucking something named chaos. Oh, that wasn't what I wanted to no, do. No, I I bet. I bet there's nothing in chaos at the end of this. Don't you dare. I bet that's the twist. Like, it's just M. Night Shyamalan comes out and it's like, the real chaos was the, the was... torment within your souls. Oh, man. There had better be something named chaos at the end of this. Oh, no, I died. I hate mind flares. I just need to kill the mind flare, and if I kill the mind flare, everything else is secondary. So, breaker. So this pizza, was it a large size Little Caesars yeah. pizza, or is yeah, it like it the hot and ready version? No, it was the normal hot and ready. Okay. My stomach does feel good. I bet. Yeah, I, I believe that. I have done the thing where I've eaten an entire hot and ready pizza myself, and it doesn't feel good. Gina, you know, I've been asking other people. You seem to be like the only other, the only person I, I can. I, I've asked for uh, Judge for this, but yeah. You know, what's your advice about archiving this shit? Uh, YouTube. No, but I mean, are you gonna cut this shit in half, like the especially long streams? Or are you gonna, yes. Like... Yeah, you cut it into segments. I, I find that the auto breakup, the auto segment, the 15 minute chunk. That's too much. Works. It yeah, also is too much. And that breaks a lot. Uh, I remember doing it once where it it worked like for 30% of the pieces. It was really weird. Unfortunately for that, it, for this type of thing, you, you kind of just got to download the raw file and then break it up yourself. Die, Mind Flare. Yeah.
stupid sirens. Siren down. So this is the first time I streamed this month. Like, uh, typically I do like something on a Sunday, just yeah, to like. I noticed that your your favorite day is Sunday. Yeah, it's it's more or less a thing to force me to actually play the video games I've bought in over the years because I don't really have time to play video games. I, I do a lot of just like preparation for stuff every day that I have to deal with. So I'll like watch someone else play video games, yeah. that sort of thing. That's my thing now. I but, just uh, um has you know I I know I'm not trying to diminish either of you on this, but as someone who works full time a job that is mentally and physically exhausting and i'm not saying that your guys's job is not mentally and physically exhausting don't take it to mean that but i'm just saying being a full-time teacher boy howdy i just come back home and it's like i don't want to do anything i don't want to stream i don't want to play anything mm -hmm. i just want to sit and relax and sleep yeah i've been there I'm just looking at the hours streamed for this month, and keep in mind, I have the only time I've streamed this month is for this charity event, and it's uh, 45 and a half hours. Damn. How do time I... flies. How do I go? Where do I go? When the Jester's fun, Causeway. So that's definitely where I need to go. Is it this way? Yeah, I haven't seen these. I haven't seen these weird flans before. All right, flans, there's another one. Christmas stockings for you penguins are sent over. Cat is the king. He corrupts animals, people. Yeah. That's what caused all this madness. The sending of his means in Shenan. And it's that ah. darkness that held the crystal's light. Now he basically, darkness makes Sparkly happy world. Okay. Well, world. that's that's it for me. Um, all right. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and go back to the main menu here. I want to thank everyone on my stream. I'll put the uh, donation link in my chat one last time. This is successful. I, w I would say this is a very successful stream for me. Uh, so far, successful stream for Eugene. I'll hang around to watch you beat chaos. I think I've got chaos on the ropes. Mm -hmm. Did I fall off a... Nope. Thought for a second. I would say a very successful year overall. Yes. Another damn mind flare, huh? And I didn't get my Zantetsuken starter. Honestly, other than, uh, what? Your computer melting down when yep. you, uh, tried to, uh, Great job, Zombie Floyd. Enjoyed watching all the headaches and listening to you pizza. I'm here. I'm here to please. VP uh, ASMR pizza stream. Wait, yeah. The ab the absolute anti. What as someone said, anti ASMR. Um. Other than like uh, the Friday issues with you doing Tales from Off City and you know my Six Ages stream. It's like. You what happened to your Six Ages stream? Uh, no, it's just like after. 12 hours of streaming, my computer's like, ah. ah. It's like, can you just give me like five seconds? Just give me five seconds of break. Holy shit, you've been running OBS for like two or three days. Yeah, when I when I tried to play Off Peak City and it literally my computer, all my monitors right, turned off. My stream, I'm gonna end my stream. Actually, no, you know what? I'm gonna raid you. Yay! Oh, damn it. And, and someone's asking, will I find a way to... Uh, I will I will take the time to archive this. I just need to figure out how I want to do that. Mm -hmm. Probably cut everything. Am I alive still? Nope. Yeah, everybody, this was great. This was a fun time. Um... 2,000 buckaroonies, eh? 2,100 buckaroonies on me. I expect to be impressed. Yep, I need to... I need to harangue... I need to text my dad because my grandparents, I think, each chipped in a hundred bucks. 
So I think I should have 200 bucks unaccounted for right now. Keeping that in your side pocket. Like if it comes in after the stream, I don't have to gel my hair, I guess. I feel like you still might have to just like, you know, do it, take a picture, send it to them and be like, this is this is what you've done. Oh, I'm sure they would you love made that. This. Who's casting holy? Is the anus casting holy? Yes. Get got. Hey, it looks like Trash Squad is also still going. Yeah. Whoa. Are they you still doing it for that. for this though, or are they just streaming? Oh, they might just be streaming. It's hard to tell. Mm, they don't have the overlay which they had yesterday, so I guess they're just streaming. Now let's move. Okay. Got two Anima shards. Time to confront Astos. Ability break damage up. Okay, I've got the things that matter for most of my advanced jobs. I thought we could spell the darkness as warriors of light. I stayed for long. But we did too good of a job. There were many of us that morning. Maybe it wasn't just us getting rid of the darkness. Maybe someone was hiding the light as well. That would be the least concern, especially if so. Sarah has a crystal. I knew it. Are we really doing doom? Oh, I'm not dead. Oh, you mean like the spell doom? Yeah, the, the spell doom. Actually, now that I think about this, you know, I might not watch the I'm gonna hit pause That's on fine. the stream. I Go for it. probably am going to have to play this game, so I don't want to spoil it. Yeah, I've I've basically just kind of been sitting here talking. I'm trying not to actually watch what's going on. Because he is literally just like one step ahead of me at this point. Quick death. Oh, what the hell? Oh, it just speeds up doom, huh? I say, if there was one thing that they would put in this that would feel slightly more fair, it's doom. Like, at least they didn't put death, which is just like, guess what? Procs, you die. Uh, it doesn't kill you. It puts you at 1 HP, which is better than what I thought it would do to me. Get them, girls. Sophia? Oh, I stepped in fire. Dang it. <laughs> That'll do it. I was dodging for so long. As it's end game, sets you to one HP and then get you to kill yourself by stepping on a thumbtack. Yep. Welcome to the end of a video game. Be vigilant. Sizing Oh no. Oh, I okay. Just can't get hit by Meteor. That checks out though. Do you know what did you say was the name of this level? I don't know. I'm getting a phone call though. One sec. I think it was called Terra something something. Yeah, but Terra's in like the 
the concept of Earth, I guess, the Latin. Uh, wait, Terra is Earth in Latin, right? Or am I, I mean, also Spanish, I'm pretty sure. And Portuguese. I'm looking at a guy. I don't think he's as close to the end as he thinks he is. Honestly, that makes me happy because uh, I've had a, a legitimately fun time with that game. And I'm down for more of it. CP, you got another $20 donation. the name of your uh, place? The, 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 this level? Terra something. That is what it's... I, I don't know exactly what it's called. Oh shit, the, the new number for ZP is 2121. Sweet. Thank you, Invisible. Oh, Assassinate is Baroken. My goodness. I did not realize how good Assassinate is. So if you just are behind an enemy for a while, and then you just pop Assassinate... It, it does not cap how many times it does it. It is once per time you hit the thing. I thought there would be like a cap or something. It's just straight up like excessive damage. It's one per. You should not be seeing me. I must. I'm invisible. It's one per time you critted, technically. Invisible. Go after someone else. Should really be going after someone else, I feel. A lot of teas. Fight with caution. Get on your toes. Mm, I tried to go after the anus instead of fighting the bosses, and they didn't like that. So, knowing how the uh, the mobile game market works nowadays. How long do you think until the uh, Stranger of Paradise gotcha game? Final Fantasy gotcha collaboration happens. Um, I would expect. So does uh, it being in Opera Omni account? Sure, that's a that's a gotcha game, right? Yeah. So I would expect it to get into um, into Opera Omnia at some point. I expect Jack to be in that. Dang it. I mean, Sonic this is Wave. the newest Final Fantasy game out right now, right? Yeah. So. Barring whatever they have planned for the big Final Fantasy anniversary event this year. 
Nine remake, do it. Cowards. They're not gonna make the nine remake that you want, Gene. You might as well just stick to the Memoria project. They just do do nine remake. Do seven remake but nine. What if they did that but they used the um the city of character art for the nine characters? I'd be fine with that. I, I hate the Dissidia character. I don't like it, but, like, I'll live with it if it plays well. Hmm. Dissidia doesn't play well, right? Uh, it's, like it's smash specific. Button smash. But it, 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 CP is saying, like, looking like Dissidia, not playing like Dissidia. I... I would argue that there's a lot less strategy to uh, Dissidia than what people claim there is to it. I don't it know. Like the, matchups and it stuff like that. It's like a Dragon Ball Z fighting game yeah, to me. It's just like basically mash the buttons. We've got our work cut out for Those games are about power fantasies living out vicariously however the player sees fit rather than actually being super balanced or quality experiences gameplay wise. Yeah, it's like, what if you could see a 3D fight between, you know, your favorite protagonist and villain? What if I put Kucha against Kefka? Which one's the crazier, better, more powerful wizard? So it's Super Smash Brothers. Yeah. Yeah. Do you think bats. Square ever makes a platform, like a proper platform fighter with all their characters one year? I mean, they would it, at best they would contract it to like art systems. That would I, I would play that in a heartbeat. Ugh, there's so much garbage on the screen. I'm so close to the end, though. I think. I think. Maybe. Maybe. Please. I mean, I'm if, honestly if, not the one to ask. If you are where I think you are, um, I don't think you're as close as you think you are. But I, I don't. Ugh! Stupid command grabs. As long as this isn't a case of. Like, oh, now you've unlocked this, but you need to go back to all these other locations to unlock these before you can do the final fight. See, that was the one thing about uh, my Lightning Returns playthrough that I... We've got our work it's going to be really hard to make a podcast about that game, so I'll warn you know about that, just because it's completely non-linear. Mm -hmm. And there might be a situation where you have to replay that game, Dead Rising one OG Dead Rising one style of oh you ended a fail state but we'll give you all the stuff you got to play new game plus now. Hmm. I say I will Dead admit I one? did not see much of you playing it, but everything I've seen of you playing it, it looks kind of like a better Final Fantasy fifteen. Yeah, and I hate Final Fantasy thirteen or fifteen. 15. No, I mean, like, it reminds me of what 15 is, but done well. Yes. Uh, that like the combat actually looks enjoyable. And the open world stuff seems better put together. It's not like... So Final Fantasy 15 is like, oh, this is the first open world Final Fantasy in forever. It's like, okay, sure, but the open world missions are... Find this specific monster, the or too big and find this fish. Like, there's nothing there. And then the game's pace of its story can't, I can't actually match the epicness of the size of the world. Oh, man. 15 is like the ultimate. That's an, that is a pretty big page in the What Could Have Been book by Square Enix. Mm -hmm. There's so much in that game that is so frustrating. And the game actively like pushes you away from being able to find interesting story beats because oh of its own mechanics. Oh my god, it's so frustrating because it's like, hey, we've spent all this time building a sense of camaraderie. It's like, okay, so now the character arcs happen. So now we're going to play baseball together. Okay, cool. So you guys are friends. Characterization. Where, when, when are we going to 
what's the hook other than you're a pissed off little prince that wants your throne back? Now we're gonna learn how to cook with each other. Fuck! Characterization? At the same time? Where, is it gonna happen now? You could miss all of that, like, filler shit, too. Then it's like, uh, don't even get me started about episode Arden, which completely undoes everything. I... Entire, that entire thing. This will be a thorn in our side. Why can you see me? People were speaking glowingly of 15 and people were smoking. Who? Who spoke? Yeah. Who spoke glowingly people liked of it, it? To a certain degree. Some people like broy stuff. I don't know. It's part of this game. I, I like the idea of it. Yeah, like if if you were to say like we made a Final Fantasy, but it's just stand by me, I'd be like, yeah, sure, let's fucking go. This fight sucks. Stand by me has a pace. Yeah, fi 15 has no pace. 15 is the Ubisoft of open world RPGs. Just a whole lot of stuff to do, and none of it has any actual weight. Oh, I mean, it is visu visually impressive, I guess. Yeah, it's, it's visually impressive. You know what? I, I've said this before. I think the best version of Final Fantasy XV was that playable demo they 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 released when on like the PS4, where it was like you in like a fucking kids kids playground or a house, and you're just tiny side. people Hold messing on. around with toys, and then it's like you're in uh, the street, and then fighting a summon. Oh yeah, and that's not actually in the game, right? Oh, no, none of that shit's in the game, but at least, you know, the flippy shit looks good and, you know. Get behind the weird ball. I know it's got a tail, but get behind the weird ball. Assassinate. I... Rory I wants really to hope stay. 16 is good. What does Rory I mean, want to know? It's in good hands, right? Like, Yoshi P doesn't make bad games. But also, that man is micromanaging, putting out fires for 14, and making a proper number of Final Fantasy games. So, we'll see. Uh, yeah, Rory says that he's going to probably be out for an hour. You know, okay. So, if you do finish early, shut it all down. Will do. Why can the bats see me? The bats in this game can see all. You should not be able to see me. I'm invisible. Actually, if you think about it, it makes perfect sense that the bats would be able to see you via echolocation. That's true. That's true. You're right. They should be able to see me. They should be the only thing that can see me. No, 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 no. No, 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 not like this! Okay. I didn't die! No! <laughs> Did you actually just fall off the cliff twice? It pushed me off the cliff. No! Stupid cliff. Can I take these things to the cliff and shove them off? I mean, they have wings, so... They do. Might not work. But I don't think that's how that works in these games. Can I just wail on this thing? Oh, I absolutely believe that there's no way that they program it to not just fall. Like, it will just fall, I guarantee you, if you get it across that. I don't know if I love the the attack animations in this game or I love them. Oh, thank you, invisibility. The, the gas pedal animation in this game is real good. When 
you say good, is it good or is it good? I I just think it's good. I think it's real good. We should collect ourselves. It's very satisfying to see happen. As twisted as that may sound. Okay. I just used invisibility and then uh, beat the crap out of the thing in front of me instead of doing the doing the gauntlet. Oh, Astos. But no matter. Relax. We won't have any more gifts to deal with. Light and darkness are in perfect balance. Ooh, light and darkness are in perfect balance. So, where would you like me to start? You. It's Jack. Are we friends? No. Not in death. Oh no. Stuff's being revealed. They, on the other hand, are formerly Fenians. They're working with me, but for their own ends. To be honest, they'd be just as happy to see me dead. I was the one who turned them into bats, after all. My enchantment will fade as you sing. And I'm sure that's why they've been so very helpful to me. Ooh. They're hoping you'll decide to take my place for all the trouble I've caused. I'm learning. Plot plot things are happening. That's right. Revelations are, are happening? Yes. I'm sorry I asked. To be honest, <laughs> I don't give a damn. They're now explaining how the chaos is made. Yep. Weren't the best chaos the chaoses we met along the way? You could give me a reason to power up. An enemy to fight. Mm-hmm. And you'll do that. I'd love to, Jack. Oh, I would. But I can't. <laughs> I've lived too long this way. And oh. Astos. I might as well be a dark crystal myself. Oh, Astos is gonna cry. Or something, no. I'm gonna have to fight Astos. Jack. Oh. I ask you one more time. Who am I? Is Astos Jack? <laughs> the dark dark oh astos is like have either of you played it takes two no uh yes astos is like who am i and jack's like you're king of the dark elves i guess king of the pirates Oh, ah, that sucks. His moves uh, hit all around him, so even if I'm invisible, I can't just wail on him. He has 360 oh, degree. So it's like one of those like radius 360 degree no scope. Yep. I don't think I can just do my invisible mm -hmm. cheese. Though maybe, maybe with a longer weapon. I was gonna make a, a quick note. Uh, I played a bit of, well, I played a, an amount of It Takes Two this year with uh, a friend, and... Yeah. That game seems dark. Yeah. I you don't think it was the game of the year? I... I 
guess it got game of the year. I mean, the last thing I did in it was murder a elephant princess and so this was the exact bathe in my daughter's tears. So here's what I wrote about this game when I did my game of the year awards. Takes two. Most significant oh. disconnect I had with the press and mainstream media. Like, the moment when It Takes Two won Best Family Game during the 2021 Game Awards, I just flipped out. I just, I completely lost it. Like, Didn't I, it I, win who the Game of the Year? Is playing It Takes Two with your kids. The first thing you do is murder a sentient vacuum cleaner by sucking out its eyeballs. And there's all the times when you eviscerate stuffed animals. In very brutal and, like... Graphic ways. Like you feel guilty. Yeah. You feel ashamed of your words like, and deeds. And then also, it's just like, I understand the whole perspective that kids need to be told emotional, like, important messages. But it's like... There's a lot of swearing in that game. There's like visceral dismemberment in that game. Question. There's distressing material in that game. Like who willingly subjects non And then the other thing is like family game. Like who willingly subjects non-gaming relatives or friends to it takes to is like time sensitive platforming and all of that puzzle shit that requires two players to be absolutely on the same page. Like who are these people? I don't think those people exist. Another question about It Takes Two. Is the message at the end of the game uh, that, like, they get back together again because they have done platforming puzzles together? Like, do I'm they un... Not we, you... I'm not going to play that game. I, I still don't. Okay, fine. You don't have to spoil it. And uh, people on stream watching you who might that's fair want to play that, so I'm not gonna answer that. Fine, take this Astos. I will eventually get there as well, but like, holy shit! Everything I've seen in that game, I've just like, what? 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 Huh? Awesome. Oh yeah. Yes. Yes. Oh, it's the thing in the trailer. The trailer thing happened. The trailer thing happened, but also he pu they punch, and then bro fist. Yeah, that was the trailer thing. Ooh. I was born in Cornelia and traveled with the Lithuanians across the Pyrenees. Ooh. Story is happening. What? Tiamat? Doesn't Astos have a second form in the uh, original game? Ultima Weapon. Ah, that's... I don't know where my heart should lie. Ooh. What up, Ultima Weapon? That's a real fucked up thing of you to turn into. I kind of I kind of wish that I knew about It Takes Two's content before I decided to do it though, because I remember this weekend I had a I guess a, a good friend of mine ask oh, what days are you going to be playing, like, PG-13 family-friendly stuff? And I said, okay, the day I'm playing it, it takes two. Your kids can watch. Oh, no. And I regretted that. I am hoping I did not traumatize some children. I don't know what else to say. That's what I hope every day. 
always end up telling myself, hey, there was someone who says, I really would like to listen to your podcast and your content with my on my commute, but I have kids. And it's like, yeah, you're right, you know, I'll, I'll try to watch this one. Then, uh, like, I... You almost got him. In. Fuck! Like, it's like, yep. uh... Oh, damn you it. Start the, you just start the show with, fuck that. Uh, can I level up Assassin more? Assassin seems like how I'm going to do this. Critical break damage. I cannot emphasize enough how hilarious it was to see someone pay money to post in a complaints department. Uh, let's not talk about that publicly right now. I just, I just want to mention it. It was very funny. Come on now. I think it had a happy ending for reference, but yeah. Okay, boom, boom, get in his grill. So Gino, how are you going to work tomorrow? I don't know that I am. I might take the day off. How are you, how are you going, what, what will you look like when you go to work on Tuesday? Uh, I work from home, so I will look normal. I will look like nothing if I don't... I've got to shave my face, and then my hair, you know, I just get it wet, and it will be unstraightened. You're not going to keep the look for a couple of days, just see how it see how it treats you? No. Is this shirt going to Goodwill? No, this shirt's too good. That shirt is... Hey, Gino has a solid, let's say, Christmas... Or not, not Christmas, Halloween... Halloween outfit. Costume. Astos is like, what's this weird thing that keeps hitting me? Oh well. Guess I won't worry about that. Oh, damn it. Did I die? I died. Damn it. This guy just has a ton of HP. Oh, you know what I should do? Assassin's cool and all, but um, let's go ahead and make myself a uh, a monk. Where's my most powerful monk knuckles? I think I should just keep the sonic knuckles on and change my job from assassin to monk. Like, give me all that Assassin's Wisdom, but also Monk stats. Monk has been... It's done me so well. I just hit so hard. I do actually... I feel like I have a request that I should, uh, that I should say. What? What are your feelings on if I could convince someone in chat to donate an amount of money that we make it so that you find and equip a fedora on your head? Uh, that might take a while. I don't know where. Do you know what level the fedoras are in? Uh, I'm not sure. You may already have a fedora for all I know. But, uh... That's true. I might have the fedora. The fedora might already be with me, but it's hard for me to know. It really depends on how far I am from a fedora. Like, if it takes me five hours to find the fedora, then no. Yeah, then it's not worth it. If it takes me two minutes to find the fedora because I have a level where I know the fedora is, I will do it. How about this? If you have a fedora, maybe sure. we, we propose this. Sure. After I beat the game without using such chicantery. Instead of you need to use the fedora. I think we just need to see the fedora. the fedora. Okay. Yeah. Ah. You know, like, let's say, perhaps maybe you do the thing where you get to the final boss, you have it in its break state, about to die, you equip the fedora, and then and then the game out with fedora. And then kill it. Yes. That would be very funny. Where you at, my guy?
Blood weapon. Chakra. Get out of the way of him. Focus up. Asdos is saying stuff, but I don't know what he's saying. The sound of me punching him is too loud. There we go. First form down again. Yes, bro fist. Please tell me it always does the flashback. It does. <laughs> awesome. Game of the year. It might be good. This might be a good game. Where am I? Oh, okay. You gonna heal, buddy? Here you go. My healing is the violence I'm inflicting on him. But really, though. I heal from damage. Oh, he took out my my buffs and debuffs. Oh no. You know being surprised that a boss would take do that is uh, I'm not surprised. You know you're so close. You're so close. I'm not surprised, it just sucks when it happens. Use your specials. Oh wait, okay, I was reading this wrong. Yeah, this is this is the end. The end of the game? Um, I'm not gonna say anything. Okay, more don't say anything else. I was reading the guide wrong when I said that you had a lot more to go. I was gonna say six I'm going to suggest you pause and check to see if you have a fedora, just in case. I I can't like when, I can't you, do that at the same time. Moment. Yeah, got him. Hey. Hey, Astos, you piece of shit. He's grateful. Embrace eternity, motherfucker. Led by the nose. I have gotten even darker, and behold... What do we got? Your memories will be stored in this device. Be sure to bring it back. Understood. Be aware that storage space is limited. Oh. When that limit is exceeded, you must cease your activities and await instructions. From where? It varies. It varies. Just contact Astos when you're ready for pickup. Astos? Hmm. Our newest organic replenishment unit. We'll show it to you later. Ooh. I don't see much point. I'll forget about it either way. But Astos won't forget you. Ooh. By the way, I know I must have asked this a dozen times before, but... <laughs> why do we have to forget? Why doesn't the world forget? Simple. To ensure our glorious future. <laughs> it's simple. You have to forget because... You do, of course. Astos, were you the sixth? Organic reconnaissance unit Astos just surfaced. Thanks to the benevolence <laughs> and technology of your people, a simple Cornelian elf like me was reborn to aid your glorious cause. 
Oh, no. Was Astos pulling the strings? Don't think of me as a friend or comrade. My kind oh, are no. Bioorganisms, mass produced to serve. <laughs> what? Truly, I say this out of concern for your well-being. In the past, strangers died for us, sacrificing themselves out of a misguided sense of justice. <laughs> Pretty stupid of them. <laughs> Ooh, the FF13 level. It's just a scratch. Nothing a little spit can't heal. Oh, nothing a little spit can't heal. I'll keep that in mind. I thought I made it clear. Me and my kin in disposable form, grown in droves to die for you. Ah. Pretty stupid of you. Jack is Astos. I can argue with you on that. I think. Astos, I want you to be my accomplice. Your help. You may be able to change things next time. Ooh. What would you have me do? You say you need me. Guide us. Show us the way. I don't <laughs> care how you do it. Ooh. Ooh. They're supposed to change the extraction point every time, you know. But just between us, it's almost always the chaos strike. I like chaos of them. When rules become mere formalities, well, that's when things start breaking. The preparations are complete. Good luck. Stuff is happening. Hey, Astos. Want to come with us? Hmm? Don't you want to go home? It's not a matter of what I want. It's uh, against the rules. Then I'll change that. I'll fight for you. Hmm. You'll just forget it. I won't. Don't get my hopes up. I promise you. I won't forget. Oh. Next time. You sound very baffled. I'm not baffled. It's just sad. Don't fist bump over something you cannot do. Goodbye. Jack. Jack. <laughs> Jack's just been fist bumping his way through all of these cutscenes. <laughs> Incredible. Game of the year. Well, I killed Astos, I think. Oh, right, they're all naked. <laughs> After a cutscene of them not being naked. Okay, that image just looks like the meme of people standing over someone who's fallen and spilt their food. Yep. You're the one who lives in your memories. It's not your fault. I know it is bad for you. I was going to wish for forgiveness. Aw. I should have screamed. Astos. Forgive me. I wish I could forgive you. But it's too late. There's no room left in your heart. We gotta talk about what you gotta do. You will change us, and those who have been with us will be undone. The moment I draw my final breath. Ooh. You let the magic fade. So do it and fill their lives. Ugh. We'll go to the grave together. When you sleep, in the moon's tower, please stay in bed. Our darkness will merge Oh no. Together, we fight the beast that emerged from our shadows. 
Is this the that wasn't the last battle then? No. But am I close to the end? Chaos finds its Not gonna say anything. The true stranger of paradise starts now. Wherever it lurks, it feeds. Can't you tell? From there, all my thoughts. If it were to follow your conscience. Follow your conscience. Uh oh. This is the end. The last gift I can give you. Please get out. Clothes? I hope it's not clothes. This is the last gift I can give you. Punish the rebellious of all things. Protect Cornelia. Astos, my boy, they massacred my boy. We can't stay here. Let's go. All right, it seems like I'm entering the end game. Uh, so. Reminder, this is the Giant Bomb Community Endurance Run. We are raising money for Pencils of Promise. Any amount donated helps. It's a charity that builds schools, trans trains teachers, and sends kids to school in developing nations. Please do what you can. And, oh, I, I probably need to turn. You know, maybe I don't turn a light on. Maybe I'm just a the darkness in the darkness. You've reached the, the penultimate, penultimate emo yes the darkness has consumed you yes as it will consume all things yes violence time Princess Sarah. I think Astos is worried we have each other. You freed Cornelia from the lieutenant's meddling. I love that the gloves are just floating. <laughs> why is it that? Why did they do it like that? Well, he should have clothes. They should look attached to the clothes that he's wearing. I guess, but why not just have him wear the gloves on his hands? That's a good point. Oh, like when, in, when entering combat, does he have to reach for the gloves every time? Yes. It just seems very inconvenient. So, Gino, this is the end. There's one last boss after Astos. <laughs> okay. I need to get to the boss then. I'm going to turn invisible, and then I'm going to run past you idiots. Bye, idiots. Yeah, it totally just lets you do that, huh? Uh, it's basically encounter none, but not really. Yeah, yeah. Yep. I like that Monk was still, at the end of the day, my best job. Oh, no. Who are these dead people? Oh, no. Where's Sarah? Sarah's the important one. Everyone else is dead, though. Hmm. 
<laughs> We've got a Drew blinking emote, I assume, from what is going on here. Hey, Sarah. Yeah. Biggs and Wedge. They're dead. Yep, nope. That sure is a thing. These two guards that have been defending the royal family their entire life, and here comes their rescue troop, and they're a bunch of people running around in their underwear. Yep. She's got uh, the Warrior of Light from Final Fantasy One as like a headdress. That's cool. The horned thing. Join the fight. Ooh. Baker wants your autograph. Show some sense when there's no choice but to block him. Got it. <laughs> you lot keep the princesses safe. I'll park us a path out of here. Keep up. Uh, don't tell. Please don't tell me this is an escort mission. Because my invisible strategy will not work if that's the case. Maybe if I run fast enough, I can outrun it, even if it is an escort mission. Oh, it's not. The cubes! Invisible. Deuces. Ha 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 ha. Ha! Yeah! Yes. If you want to live, follow us. Follow me. I'll keep you safe. Peace. <laughs> I couldn't be chaos. Haven't they heard me say how many times I want to kill Chaos? Yep. Hey, there's my friends, I think. That's true. He was a real one. I'm keeping them safe by beating up all the monsters, but then, you know, I just turn invisible and run past them all. Boss? I assume? What? Are you the boss? I, I mean, I got a save point and I'm at a door, so I, that's how this has gone up until now. Okay, well, you'll... Um, be happy to note that uh, the recommended strategy for beating this boss is the complete opposite of how you've built your characters, so I look forward to you complaining about it. <laughs> I've been ordered to rest. I'm now leaning back on my reclining chair and closing my eyes. Okay. 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 We need to survive and just kind of be there as symbols. My sister is right. 
Isn't that the whole point of a king? Or queen? Oh, thank goodness. I don't trust Mia. Or Sarah. Seem like much has changed out here. Mm. So you're all set. I was thinking Gravica might be good. Plenty of space, no secrets. Smart. Me on it. Go get the others. Uh oh. Think Sarah and her people can make it that far? We don't believe you now. <laughs> we took a walk for two seconds. They just took a walk. Uh oh. Oh no, the people we saved. Do I have to get somewhere? Or is it still cutscene land? Oh, I didn't want to focus. Okay, I died. Now what? Cutscene, or do I have to keep redoing this fight? Oh no, I have to kill all of these enemies? Does invisible work when I'm the only character? No, it does not. Oh boy. I guess that's what he meant when he said your strategy won't work. It, it, is the final bo the final boss can't just be a pile of monsters though. Uh, I guess I need to eliminate them one at a time. Try to take out as many of the trash mobs as possible. They're not that many, like, incredibly powerful monsters. Invisible, blood weapon, go. Ah! Mind drain. Oof. Well, this is bad. Uh, hmm. I mean, I could. I told you. I could use a break. Let's try and break with them. Let's see if I can break with them. Just what did I tell you? Just clear out some of the trash. Come and get me. Mmm, Zantetsuken. Oh, I'm supposed to use Lightbringer here. and isolate the weakest of these enemies and kill them immediately. You, 
you haven't even reached the uh, proper first stage of the boss battle. No, I know. But I'm trying to actually fight them instead of cheese them, so... That seems to have helped. Oh, no! Ugh. Stupid mind drain. Oh no. No, don't kill me. Invisible. Okay, mind player down. Ah, damn it. This fight sucks. There's a lot of them. And I'm alone. Cheese, glorious cheese. What can I do to cheese this? I, I thought you, you were the one who said you knew the cheese. Uh, I can just go Sage. Sage might just be able to cheese it. Cheese it. You could, yeah, you could always just Ultima everything. Ugh. Knock the Zantetsuken right out of me. Yep, I can try and ultima everything instead of using the breaker. I'll, I'll try that. Let's try and ultima everything. Uh, battle settings. You ever have a hard time in Final Fantasy Lightning Returns? There's a very easy way to break the game. I see. Uh, I don't have... Okay, I guess Thor's hammer. Does that answer Ultima everything? No, it's use the uh, use Yuna's costume. Yuna's OP. Uh, Yuna's costume is busted. So that game has the dress sphere system, basically. Kinda. Yes. yes. But it's characters, costumes, yes. or instead of just classes. It's complicated, yo. Alright. Haste go. Shoga. What if the dress spheres were Pokemon you had to collect? What then? That just sounds like a gotcha game. Protectga. Ah! Stop doing that to me. You don't have to pay microtransactions. You can get boxes. That's, that's a good thing. That's a good thing. Ah! Maybe one day I'll open that $5 copy of Lightning Returns I bought at Walmart that is in a box somewhere. I do have a very cheap copy of Lightning Returns somewhere. Okay, so let's try this again. I just want to cast Ultima. That's all I want to do. Haste go. Shell go. Ah! player and it's damn I definitely do like those mind player models oh they look great I just fucking hate them ah okay uh I think I have an ability that just lets me slowly regain um MP uh -huh. I'm just gonna equip that real quick 
so I don't have to like run up and attack them. Get rid of the chakra. Where is it? It's not reinforce. Seal of blood. Was that it? What does this do? Increases damage dealt. Nope. Divine sigil. Duration. Magic regen. Yep. Let's just pop magic regen to start, and then that way I don't need to get close to these fuckers. I can just dodge. Magic regen. Haste go. Shelga. Protecta. Okay, magic regen doesn't help. Because it costs me a... Um, it costs me something to use it. It costs me MP to use it. <laughs> That just seems like a poorly designed ability. Well, I mean, usually you have a party and you're not fighting this many monsters and, you know. You have more MP than this. Ah. How am I on MP? Not great. Or you would have armor that makes this process faster and or more efficient. Uh, the armor doesn't do as much as you'd hope. Damn it, I was so close to getting, uh, to getting Ultima there. I mean, uh, Jossie, you could tell him, like, I, the armor does not do that much. Damage-wise. Ooh, Flea. What does Flea do? Movement speed and break gauge recovery. You know, I, I do like that. <laughs> I like that a whole lot. Flea seems like what I want to do here. If magic regen's not useful, then give me flea. Make me fast. So, when in doubt, run away moment? Yes, 100%. Um, oh, I cast haste twice by accident. Bop, bop, bop. Um, Shelga. Did you cast Shelga? No. Quagga. Feel the pain. Quagga. Oh, wow, there's way more space to run away than I thought. Quagga. Ultima. Take that, you fuckers. Okay, that took out everything but one. <laughs> oh, no. No! Killed everything but the last one, and then the last one killed me. You hate to see it. Yep.
Oh, I don't have to use haste go. What am I talking? Why was I doing that? I'm the only character. It doesn't matter if I use the ga versions of white magic stuff. I forgot that the ga versions of white magics in this game just uh, apply to your whole party instead of you. Yep. Haste go. Black magics, it is worth doing that. Okay, Hillgig is down. Bye bye, mind player. Okay, only one left. Hate this growing malice nonsense. Stop. Filling the screen with garbage. Do another move. Oh, uh, petrifying gaze. No, don't kill me. Oh. Okay, the Arimon's what I need to put the Ultima on. I need to drop Ultima on that thing. But I've got a plan. Ultima my way through it. Just Ultima my way through this fight. I'm so close. This straight nuclear option? <laughs> yes. Protect. Bop, bop, bop. Quagga. 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 Ultima. Take that, you piece of shit. Perfect. Quagga. Quagga. Ah, stupid mind drain. All right, just this one enemy left. And it has a move I can actually catch and send back at it, so... That's pretty good. Mind blast. Nope. 
Bye bye. Got him. Oof. Got through that fight. Now hopefully it's a boss. Boy, if that's how you what you had to go to to beat those guys, I wonder how this boss is gonna be. Hey, Gino, if you get frustrated, there's a tip. Okay. Oh no. The tip involve a fedora. Uh oh. That's why you love this room. <laughs> you can borrow it if you want. So Limp Biscuit, that was just in it for two seconds. That was the only time it did this. It'd be wonderful if I could adapt this song to the loop. <laughs> Will you come too once we're finished? I'm no stranger here. To wander off. I wonder how much they paid for that. No idea. And the Sinatra song, I guess. I mm -hmm. you. I'm not sure about Sinatra, the Sinatra song is even weirder, <laughs> right? Funny. It's not yes. just Sinatra, it's a remixed version of Sinatra. Oh. <laughs> uh oh. Garland. I never Maybe someone at Team Ninja just really likes Sinatra. Yeah. Jack Garland. Garland. My name's Jack Garland. Oh. Ooh, is, is this meatball? Meatball or pepper or uh, sausage? Meatball. Meatball. Thank you. I'm laying down and I just I'm assuming that a meatball pepper sausage has attacked you. No, I got a sandwich. Meatball sandwich. That's that's uh, probably they're correct. vegetarian meatballs, yes. right? Yes. I don't do that on purpose. What's in a vegetarian meatball? <laughs> Soy, <laughs> mushrooms. I'm guessing just a lot of tomato sauce in there too. Gave me some advice once. Communism. He said, "Fucking gotta be crazy if you want to change the world." I'm going to mute so you don't hear me chewing. Chew away. That's the ASMR money. Yeah, you got to get that. You got to get that uh, the big bucks. Luciferians rip holes in reality, dispatching strangers like you as regulators. If the balance of light and darkness fails, they won't hesitate to reset the world. They couldn't give a damn about Cornelia or its people. <sighs> what are you talking about? I'm guiding you like you asked me to. They can't control chaos. That's their weakness and our opportunity. This is the third time we're having this conversation. This is all your idea. Men may overcome with strong emotions. Allow them to overwhelm you, and it won't be long until they warp you into something unspeakable. Become corrupted by chaos, and you will no longer be permitted to return. Veterans are precious resources. Do not ignore them. Though darkness is a controlled substance tested and introduced with great care, when it bonds so with tired. powerful negative emotions, it forms chaos. Yep. By manipulating I am I'm staying awake because I kind of need to fix my sleep schedule. But if chaos takes root, right. thankfully the uh, the discomfort in my chest is helping me stay awake. But I am pretty tired. At the very least, I have a, a perfect solution when I actually do need to go to sleep. I just no. turn on my back, and then I'm pretty sure I'll fall asleep. Yeah. 
Lucky you. That's so cool. <laughs> the rest is up to you. I I'm but a finishing touch. Are you you're working tomorrow? It's a shame what happened to the royal son. Yikes. Sure. That's gonna be a tough one. Fun with death. <laughs> I don't know, I assume. Maybe you'll be fine. I, I know that I, I took tomorrow off just to try and recover from this. Let the darkness take hold. The only thing Lucidia fears is something it can't control. Damn, that's sweet. Yep. Uh oh. Hello. The chaos that gnaws at this world is the final bad end for fallen strangers who lost their battles against darkness. You saw it happen. You have defeated the fiend. Sadly, we aren't warriors of light, Jax. We're pawns the Luthanians unleashed on an unwitting world. How goes the uh, stranger of paradise? Scene? Um, I am now, I, I think, doing well. Uh -huh. You seem to be beating up your uh, fellow team members. Yep. For story purposes? Yes, it would appear. Are they naked still? Yes. yes. And I think it has made them weaker. Are you sure this is the right choice? Pretty funny. That, that must be the technique is right before this encounter, you just strip them clean. You found the speedrun strat by accident. Please stop. Hey, have some Ultima. Yes, leave me alone. Just let me cast Ultima, you jerks. I will happily knock you all out. I just need to cast Ultima. Okay, I'm not. I'm not taking damage. At least I'm not anymore. I don't know if I ever was. Thunder of all the spells. Boom, 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 boom. Yes.
Yes. Bye, Ash. Bye, Sophia. Bye, Neon. Oof. Okay, Jack Garland. Sandwich time. Not my boys. You might not like this, but you know I like to speak my mind. I'm Sophia. These cutscenes keep assuming I was wearing clothes. Maybe it's just alternate timelines. Mm hmm. When Farka failed to work, four warriors of light shall come. The true timeline could only be achieved once all clothes were removed. Mm hmm. Isn't that just the plot of Kill a Kill? Oh, wow. I think you might be right on that. What? I fucking hate Kill a Kill. There's a gap for a sixth person. Never really watched it. I just sort of know of it through osmosis. <laughs> He's profisting the air. Don't let me forget. Don't let me forget. Change the extraction for every pain you know. But just between us, it's almost always the Kilgish Vow. The war leaves here. I shall remember the joy of us. We're FF1 in it. Inventory's full, damn it. So there's another area? It would appear. Hmm. I'm gonna be honest, I don't know if uh, I'm gonna get to L8. Maybe a half hour more. Uh, I'm gonna tune out after that point. Mm hmm. I mean, this was a short level to begin with. Hey, finally partitioned 
Oh, there we go. He needs chaos. Chaos. Is someone just constantly screaming chaos right now? Jack just said, I need chaos. Chaos. Oh, are these Excellent. story things? Oh, it is. Describe chaos for me, will you? What shape does the legendary creature of darkness and terror assume to listen to the rumors on the street? As many fanciful forms as there are stars in the sky, and yet there's one trait that descriptions have in common. It appears as an inhuman monster, terrible to behold. When rage and despair are bound to emotion, chaos takes form. How will it change, my dear friend? I wonder when his transformation is complete. An anatomy of terror in the eyes of the Lufenians, I'm sure. But to my fellow compatriots and I, a last glimmering ray of hope. Are we, uh... We're redoing chaos, huh? Chaos as the uh, as the hero of the story. Oh, how hard do I hit now? Eh, hard, but not hard enough. I was wondering if I was just like one one hit killing all of you. If I would one hit kill all these things. Is this where I came from? Yeah, but. I just turned the wrong direction. The shortcuts are all still here. Oh, that, that's pretty convenient, actually. The music's good. It's nice and sad. Are you telling me that this game is making you feel emotions? No, the music's good, though. It's like, what if uh, Garland became chaos, like, because his friends died? Princess Sarah the Third, Within the heart of the singularity, he will be reborn, but to be merely reborn is not enough. He must accept the chaotic darkness of the singularity into his very soul. Following a similar principle to how the fiends manifest, it is emotion and despair merging that converts gloom born from singularity into true darkness. From this, it should be evident that darkness will follow him wherever he goes. Ever uh, Drawn ever to the gravitational well of his momentous despair it is the darkness injected into this world and the darkness born bred here that will guide him to the inevitable conclusion of our ploy. All that is left for him is to use the warp device I've prepared to send himself and all his accompanying shadows to that pocket dimension of theirs. Our plan will end in failure if we cannot seize the power to reset the world from them. Isn't that right, Jack? Um, to become chaos. You set me up to become chaos. No, on my end, you cut out, so all I heard was come chaos. Yeah. I feel like we're just talking spoilers for Final Fantasy 1. Yeah. Far, far away lies a place that could only be considered another dimension. Here, the Lufenians constructed what they call stations to serve their needs, stations like homes to the strangers, and in a sense, like a second home to me. From the various stations, the Lufenians monitor and control the very fate of the world. With coldly ra cold rationality, they fine-tune the balance of light and dark and wield the power to reset existence if deemed necessary. A long time ago, you told me that you wished to completely sever our world from the Lufenians and wrest the power to reset the world from their grip. To this end, you hatched a ploy and a uh, plot and spoke at great length to me of my role within it. But enough history, the message is likely my final piece of guidance to you before you warp to Lefania, Jack, become chaos, free us from the shackles of these would-be gods. Yeah, go in the chaos shrine. They said to kill chaos, but what if you become him? Yes. Initiate immediate memory erasure in 
Yeah. He's wiggling through the portal. Proceed. What do we got? Hello? Rejoining. Who's this? Guys, I'm in the drive through at Dairy Queen. How's it going? <laughs> Garland is corrupted. Uh, can, I a blizzard? can I get an Oreo Blizzard, please? No, sorry. I, I got I, I got the, the caramel fudge cheesecake blizzard. Oh, that's good, too. The strawberry and a thing of, and a thing of, cheese, and a thing of cheese curds, because I want to oh, die. Nah, throw that in the trash. That goes in the trash. Delicious. Anyway, can you hear me? how far are you in Stranger Paradise? Literally the last one. Oh, fantastic. I'm excited. I should probably look at the stream. Uh, you're driving? So maybe not? Yes, I am. I am. I'm in my motor vehicle. I am sitting in the drive through line. Waiting for the people ahead of me to get their Dairy Queen. Oh, Jack is, uh, Jack has gone sicko mode. Has he just started? Yeah, no, this part's great. This entire game. Amazing. I can actually pull up the stream on my phone too, and then I can see what's happening in real time. I'm punching the hell out of these crystals. Power of the internet at your fingertips. Power of the internet at my fingertips. I'm punching the hell out of these crystals. the outside of it? Am I... Okay, there's one big crystal left. Why is it not taking damage? Thing happens when you destroy the big crystal. Brayden, can we play uh, King of Dragon Pass? Oh. Podcast. Draw up the deep end. I mean, it's very good. Yes. I I would play King of Dragon Pass, but that I that fills I would... the box. Uh, that fills the objective of playing nothing but playing some CRPGs. That's a CRPG. I mean, it no. Yes. It is. Yes. I think that game defies genre. It's a but for CRPG. the purposes of our podcast, I would call it a CRPG. <sighs> Ooh. They really should not have leaked that his name was Jack Garland. Yeah. Let's go. I mean, Wicked starts with the Wicked Witch. It just tells you that this is about the Wicked Witch. I know, this but it's... This is just wi Wicked. This, this is Wicked, but for Garland. <laughs> Yes. I've been saying that. Oh, no. No one mourns the wicked. No one... <laughs> yep. Does he have a mouth where his dick is? I didn't see. Is that a, a maw? Just... <laughs> a dick maw? Chaos! I he does. I can't actually see this, but he I, does. I'm only assuming the worst when it comes He's to got a dick got belt. A, He's horror. got a mouth on his dick hole. Like his dick is a mouth he eats. Yeah, listen, you gotta you gotta eat somewhere. So does that mean that chaos has a cloaca? Yes. I uh, I'm gonna assume yes. 
We've seen its sphincter. We know. What up, Darkness Manifest? What if I turn invisible? Does that work? Seems like it might. I died. Again. Try again. I assume I just start in the battle. Yep. Uh, what does it say? Uh, the creature of darkness permanently seek, primarily seek to engage in close combat. It is just as competent at destroying its enemies with elemental attacks before they get close. Find a way through the barrage of attacks. Close the distance. Engage in melee. Got it. Engage in melee combat. Can do. Come on, Darkness Manifest. Focus up. Ah. He knocks he knocks my buffs off. He just knocks them all off. Oh, no. Okay. He knocks all my buffs off, and he... Ugh, the buffs... The buffs getting knocked off sucks. That's kind of my strategy. I have this guy, and they lay out... What if I just... I'll read the title for this. Always be sidestepping. So dodge. Basically, apparently, when this boss ha has a weird animation where he basically plants his feet. Everything, including spells. Is you dodge. You will never get hit. Just always be dodging? Sidestepping specifically. Okay. Can do. Imagine that his weak spot is his booty hole. Hit the butt all the time. Shoot your fist deep into that anal slit. Oh. Damn it. Always be sidestepping, but I don't think I don't think Sage is like great at this. Can I have more water? I'm at the the final boss. Yay. Ugh. Chaos, I'm going to kill you. I come not to praise Chaos, but to slay him. Okay, Marnik Anthony. See, I got that reference. Yeah. Change jobs. Let's become a breaker. I don't think you're going to shatter my bones. Oh, I should have. I shouldn't have stopped. That stomp. That stomp attack is the perfect definition of always be sidestepping. Stops yep. completely to do this frame of animation. Yeah, I... Uh... One thing I'll say about this game, I feel like the cues in terms of the animations are better and clearer in this game than Elden Ring. Yes. My goodness. I mean, this is a modern game. <laughs> Like well, it's it looks a... like shit. Like it's it's an ugly ass fucking video game. No, it isn't. It's the fine. The models are awful. The backgrounds are terrible. Like the production values, like it it looks like a PS3 game. 
A good PS3 game. When's the last time you... I mean, other than... Uh, Oh, that hits all around them. Got it. You don't play a lot of modern PC games, Gino, so... I don't. Uh, yo, PC games on modern NVIDIA cards, Oof. or even, like, AMD cards, they look fucking great. From what I understand, this game on PC, though, is just a mess. It's a teeming dumpster fire, which is why I'm in a weird bind, because... I don't have any of the modern consoles. I've heard that there is a mod that allows you to use hair without the game going to three-digit FPS. Yeah, apparently they... The, and by the three, that I, I mean has actual a three. engine that causes the, the frame rate to just die. I do like how there is an option to turn off the hair so that everyone is just bald. No, but why would you do that? Chaos! Chaos is why, ZP. I wonder, I should check my... What are the, my settings? Not a flex. I just, I just to be aware of this. Windows 11, blah blah blah. Yeah. 64 base PC, of course. I7 10, 700 KF. 2.8 hertz, eight cores, 16 processors. It's basically an I7. I was considering going to the I9, but it's like uh, I don't want to have to worry about that. Ooh. Uh, 32 gigabytes of RAM. Chaos. And 36 yeah. Ti. Let's talk this out. <laughs> Checklist. Let's talk this out. Let's let's chill. What do you want? Yeah. I'm assuming you have a list for me or another. Will you be my man? Yes. Have the other one. For you. Ah. Yes. It's the tale of an angry man. What's up, Darkness Manifest? I feel like you could play Tenacious D's tribute to the, what we are watching right now, and it would feel very on point. Yes. Chaos. That move's move. That move was called chaos. Assassinate. Nega shock. Oh no! Damn it! I almost had him there. I just I stopped dodging for half a second like an idiot. Uh, let me go ahead and oh, can I not? Do I not have cubes? I can't. I can't upgrade my shit. That sucks. Why can't I upgrade my shit? It's the last fight of the game. Let me use all my resources. I really need to not stop. Like, stopping to do setup stuff is what's killing me. Oh, 
Oh. What the hell? I, like, took him out easy the first, first time. Did you have to take out both versions now? I do, yeah. I just more meant, like... <sighs> that kick just, like, knocks all of my uh, stamina out. Yeah, that seems messed up. Adrian, you know, I'm gonna pick your brain again. What are the most fucked up final bosses we've ever played in FF history? Boy, howdy. I played 13-2 again for the sake of that vlog. Messed up. There's fucking eight dragons you need to beat. Yeah. Oh, sucks. damn it. This sucks. this sucks. You're right. You're right, Jack Garland. It's another... Well, nine, obviously. Bad. Blue PP from a butt. Yeah, Necron, if you're not ready for him, sucks. Hmm, what's another? Oh, yeah, the 13. Oh, Bartantilus just takes forever. I'm not talking about that first Bartantilus. I'm talking about Orphan Bartantilus at the end. Yeah, takes forever. What the hell? I'm Brayden back. and I have a friend who got to that final boss and then died three or four times. Like, nah, I'm just going to YouTube the ending of 13 and call it a day. That's that's the right decision. Probably gonna I'm gonna probably yeah, it, it's my friend Yatsu, who I played Perfect Dark with today. He literally got to, you know, the last boss. The guy who just hops around and you need to snipe him? And then, you know, straight up, it's just a DPS check. Oof. Oh, I survived that. Oh, not that, though. Speaking this fight kind of sucks. Did you I, I, beat I, I, Perfect, I Dark Perfect Dark Zero today? No. No, we did not. Is that we a possibility? I'm just times. assuming that game is, like, stupidly broken. Remember the final boss? The, it's the uh, it's the weird Asian guy that hops around and he becomes the Incredible Hulk, right? Sure. That just that sounds, sounds like right. a video game. I don't remember him being that hard. We didn't get that far though. I mean, the whole point of the game is to go back to previous missions and like pick up guns. Remember, you can only have a certain number of guns when you end the mission, and if you end the mission with guns that are not new, then you're done fucked up. Oh, is that how that works? Yes. You can't pick guns for the loadout unless you end the level with them? Yes. Wow, that's great. So, there are certain guns that are the, the good guns that you have to end the mission with them in your inventory. There are some guns that the game just gives you because, hey, it's a sniper mission. Obviously, we're going to give you a sniper rifle. Yeah, some of the guns you pick up from the enemies that are really good, I think, like, the rocket launcher with the homing missiles, like, you should need that. You need to end the mission with that. Otherwise, you're going to be using that pistol with the two times zoom. A lot of missions, and that gun sucks. Oh, this get up. It's pretty good. They took my wonderful laptop ah. and made it shitty. I don't think the you gloves... Know, it makes you feel better. I beat this boss by doing Ultima spam. Uh, I'm going to try using a different Ultima weapon. Spam. Can I... Yeah, Radiant Lance with Assassin. That's the, that's the other thing. I don't know if you consider it too cheesy, Gino, but apparently this boss is hypersensitive to Ultima. I mean, I'll consider it. I'm just trying a weapon that doesn't require me to be quite so damn close to him. Like, same strategy, just like a different weapon. Like, I won't be quite as fast, but I will crit more. 
killing the final boss with nothing but Ultima sure is a Final Fantasy thing. It's a tale as old as time. We okay, earthquake. I beat five and six. Doing that. Oh, I mean in six, like once you get Ultima, it's like there's no fucking point. Why do anything else? Uh, you did three moves that time. You did three that time. That's annoying. I can't believe I got to the second form, almost beat it, and now I'm having trouble. Ultima. I can. Ultima. You know, if you put on armor, is this going to be like when, um, when a uh, guy, or what's his name, Rock Lee, drops his weights in yes. the Gara fight? Yes, it would exactly be that. It's when, uh, it's when Vegeta, not Vegeta, Goku and Piccolo take off their hats and their wristbands. I still think that Rock Lee versus Gara fight is like top top five anime fight. <laughs> Dang it, I'm getting distracted. What, do you want me to put that on? Are no, funny pet things I, happening? I no. My my wife got a shirt. What does it say? Can you see it? It was two dollars at the store. Two dollar shirt. It says, right it's there. He Man just standing smiling and it says, Sup, ladies. Oh, yeah, please. I don't know if it's my shirt or your shirt. I don't know if it's my shirt or your shirt either, but boy, that's a good shirt. Okay, the, uh, the breaker is not, has never been put into my uh, rotation in this fight, so let's go ahead and get a Thor's hammer and get Sage going. So now I have access to the spam. If need be. I wish I had the ability to, like, go to a save cube and use my items that I've stocked up over the course of the game. Maybe now is the time when I would upgrade an item. If not now, when? When? comment apparently someone also wants to chime in hardest final fantasy part. i think with the first part the answer was i had to figure out the game's mechanics since i really didn't before just hit the auto button for every single part yeah that's the problem they drop a difficult boss battle and that's when they expect you to just figure everything out yeah like yeah bart bart Tandalus is like maybe a perfect example of how not to do a boss because yeah. it requires you to be so on the fucking ball just at all times buff attack specific spells to break or stagger specific abilities to do damage and if you don't buff. do it right you're just stuck buff. in suspended animation the whole time like you're not making progress Oh wow! I jumped right into it. Um, you're not—you don't make progress. Not even just a DPS wall. Like he's just—if you don't have your paradigm set up right and you don't figure out his shit, you are dead. But it's gonna take like a half hour for him to kill you too. Oh, I'm dead. The death of a thousand cuts type of fight. Yeah, I mean, the thing is, like, Who Final Fantasy that? 13 battles take, like, a half hour where all, you're not in control of your characters at any point. You're just, you know, m managing your paradigms, swapping them constantly so that you can, um, you know, equip the right stuff at the right time, block when it's blocking time, punch when it's punching time. So you're just fucking with that stuff forever uh the double earth um and if at any point your paradigms you fuck up like 
you're just going to slowly lose HP instead of being at neutral. And then eventually it will whittle you down. Or you're not killing him, you're just at neutral. You know, uh, lightning returns is good. Okay. Keep doing this. This is awesome. Brr, chaos. What are we doing? Come on. Ultima. Uh, Ultima's fine. Doesn't hit that hard. Doesn't fundamentally change anything about the fight, is what I should say. I just, you know, I have this Ultima move that after I've dodged enough, it hits him very hard. But yeah, I'm dead. So I, I think that Ultima, while a cute idea, um, for my build at least, um, doesn't actually solve the problem. I'm still just dodging him at all times. Uh, maybe the Lance doesn't attack fast enough. I mean, the gloves... Gloves do hit hard. Where was the one that... Yeah, the Sonic Knuckles. That was your Dairy Queen. Aiden. Oh, he's muted. Oh, it was pretty good. I liked it. You, you had a blizzard and then some bullshit. I had a blizzard and some cheese curds. They were good. Cheese curds are good. I stand, I, I stand clear. They were, they were nice and like... Squeaky and good. Do you want that is squeaky? the term all of the Midwestern people I know would say. It's like, oh, you gotta get the squeaky ones. Listen, if it's not, if it's not like slightly, the texture of slightly used chewing gum. Oh, I didn't die. Then, then yeah, is it I want, even when I want screwed? food? I want I want stuff that reminds me of biting into the tip of an eraser and a pencil. Why do you know what that sensation is? I can't is? hear it squeaking against my teeth. <sighs> All sickos. A whole lot of them. I mean, if it makes you feel better, I'm probably going to regret this in, let's say, three, three hours. Four hours. Well, I already feel bad. Yeah, because you ate an entire fucking pizza. I feel pretty good about what I ate. How how was it with the cocoa powder on it? Not bad. Yeah, I bet. But yeah, assassinate might actually be the thing for you right now. For sure. Just by virtue of. You can proc it so many times. No. Oh, the AOE got me. 
But yeah, assassinate. I, I can proc it so many times. If he like does any of his, I'm gonna stand still and get you moves. Um, I pretty much got him there. Oh no. Tsunami is by far his best move. Oh, the AOE on that punch. Okay. Brayden, how many times did this take you? Or did it was it just one very long attempt with... Uh... Oh, Tsunami just... Boy. Tsunami's just way, way wider AOE. He tracks more with it. It's the fire move, but much stronger. It even hits harder, too. Odious Wind. Flood Weapon. Ah, oh, crap. I can't overcommit is the problem. I have to, like, balance the aggression with the, uh, with the dodging. Come on now. Flee. Odious Wind is free damage. What are we doing? Whirlwind? Okay. Malicious Waters. Right back at you. Okay. But I have a question for, for the panel. Yes. Uh, so I, I reached my goal to... I am once again doing the same stretch goal I did last year where I said I will play through the entirety of any of the, the dubious games I've previously played on stream. Uh, terms and conditions apply. Okay. And I'm wondering if you guys have any nominees, because right now I'm like, what if I just finished Hitman Absolution? I don't know what's on the... Uh, did you finish that Skittles game? No. <laughs> Was that part of this? I, I'm I, I'm gonna say roughly open to everything, but let's say more priority to things I played this weekend. Can I say the Skittles also, game anyway? There are some other games that I will not be playing through the entirety of, <clears throat> unless people pay me money. It's no, it's no longer for the charity. It's no longer for the children. It's for it's for the Braden. I'm a child. We're all a child of someone. Great ends of promise. <laughs> I, I, yes. Witness the birth I, of chaos. Uh, yeah, this whole the cutscene leading up to this fight is very good. It is, and then this fight's kind of eh. I mean, yeah, yeah, I bet this fight would be pretty eh if you literally could not take a hit. I could take a hit. I would say Hitman Absolution wouldn't be a bad idea. Because I feel like that game is, is, like, equal parts. It plays pretty well, but it makes me mad. Yeah, it is a game that could have been way better if just, you know, like it's it's it was basically like a wrong turn happened, and that's what you got. Hitman yeah, Absolution. Yeah, no, you, they they took a left turn, and Powers Booth was there, and you're like, ah, claimed, acclaimed character actor Powers Booth playing the greasiest man. Come on. CP, do you have any input? If you're muted, I can't hear you. Maybe the pizza finally got to him. Oh no, the pizza. He's more pizza than man now. He's he's just a that or his internet broke again. Assassinate. Second form. Oh, don't be sage form when this 
this fight starts. <laughs> So the good news is uh, you have infinite MP mm -hmm. during this phase of the fight. Oh. The bad news is this it's, it's still pretty hard. But yeah. If, He's still very if aggressive. If you want to spam Ultima, this is the phase. Well, because you have dance infinite with magic. Dance with what brought you, right? Yes. Swing in the wrong direction, you idiot. Flee. Assassinate. Assassinate Classroom. My favorite anime. Is that a real anime? Assassination Classroom? Absolutely. And it's actually good. Nega Shock. I don't know if you're if the mic is picking up the uh, the dogs. There are no dogs here. It might just be me okay. breathing heavily. No, it's me. I'm talking about Oh. My my roommate is dog sitting right now mm -hmm. for her mom, so we have two uh, two additional visitors. I see. And they are both uh, large dogs. Mm. And one of them is uh let's say he he's very needy. He's 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 a very anxious pupper. And also, he's a 75-pound golden retriever and something else. Golden Doodle? No, he's not Golden Doodle. He's not... He's not like Bo. He's not my friend Bo. Um, my sister's dog is, like, a little under 50 pounds. Uh, but it's great, because every time I leave my room, oh. I get, I get kind of mobbed by these two dogs who very much want my attention and approval and also Always. would like to violently lick my face. Oh, cool. You got two spam bots. Someone Double killed the them. Spam bots. All right, let's. I can't. No, I, I cannot. You're 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 a little busy. I, I think I, I I think the coward strategy is working. You just need to never get hit. I'm bobbing and weaving. <laughs> I am boxing this chaos. Is, this is just uh, Ashita no Joe. Now, that's another deep anime cut. Yeah, that's right. That's right, I'm back. Anime is back. Oh no. I thought about I I I'm very close to re upping a Crunchyroll yeah. sub. Ajime no Ipo is uh the boxing reference to make. Yeah, and and that was what I was thinking of, but of course the way my brain works, I'm like, oh, what's a boxing anime? Ashita no Joe. <laughs> I don't even know what you're saying. But it's, it, it means like everyday Joe gets good at boxing. He gets very good at punching. Yeah, just yeah, like but... you. And it's kind of the archetypical sports manga. Character One died in Ashita no Joe, and uh, people were so upset in the original printing of the manga that they actually held funerals in Japan. Oh no. Yikes. Oh, no. Do one of your moves that's easily punished, please. Good deal. Good 
heal. You're gonna give me anxiety. Please. He can't please heal. Go. He's out of healing potions. He's gotta hit him with blood weapon. Oh no! Chaos! Too much chaos. Well, I have ascended to a new level of violence, so this man can no longer hurt me. Is this like a sticks and stones situation? No, or? this is a... I have... If you wanted to ever see hyper-focus Gino, it's this. Just 300% concentration? Yes. That 300% concentration. If his concentration goes any higher, he'll go into the zone. What if we use 100% of the brain? And 100% of the brain is going to punching this dude in the ass. Finally. What the people have been asking for this whole time. Have some. You don't understand. You're gonna die. Yes. Yes, chaos. Give me your chaos. Oh, no. Damn it. <sighs> can't get tagged. Just can't. Can't get punched. Flee, blood weapon. I could probably stand to put another ability in the third slot, because... Um, do you have, uh... What is it called? Which one? Because... These two are real good. Flea's basically haste, but anyone can use it. And I don't have to cast it. All right, the cast is very fast. Stamp back, asshole. Oh, assassinate! Oh, that should have killed... That should have stolen so much HP from him. Okay, let me look at my abilities because I could use a little bit more wiggle room and I am invisible. I don't think it's going to work on him. Uh, so, overpower. Long-range attack, no. Lancet, exploiting an enemy weakness. I'm not exploiting weaknesses. Slowly uh, recover... You could do MP. Venom. Venom. You could Ooh. poison the boss. Let's see. Let's see if poison works on him. It's possible it doesn't. Only one way to find out. Oh, fire hurts hard. Well, you're having a fun time. I am. I'm about to kill chaos. Oh, I died. I'm going to kill Chaos. I was so close to killing Chaos. That fucking move by like a pixel hit me. 
I think this is way more entertaining. Didn't you, didn't you come, like, incredibly close to the first attempt? Yes. Dread Earth is... So, Tsunami's his best move. Dread Earth is probably his second. Just because it hits quite hard. The fire move is very easy to dodge, thankfully. Bop, bop, bop. But what is the uh, the Shaggy meme? Feral Instinct Shaggy or yeah, Ultra Instinct Shaggy. My favorite DBZ character. Oh, <laughs> uh, oh, okay. Venom. Hmm. I mean, it works. It will work. It's just like, how hard is it to land the Venoms? Is... Do we have any donations to read out? Anything no. to distract me? No, no donations, only chaos. <laughs> just retweeted Rory's uh, tweet. Hey, come on over for the last hour. Oh boy, got. Okay, so he does put the fire circle right under his feet, which is kind of annoying. You could also put armor on him. Shut up. Shut, shut up. If I ask for dumb suggestions. Oh, it washes away my buffs. Oh, yeah, you, you lose your buffs when you get staggered, by the way. Oh, I thought it was a debuff thing. Because he's chaos. The the real the real debuff was getting hit. Getting hit in the face all along. Oh, he tagged with his stupid debuff, hand. Getting punched in the face. That does debuff me pretty hard. <laughs> that tends to knock my stagger meter up as well. That's the one you started with, my guy? I like that if I'm doing something and then I hit the parry button, it just is like, you meant to parry. This game's like, it's cool, bro. I know you were parry. animation canceling. Oh, didn't quite get out of the range. I was too I was too uh, focused on punching the butt, and not enough on dodging. Flee, blood weapon. Earthquake is his worst attack. Which is fitting because Lich was his worst goon. Least effective goon goes to, award goes to Lich. You know, I haven't gotten your take on the Kingdom Hearts 4 trailer. Uh, it looks like fucking Kingdom Hearts. I don't know. Just, what about the part where it was in Shibuya? Like, that was weird, but I knew that was coming because of, like, the end of Kingdom Hearts 3. And the fact, my problem with the new Kingdom Hearts trailer is that Kingdom Hearts has been reducing... Is that his feet are regular sized? Yes. His feet? Yes, I hate that his feet are regular sized. Like, they have been trying to make... Like, this is funny to have regular man in Final Fantasy world. But Sora was always, like, 
there's a history there. You can't just like a hyper stylized anime character that fits yes. in the world of Disney, right? You, you can't just Disney every and... time uh, you want to do your hyper realistic you high art Sora's style. Seeking, seeking a therapist? Can't you just be proud of Sora? No. Finally confronting his problems and anxieties. confidence in the medical system to address his issues of anxiety and knowing that his friends are going to be consumed by the darkness. Your friend. <clears throat> okay, Will you be consumed by the darkness. You can poison him. So I take it that Kingdom Hearts 3 didn't end the story. No. Uh, Kingdom Hearts 3 ended the Xehanort story. Excuse me. Oh, okay. So this is a case. So of this is one uh, door the, the Keyblade left. Saga is over. It's now time for the Lost Master Saga, apparently. Ah, okay. Any further questions, dummy? Uh, yeah. Um. Do you think that they're also not going to put the Square Enix characters in it? Yes, I think that they are I not. I bet there will be not that many Disney characters. Because Disney is weird and protective. I, I, I feel like I have to say this to you every single time. Not really. I mean, they got Toy totally Story easy. already. You can go to Tokyo Disney and you can find Sora. There's a guy dressed up as Sora, and then I even. I'm not saying Papua. no. I'm saying di like Disney get, will will you know they will let your Jack Skellingtons do whatever. But the second, like, you get to a movie that they actually care about, like, compared the Frozen level, which has nothing going on, just absolutely nothing, to, like, I don't know, the Hercules levels, that beloved Disney property, Disney's Hercules. A movie I have a lot of fondness for, I but do. acknowledge is probably not that good. It's fine. It's a good, it's a good Danny DeVito performance. It is a great Danny DeVito performance. That's most Danny DeVito performances, to be fair. Danny DeVito only knows one way to act, and it is well. And it yes, it is, and it is Danny DeVito. And Danny oh. DeVito, like, and I think. I think so highly of Danny DeVito's performance in Always Sunny that that's basically the only version of Danny DeVito I'm used to anymore. Okay, second form. Second form with a lot of HP and a lot of healing items, so that's good. It certainly does leave a very lasting impression. Yes. May I offer well, you an egg I in these troubling Always times? Sunny, I mean, the movie that I always used to think of was, you know, Matilda. Yes. And then also Other People's Money. Danny DeVito's performance in Other People's Money is actually really, really good. Like, get to the part where he's, like, doing his, uh, the buggy whip rebuttal. That, that whole speech is fucking amazing. Oh, right, I have infinite mana. It, the, the thing about the, uh, that, that scene from Other People's Money is <gasps> follow up Gregory Peck. Fuck! Scene. Chaos! Okay, I've got three, but I'm starting with three mana this time. That's pretty big. Which, which one are we getting? Water. Okay, all my powers are up. Oh, no. And now I'm not at three mana anymore. Damn it. <sighs> Do you know how much longer are you going to go? I mean... He's got 30 minutes. I've got 30 He's minutes. Got 30 minutes to beat the last boss of this video game, or else he's banished forever. He has to look like this forever. Oh, this no. Realm. Yeah. Looking like this forever you know, I, is I the Shadow you Realm. To, uh, I want you to, you know, for your job, just go to a, into a Zoom call looking like that. And then get fired. And then get fired. No, just be like, I'm sorry, I, I was cursed with a horrible curse. <laughs> <laughs> Chaos. You don't understand. They killed my friends, Jed, Ash, Neon. 
No, yep, the other I one. killed my friends, Jed, Ash, Neon, and uh, Sophia. But you need to understand, it was part of our plan. They had to die to drive me to the point where I would kill the Lefenians. Oh my goodness. Come on. Gotta now. break the cycle. I gotta break the cycle gotta of violence with cycle new of violence. violence. With more violence. I'm saying this is literally the plot of Wicked. You're not wrong. Is this like a case of I'm saving you by killing you? Uh, Wicked. I wouldn't say that that's the plot of Wicked. Ah, oh, damn it. Earthquake is really my opportunity to tag him a lot. Why did that break me? That didn't... That that move shouldn't break me. Uh, I don't think poison's the way to go. Let me see if I've got any other abilities that are better than Venom. Uh, shield Bash, that ain't it. Reinforce. Temporarily decreases the amount of time required to charge certain attacks and the likelihood of being staggered. No. Summon Tai Chi. Temporarily increases damage taken and damage dealt. Nope. Ruin, nope. Sway back. Evade with a swift step back. Fills break gauge on activation. No. Lunatic. Temporary increases attack speed. But, oh, that's a good one. Because I'm not trying to get hit. <laughs> I'm not going to, like. If the plan is to not get hit. Oh, what the hell. That. Oh, I shouldn't be dodging that. I should be just running. I should hit flee and then run in a circle. Lunatic. Oh boy, it, it sure does increase your attack speed. You need to be in the middle of the arena, my guy, so I can circle strafe around you without these pieces of, uh, bell, bell, I forget what the term is, without these bits getting in my way. <laughs> Holy crap. Ah, uh, Earthquake Curses. Oh. I mixed up the moves. Oh. You can actually... You can parry that. I guess any move that doesn't have red, you can parry. Yep. So, shouldn't surprise me. Which one are we doing? Tsunami... There's a lot of weird timing with some of the parry stuff, though. Yeah, and this this guy specifically, like, I just can't get hit by so many of his moves, or I just die. So, like, I'm just thinking specifically of stuff like that Thornberry move where he shoots out. I mean, I can't remember the name of it, but. The timing on that needs to be so precise, and then also it hits like 50 fucking times. 
Pardon me. Oh, what? Everyone's grudge. Yeah, oh, the Tonberry move. You said Thornberry move. I'm like, yeah. Nigel? Nigel. Th well, Nigel, <laughs> Nigel Thornberry, Thornberry is in uh, Nickelodeon All-Stars. He is? See, I have this problem where... Yeah, he is. Hell yeah. My vision is terrible, so I just kind of read the blur of what I think it is, and then it just gets stuck in my head forever. Please tell me Nigel Thornberry's top tier. Has that game come out yet? I mean, he probably is. I mean... Who wouldn't be top? I mean, if anyone's going to be top tier, it's going to be Nigel Thornberry. That's uh, true. I genuinely... Do you want me to look up the tier list? Yes. All right. I'm going to look up the tier list for, for Nickelodeon All-Stars. All right. Is Garfield top tier? Let's find out. We can only hope. All right. What tier is Garfield in Nickelodeon All-Stars Brawl? Okay, this is from optionselect.com. Oh, that that's reputable right there. That that sounds okay. Um So, uh right now the the 21 characters in Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl. Uh want me to tell you who the uh in F tier is Reptar, SpongeBob Shit. SquarePants, Leonardo, Lincoln Loud, and in D tier, we've got uh, Danny Phantom, Ren and Stimpy, Aang, and Sandy from SpongeBob. Dang, you're okay. in, in C tier, we've got Toph, we've got Helga from Hey Arnold, we've got Cat Dog, Powdered Toast Man. <laughs> Patrick Starr and April O'Neil. And then in B tier... April O'Neil? Is in this game? April yeah. O'Neil's in there. Yeah. Ninja Turtles are a Nickelodeon property now. Oh, I did not know that. Uh, B tier is Shredder, Oblina. I don't know who that is. Uh, Michelangelo. And then in A tier, it's uh, Nigel Thornberry. Yes! Field and Cora. And then S tier is Lucy Loud. Oblina's Who's Lucy Loud? Ah, real monster. Uh, who's Lucy Loud? From the Loud family. What? Yes. From from the family Loud. That's not us. I am legitimately surprised that there is a Hey Arnold character in that game. Nah, the kids know who Hey Arnold is. No, they don't. Oh, I know. It's just. I it's, know. It's for, it's for the boomer ass boomers playing that video it's game. It's for their parents just, playing I, with them. I it, can't it's think of, us. like, any scenario where people used violence in a Arnold. Uh, there uh, is yeah, the fight but, episode. Well, maybe Helga. about bullying. You're, maybe Helga, yes. The absolutely. karate episode where Arnold learns karate and then misuses his karate and his grandmother needs to teach him about how to use karate correctly. Karate for good. All right, we're back to his second form again. Okay, remember, I need to remember anyway, that... Anyway, I just think it's very funny that Garfield is high tier. Of course. If Was there any doubt? There's murder in that cat's eyes. Yeah, but what's Garfield's Okizeme mode? How, how good is he at off the ground? How good are his mix-ups? Garfield's mix-ups are uh, top tier. You know, the, the, the lasagna loop. That would be uh, amazing. Yeah, Garfield combo I call the lasagna loop. <laughs> I thought you were going to say, I hate Mondays loop. I think that's just the ultimate move, right? Because when you're done they with the move, they the hate Mondays. Uh, you can thank me later, people who made the video game. Isn't it literally like former the the isn't it the rivals of Aether people or something? I, I have no clue. I believe so. It's one of those those platform fighters the kids like that I don't give a shit about cuz uh only only one of these platform fighters has Sephiroth. That's true. Oh, my favorite Nintendo character, Sephiroth. I need to be fast again, or he needs to do a bad move. 
I actually really like playing a Sephiroth in that game. Assassinate yeah, for just HP. Because he has a big fucking sword. Just an obscenely long sword. And that's what I want. It's big sword, man? Okay. Yes, big sword. So it's not big sword, man. It's big sword, man. Yeah, it's big sword, comma, man. I think ruin... Yes, ruin is a move I can run from. Like... I, I could care less if, if the man holding the sword is big. I just want the sword the man holds. Ah! Obscenely big. So what if we combine this and we have Big the Cat wield a big sword? Big the Cat holding a big sword? That fan art exists. 100%. I, I'm sure it does. I'm not going to Google Big the Cat fan art. Now you don't need to Google it. You go to DeviantArt for that. Go to the dark web. DeviantArt's not the dark web. DeviantArt is art. By Deviants. I mean, listen, a Suddenly lot, it a says lot, you need a to lot of professional artists of the modern day got their start on DeviantArt. That's true. N you know, not everyone is privileged to, to begin with a, a silver spoon in their mouth Sometimes, sometimes you gotta grind your way to relevancy with naked pictures of your favorite. Does Tsunami have a max range? It does. Oh, thank goodness. Because that was gonna be real bad if it didn't. Your, your favorite licensed characters. Can you draw Danny Phantom with a large ass? Yes. That's what DeviantArt is for. That's what DeviantArt is for. DeviantArt is here for you. You just use the tag system. You put in Danty Phantom. Dan Dandy. Dandy Phantom. Dandy Phantom. Add ass. Add large. And then add in charge. Dump truck Phantom. <laughs> Dump. Dot wave. If I, here's the thing, you make too many jokes about like, haha, pornography, and then, uh, there is nothing we can make up now that hasn't already been created. Yeah, there's nothing we can make up that doesn't already exist, and also, you run into the trap that Griffin McElroy ran into when he started making jokes about Vore. What? Listen, it, it, it involves... It, it's because he ate that banana weird during that Sea of Thieves E3 demo. And it escalated from there. I don't even know what you're talking about. I'm saying, I'm saying if, if, you, if you invoke the devil's name enough times, the devil will find you. <laughs> he will show up. Yes. I really... This music's, like, fine. Ugh. Fine, I'll drink a potion, you son of a bitch. You will rue the day you made me use a potion. I alone am more than enough darkness. Assassinate. Yeah. Okay, second form again. I am I am getting better at this. Can you get better quicker? I'm. Uh, <laughs> can you get better? I'm working on it, my guy. He's chaos. 
Who am I to? But I'm tired. What is a man to a chaos? Come on. Do a move that I can punish. I bet I'm supposed to use Lightbringer here. Right? I didn't. But I bet this fight is like... That's what they're hoping you do. Come on, Chaos, you son of a bitch. Just hold still. You know, he's been getting all of this equipment and items, and he's been saying no. No! Sorry. I'm almost done. I, it's the literal last I, fight in the game. I, I know. I'm, just give me another crack at it. Give me another crack at it. I love give you. you another crack addict? No, not another crack addict. A crack at it. You heard me. The only addiction people have here is addiction to video games. Chaos. Yes. That's true. We hate chaos. In this house, we hate chaos. I don't want to be in a house that doesn't hate chaos. Oh, I didn't recognize the moo. Or I didn't. I got greedy. No. Slam into chaos with my very being. Ugh. Which one is it? Earthquake. Okay. I can equip all of my things. Come on. Jump at me. Wind. Punch him in the butt. Uh. <sighs> oh, what's the excuse that that's not the crack at it? That doesn't count? No. The need to destroy chaos is too great. Yes. I but will fight give up. chaos naked in my underwear. I will wrangle him. We will fight chaos in the streets. Gonna we wrestle will, him to the ground? We will, we will fight chaos in the beaches. Okay. We'll fight chaos but not get rid of colonialism. Hey, Sometimes it, you just you need know, to prioritize. You either you you can either get rid of colonialism or you can fight chaos. All right, I need to I need to kill chaos with my inside voice. I'm gonna kill chaos Can't with my inside you voice. Killed, you killed your marriage. Nope. You know you can always do what you did last time is you just call it, then do it on another screen. I'm not even at my time yet. I've still got five minutes. I know, I'm just joking. I just realized that you also still have it listed as Tales from Austin City. I do? Yeah. Awesome. You never yeah, changed. you never changed your, uh... Your template. So it does say 8 p.m. to question mark p.m. I mean, it is question mark PM, so part of it is true. Yeah. That's like me realizing the third that? day that you, every that stream game I have says day run one. Run any better? No. Uh, it crashed my PC. It ran. 
and then it crashed my PC. I mean, what what else could you expect from Cosmo D? Like your your PC ate a pizza, and then crazy shit happened. Yep. The additional speed actually just kind of made me too greedy. Giving you a false sense of security? Oh, he can't hit me. I'm too fast. No, it just made me want to hit him more times than I really should have. Like, there was the safe amount of times I could hit him, and then I would always go one too many. Oh no, but I, I still can't get tagged like even once. <laughs> like how much Brayden does uh, armor decrease the uh, uh, I'm dead. this is this is a dead run. Um, how much does armor decrease the damage taken really? I mean, you could put on the armor and see no. But you're playing on action difficulty and not hard. So. Yeah, I guess. I had to guess it will also probably mean you get broken a lot less. Is there like an equivalent to the poise stat in this game? Yeah. Uh, basically, I, from what I understand, it's basically like the higher your, um,. your level is relative to the the ah. recommended level of the enemy of of the game of the the level uh determines how easily you you are broken versus break as one break versus broken yes Which one are we doing? Tsunami? I wish I could just use items. Like, I wish I could go into my menu and put more points into Assassin. But I can't. Like, the game, once you get here, you're stuck here. Right? There's no... There's no abandoned mission option. You can't blame the game for that, Gino. I mean, I can blame the game for locking me into the final fight without access to multiple mechanics. When you actively not engaged in literally every okay that's not right. true at all that's not I just not wearing armor looking at class energies or i am looking at class energies what are you even talking about like the only way that i'm even beating i'm at the final boss like i am using class energies i'm not using armor that's the one mechanic i'm not interacting with which has synergies with the character significant classes. buffs yeah, yeah significant buffs, buffs. That actually tie into whether or not you're Fine. using the correct Fuckers. equipment with the classes that you have. Actually Fine. In Shut, the up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Oh, I already burned I all just... of my armor. It's all gone. It would be funny if actually you he looks into his inventory and it's all actually it is, gone. It is all actually gone. I just looked. I was going to like use before armor. Before he went here, he just... I was tempted by armor. Turned it all into material and... I did. here. 
I'm trapped here now. I mean, you could just leave the level. I don't think I can do that. But no, I, I, I have no sympathy for you choosing the path you have chosen. Like, congratulations, your 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 ability to dodge good and read patterns in the face of, of stuff or not for chaos. Shut up, assholes. Sit back and watch the birth of chaos. Witness the birth of chaos. I'm pretty sure he's just trying to, like, make himself go through the exact Jack Final Fantasy experience. I'm a method actor. God, method acting. Well, chap, what if you simply acted? Right, pretend. What? Okay, listen, the only way you can get into the, the, the true role of being the Joker is if you send all of your fellow cast members a bunch of uh, used condoms. Yep. Wait, what, what, what is this a reference of? Jared Leto. Leto and the oh, right. Jared Leto right. and Suicide right. Squad yeah, right. sent Wait, his co-stars used condoms. And ha, he's ha, not ha. on the sex offender registry? Uh, I mean, he should be. I mean... His cult, and his, I heard he, I have heard he is in uh, the DMs so is this like of he every is part of a cult, or he has made his own. Cult? He has a cult. His cult is based around him and his band. Who he has a, he has a band. Yeah, he was yes, in. Yes, uh, he has a God. band. It's called Three Seconds to Mars. Three Seconds to Mars, a, a Nemo band. Um, and yeah, he, he's a bad person. He is. That's true. Um, I was suggested to sing a 30 Seconds to Mars song, but I said no. Jared Leto seems to be a bad dude and not in the like fun video game bad not, dudes in, not way. like Jack Garland yeah this isn't the emo isn't fun anymore it's like this is like oh we're, we're taking our emo and going home yep we have emo at home on the other hand uh how many of us can truly speak to the majesty that is uh Morbius a film I I saw Morbius how is what? Morbius no one why did you see Morbius? I wanted to you know how bad it was. Oh, it's because it you have, death. like, the equivalent of movie pass, right? Yeah. Isn't okay. that just, like, it is that literally the, it a little more. I didn't ask for this, the oh, movie, have, except um, everyone says that. Whole, so my parents used to always buy me, uh, for my birthday, because I like movies, they used to buy me, uh, gift cards for Pandango. And I have, like, a, two $75 Pandango cards that have or like two years old and you know i didn't get to use them for the longest time and you're yeah, like so ah yeah it's time to see the beloved film that I don't inspires know about generation you, something that's incredibly underrated is watching movies by yourself i True. don't watch movies by myself i watch anime by myself like i'll do that Me. at home but not really going to the theater myself oh man it's great because you can just go to whatever you want and not have to worry about picking what's right for another person like the compromise between you and another group it's great i went to the kono suba movie alone that was the last time i went to a movie theater alone it was an okay movie yeah no it's great and it was with like the right kind of audience for that movie which is to say uh it was like 80 percent male And Seems like the audience of Konosuba. Yeah. All right. You don't. You don't like Konosuba. That's right. Um. I just think that it's. It doesn't need to continue. It, 
has it has shot its shot. Uh, it's the only isekai I give a shit about. The rest uh, can go burn in a fire. Slime. You should see slime. I mean, at least, at least, you know, this, I, the slime doesn't, like, advocate for eugenics or whatever the fuck half the isekai anime apparently are into. At that time, I got reincarnated as a slime is pretty good. This is See, my... it's weird that I have to think about it when you say, like, okay, the, the isekai that involves eugenics, and it's like, okay, which one is that? Which oh, one? No, it's there's the so answer many to the question them. is, which one at that point? Because there are multiple. Yeah, it's a real bad are thing. Are you suggesting I should feel bad about liking Rising of the Shield Hero? Well, Rising of the Shield Hero is just an incel power fantasy. I played all of that Sword Art Online, and I have a I have an appreciation for Sword Art Online. Like, here's the thing: at least Sword Art Online is like just shallow, like mindless Online wish fulfillment. Entry. 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 Shield Hero. Okay, that's not true at all. Talking Sword Art Online is also creepy and gross. He, yeah, both of them have, I mean, all of those have creepy and gross moments. The only thing I know about Shield Hero, ver like, so how could I put this? Uh, I've seen the... Shield Hero and I was like, oh, this could be good. And then it became bad really quickly in terms of what it was throwing at me. And I didn't know Oh, you mean anymore. like how it starts with literally, it literally start, starts with a false rape accusation and yeah. goes from there? And then you just see the man, just like the quickest fall to just being this punished. I hero. hate. Yeah, just like oh, I hate everything. Can't be as bad as when I watch now and then here and there, which uh, pictures a child being transported into an isekai world to save a girl he literally just saw. Then the entire show becoming a rant about the evils of you know child soldiers, which sounds good tell uh said girl that uh he's trying to rescue is uh, enslaved and bad things happen to her and he needs to then subject the audience to an entire episode on why abortion is bad okay sure all right uh, uh... that is somehow less egregious than i thought it was going to be uh but yeah I mean, at least it's not the opening episode of Goblin Slayer. Oh, oh yeah. I, I literally, you know, I, I watched the that first off. episode I was of like, Goblin oh. Slayer because I'm like, oh, White Fox is a studio that has a pretty good te track record. They Apparently, usually pick good projects. And what does everyone say is like, hey, after you get to pass that first episode, it gets really good. And I'm like, no, fuck off. You, you aren't allowed to say that. Like, if you were to tell me the plot of Goblin Slayer, but don't tell me what happens in the first episode. Like, you would trick me into watching Goblin Slayer every time. Yeah, no, it's about a crazy man who is so obsessed with murdering low-level goblin monsters that he is basically the Batman of murdering goblins, and he gets a bunch of other misfits to join him along the way, and I'm like, yeah, that sounds great. And then you watch it. And then you watch it. And you're like, oh, anime's bad. Anime was Well, mistake. we have to remember that part of the reason why it was bad is that when they first aired the first episode, they ac the Country Roll accidentally misrated it as TVPG. Uh -huh. That led to a lot of people watching Goblin Slayer that should not have watched Goblin Slayer. How many that kids? Was a real funny goof. How how many kids watching? I I guess I have no perspective on on what what the kids are into. Um. I just assume it's always the the Pokemons and the Digimons. I just, I'm just like, yeah, them kids, I see, sometimes I see kids with Hero Academia shirts, and I'm like, yeah, that makes they're sense. In, they're really into My Hero Academia, and they're really into these. At least they're not into Goblin Slayer. I'm pretty sure if you, like, show up to any public forum with a Goblin Slayer shirt, you're just put on the list. All right, this is my literal last attempt, and then I'm going to bed. Or I'm trying to get hey. to bed. This is my last attempt at killing chaos. We did a good job. Let's all talk about our successes. We've been messing around. I, I raised money. 
We um, raised money. We raised thirteen thousand dollars. Yeah, it's a lot of money for kids. Um, uh, I'm gonna watch that Matt Rory thing he did with George Seitz, cause I bet that's I'm real really good. I'm really looking forward. To it. I was like, please tell me you're gonna archive this. It's, yeah, it'll be on the site hopefully. Cause I want, I, I want it. Mask of the Traitor is very good. Yeah, it's just uh, as Rory said as he started this when he was like introducing his age. We're gonna disable that one feature. I, What's the one feature? The Soul Eater mechanic. It's it doesn't kick in until it is poorly later implemented. In Basically, you have to recharge a bunch of stuff. Basically, uh, you have to eat souls to not die. Yeah. But eating souls is generally considered an evil act. And uh, people generally frown upon it. Weird. And but, also, the more so souls you eat... if you want to play eat, a lawful character, it becomes very hard to law. The game... Doing so, the game just tried... Uh, the way that I heard it is that they wanted to force the player to... if At best, the best you could be in the world of Mask of the Betrayer is neutral. No one should be able... And this is how it was presented to me when I was able to act talk to someone from IDOS is like, no one should be able to be true, lawful, neutral in the world of Mask of the Betrayer. True, lawful, good, the world of Mask of the, of the Betrayer. Because in order to be alive, you're eating souls. But it's just poorly implemented. And you have to do it a lot more often than you would want to Yeah, so idea. that's how my that's how my neutral character just went full evil and I just embraced it and said I'm gonna be the bad guy now. Which, uh, leads to you usually collecting um, one of many instead of the bear. Oku, yeah. yeah. One of many is a better character, even if. But Oku is like a better party member. Oh yeah, 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 it's absolutely. But then you know. Yo, because one of many is invisible, which means your party members can't cast buffs on it. Remember when you feed that soul to one of many, and he's like, "Oh, this is too much for me. I'm gonna blow." Yeah, you feed him the soul of a go of a dead god, and it's like, "Ah, oh, shit, this is too much." And then Miracle, the god of death, is like, "Hey, asshole, you tried to eat me." Okay, you know. <laughs> You're gonna die. That, like said, that's it's, how it's that goes. Shit like that in, I, I hope they put in Baldur's Gate three. I want weird shit like that. Cause I'm the guy who killed. Rich. I mean, you can re you can adopt a baby owl bear. Yeah, but that's not really all that much different from like the black cat from. Rich. I mean, it's a baby owl bear. That's that's pretty good. But no, yeah, I'm the type of person who kills Grits in uh, Baldur's Gate One. Yeah, you're you're a monster. You're you're a. For, despite your opposition to cheese curds, you certainly are a cheesemonger. I mean, Dritz is right there, and, you know, the game, he, he has a life bar. He's very hard to kill, I will say that. Is he in your party? No, Dritz does not join your party. He's very mad when you see him. Uh, yeah, when he runs into you in Baldur's Gate 2 and you steal all his shit, he's like, hey, asshole. I'm oh, he's even, angry. he's even angrier if you killed him. Yeah. I can imagine. That sure is a sentence. He says, hey, I'm Dritz. Oh, get up. Kill me. Get up. You can't kill me. All right, that's going to do it for today. I got to right, call it. Thanks, everyone. Have a good night, y'all. Thirteen thousand dollars. We want to thank everybody for donating. We want to thank everyone yep. who tuned in. Um, I'm sorry, I did not defeat chaos. Event. Uh, yep. Hey, you know. Have a good night. Thank oh, you, everyone. Let me let me switch the, the cameras. Final total. Final I think total the site's actually is... under maintenance. <laughs> well, thanks, everyone. Is the page literally undergoing temporary maintenance? The minute yes. we check. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Temporary maintenance. I tried to look a couple of seconds ago and it was like maintenance. No, Good night. I need to I need to know which one of you wins this stupid bet. I, think I, I did. Not not really. I have I have two hundred dollars that are coming in. Put them in before uh -huh. you use the event. No, my dad's doing it. It's not. The Your site dad is should down. have done it.
literally. The site is down. My grandparents gave him uh -huh. cash money. They're, they don't have internet. Your parents don't have internet? My grandparents don't. Oh. Okay, so I... It is... I know I have at least yeah. one to two hundred dollars in transit that is in cash right now, so. Okay. All right. Uh, well, thank you, everyone. Thank right, you, everyone who participated. Two hundred dollars to ZP's page, then. Come Good on. Night, everybody. Good night. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>